All right, everybody. How's it going? Sorry I'm a bit late. Uh, my computer exploded again. So, you know, we're here. That's what matters, right? Well, today uh, on this April 1st, uh, we are going to be playing one of my favorite games. I know you guys were probably expecting some fortune cookie and stuff, but the fortune cookie, uh, you know, system just isn't working today. So we're just going to try and wing it. So um, uh, let, should we get into it right away? Should we not just waste any time and just get right into the game? Uh, all right. So. Uh, as you can see, we are in fact playing my favorite game, Superman 64. Now, did you guys know in short time, that fate will in, be uh, Superman. Eric Kane, who's the French developer of Titus Interactive, he was the one that actually bought the rights for the game, uh, from then there's no WB time to waste. Licensing. Oh, Luther, if you want to save your friends, solve my maze. What a glorious game this is, and all of you know that I absolutely love this game with every fiber of my being. Uh, now, did you guys know that this game was in fact based on the animated series of Superman, and that the development lasted two years for it? Um, initially, they were gonna go for a style of gameplay uh, that only Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider uh, from 1996 had tried before, a 3D open world action adventure game. Uh, but as you can see, they added this wonderful and glorious section of flying through the rings, which I know you know we all love. Oh! So, that, guys, that was so much fun. But I think right now we just need to quickly uh, go to an intermission. All right, let's just quickly switch up to our intermission. Give me one sec. My intermission screen is broken, as you can see. It's all right. It... Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. All right. I'll be right back. Hey there. We're having a sale. See you later. All right, I'm back. Thank you guys for waiting. So, uh, you guys guessed it. It's art time. But we're going to do something a little bit different today. So, normally we go to the bar. Bagel! Bagel! You can't go outside. We're going to do something different today. Uh, the Baru, unfortunately, the server went down. Uh, so, instead of looking at the art that you guys gave me, I went ahead and made something for you guys. And what else could I do? Except draw the lovely Rosa John. So, are you all ready to see my go. interpretation? This that ain't no sad. go. Move. All right. What do you guys think? I worked really hard on this. Uh, as you can see, it is in fact Rosa John, and she's looking lovely today. Now, as some of you know, Easter's coming up. It's just next week, in fact. And so, you know what? I wanted to also. Do a drawing of her in her best Easter dress, chat. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Look at her! In her best Easter dress. Rosa John. Looking fantastic. I hope you like that, chat. All right, so that uh, concludes the art block for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We're going to go back to a, a quick intermission here in just a moment. Um, I wanted to thank you guys again for joining me today on this April 1st, uh, and I'm Tom. Tom, what are you doing in my house? I fucking knew it. I fucking knew I was going to forget to unmute. I fucking knew I was going to forget to unmute.
Hi, John. You just missed John. Well, there you go. Should have known. Uh, I worry about my friends sometimes. Thank you, Chatia, for being so willing to do that intro for the stream. I thought that would have just been really funny to do. I'm so glad she was down for it. Uh, she kind of... <laughs> she had no direction. She just went rampant on it, and I think she did a great job with it. Uh, although I did, I did poke fun at her a little bit, because I said, like, I don't know where everyone in this group keeps finding these damn wigs they use to, for me. Because every time someone in the group has to parody me, they just get the blondest wig they can find. So, I don't know where they're all getting these super blonde ass wigs thinking it's gonna look like me, but they clearly, they clearly think I got a specific color of hair. Remember when it was supposed to be 30 minutes? Oh yeah, well originally she was gonna be live. I was just gonna stream her feed. But, um, no, I, it was so late I wasn't sure she was gonna be able to do it, so she just pre-recorded something for me. Clearly they asked for a blonde wig and didn't specify further. Apparently. This is how you learn that everyone in TRG is colorblind. <laughs> <coughs> it's uh, probably because we draw Rosa with super blonde hair most of the time. I mean, to be f in, in Massey's case, that predated Rosa. That was from 2018, so that's, that predated Rosa and Pon Pon. But, um... I was having this discussion with Mal the other day too about what color my hair is, and she's like, "You got you got very blonde hair." I'm like, "No, I don't. <laughs> my hair is weird. Depending on the light, and I showed her pictures to prove this. My hair is three different colors depending on the light. It is either brown, dirty blonde, or like a light blonde, uh, or red. It just depends on the lighting I'm in. So I just I just call myself brown or dirty blonde." So even your hair is glitched. Here, let me see if I can find... This was... God, why don't I even talk to Mal about this? Uh, let me see if I can find the pictures I sent her. I sent them at some point, but fuck if I remember when. show you. I'll show you what I'm talking about here. So I wrote her, I said, uh, my hair color depends <clears throat> on the light. More blonde in natural light and more brown or red in indoor lighting and way more red in office lighting. So I sent her these two pictures. So this was me in outdoor lighting and then this is, this is my hair in like house lighting. So you can see more tinge of brown and red in it. It's not like fiery red, but there's definitely more red in one lighting than there is in the other. So, so my hair is so fair that it just does that. So I just say dirty blonde. Yes, yeah, it's, it's never light. It's never like the bright blonde. It's definitely. It's definitely not. It's. It's definitely not this. <laughs> Yeah, that's banana. I'm not banana blonde. Mistakes is still closer than Chatia's though. I mean, okay. Mm -hmm. To be fair, uh, Chatia said like she just ordered it off of Amazon. She just ordered a blonde wig off of Amazon. It's like, all right, perfect. It works for the bit. All right, so let's get to the actual thing we're doing tonight, shall we? So tonight is a perfectly normal shuffler stream because uh, I have no fucking clue what to expect. I literally don't. 
This is this is the insane thing. I for some reason thought it was a wise decision to let the entire mod team build a shuffler for me. And once Maniacal knows that I'm giving him the cue, he can unmute. He can uh, he can explain what's going on tonight. Hi. Hi. Yeah. So uh, as you said, this is a shuffler done from the mod team and CoCom. It's got like Trey and uh, Laughing Boy in here as well. Uh, so there's like. 24 games in here. Uh, it's, it's a lot. <laughs> I, I'm excited, personally. <laughs> and I have no clue what any of these games are. I had to test the controls for one, and it was all I saw was Sonic showed up. That's all I know. So there, there Sonic is involved may... in some way, shape, or form at some point. There, there may be a Sonic somewhere in here. Which is funny because, like, you know, Easter is coming up and, like, Easter is when Jesus came back and, like, Sonic died recently. So, no way we kind of brought, like, Sonic back like Jesus. Part of me wishes it actually was a normal cookie stream tonight because I really wanted to play that Sonic uh, murder mystery game. Dude, I need to, like, try that one out myself. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Coco feed, by the way, if that's oh, okay to ask. There you go. Got it on there now for you. Uh, All right, cool. I'll bring it up here. What did someone write down? That was just the perfect way of summing up tonight. Ah, oh, now I can't even find it now. Yeah, but the best way to put it is the April Fool's joke is tonight that is on me. I am the April Fool today. So uh, you, you are the fool, and it yeah. is April. There is the the actual joke, the actual stream joke was uh, Erica running the stream for a bit there, but the actual j joke overall of the stream is on me. Mm -hmm. So I am indeed the fool. Start Monday with that Sonic game. I might. It's looking like Monday is probably just going to be another, like, just whatever day, simply because uh, we've got a sponsorship on Monday, for, uh, a dare drop for mm -hmm. an hour, and I didn't want to do game clearing on that, which means game clearing gets bumped again. But Let's go. Uh, yeah, it'll happen. We'll probably start game clearing with a lightning round at this point. Yeah. I petitioned right, so... that we have to play the Sonic Murder Mystery on Monday. I mean, I'm cool with starting the stream with that. You could. It's like a okay. few hours long. Standing. Let's see here. So I have the settings I have for this shuffler are random seed. I randomized my seed a bunch. Uh, min mm -hmm. max swap time is thirty seconds minimum, uh, three minutes maximum. Correct. So we could be on these games for a while. We could be yes. Uh, and apparently each game has a specific goal I can reach to clear it out of the shuffler. Because there's no way in hell we'd be clearing the majority of the games otherwise, I've been told. There's, like, maybe, like, one game you could maybe beat. Maybe, like, a, there's, like, a couple you could maybe beat. I mean, there's, there's a couple challenges. I will say that the goals are to beat them, just because I find that they may be short enough to do so. But, yeah. You know, it depends on the game, of course. Yeah, Mads even says you could totally beat mine theoretically. Good luck, though. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Is the Mario stream the only shuffler you've beaten? Yeah. I mean, on stream, sure. Yeah, I think it's the only one we actually finished. Cole says, you could be mine. Well, I appreciate it, but it's not Valentine's Day, Cole, but thank you, though. I think it's taken as well, as I checked. <laughs> also, also that. Not that one without saying. I mean, yeah. Gex says, you can easily beat mine. Oh, my God. Yeah, you can totally beat everyone's. Me and Gamer Mooney left WrestleMania for that video. She agreed it was worth it. Wow. I don't know if that's if that's high praise or if that's a low bar for WrestleMania. I can't tell which. All right. Let's turn it on and see what I'm going to experience. Let's do it. All right. Here we go. 24 games, and I don't know a single one of them. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is dance. <laughs> I can tell this already. So, this is... Let's double check who this was right here. Yeah, so this is uh, Ryan's, actually. Oh, it's not Dan's. I'm actually genuinely shocked. Yeah, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. So, for Ryan's goal, I just uh, want you to just go, go see a concert. You gotta clear an area, get a concert. Right, so I guess I have most to beat a stage. Yeah. Which, I can see, that took like a little bit to like, you know, be a stage. Ideally. Are the games too loud? Oh, I can turn it down. That's not a big deal. It should be my normal... 
volume settings. It is not. Nope, there we go. That's usually where it is. <coughs> Better be excellent to everyone. Don't make them mad. Prime, thank you for the raid. So basically, I'm very stuck. I'm sorry that you're very stuck. Very Don't stuck. worry, we're very screwed too, if that makes you feel better. Here, I'll pause, I'll pause the shuffler so we can run counter okay. just for Prime. All right. People are saying I'm loud, apparently. You're loud? Man, I haven't fucked with my volume settings. I don't know what's going on here. Yeah, I'm like, am I loud? Uh, I get, or I bumped you down here. Okay. My my mic might be quieter because I think I struck something the other day. Oh, gotcha. That may be what it is. I'll just adjust volume settings. It's not that hard. People are saying I do sound fine, Bo. Okay. Let's run countermeasures then. Diamond Crew, thank you so much for the raid. It's happy April 1st, everybody. Here's what you missed if you weren't here at the start. All right, everybody. How's it going? Sorry I'm a bit late. Uh, my computer exploded again. So, you know, we're here. That's what matters, right? Well, today, uh, on this April 1st, uh, we are going to be playing one of my favorite games. I know you guys were probably expecting some fortune cookie and stuff, but the fortune cookie, uh, you know, system just isn't working today. So, we're just gonna try and wing it! So, um, uh, let, should we get into it right away? Should we not just waste any time and just get right into the game? Uh, alright, so... Uh, as you can see, we are in fact playing my favorite game, Superman 64. Now, did you guys know in short time, that your fate will in, be sealed, uh, Superman. Eric Kane, who is the French developer of Titus Interactive, he was the one that actually garnered the rights for the game uh, then from there's no WB time to waste. licensing. Oh, Luther, if you want to save your friends, solve my maze. What a glorious game this is, and all of you know that I absolutely love this game with every fiber of my being. Uh, now, did you guys know that this game was in fact based on the animated series of Superman, and that the development lasted two years for it? Uh, initially, they were gonna go for a style of gameplay uh, that only Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider uh, from 1996 had tried before, a 3D open world action adventure game. Uh, but as you can see, they added this wonderful and glorious section of flying through the rings, which I know you know we all love. Oh! So, that, guys, that was so much fun. But I think right now we just need to quickly uh, go to an intermission. All right, let's just quickly switch up to our intermission. Give me one sec, my intermission screen is broken, as you can see. It's all right, it, oh, come on, come on. There we go, all right, I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. Thank you guys for waiting. So, uh, you guys guessed it. It's art time. But we're going to do something a little bit different today. So normally we go to the bar. Bagel! Bagel! You can't go outside. We're going to do something different today. Uh, the Baru, unfortunately, the server went down. Uh, so instead of looking at the art that you guys gave me, I went ahead and made something for you guys. And what else could I do except draw the lovely Rosa John? So are you all ready to see my interpretation of Rosa John? This is for you, chat. This is for you. All right! What do you guys think? I worked really hard on this. Uh, as you can see, it is, in fact, Rosa John. And she's looking lovely today. Now, as some of you know, Easter's coming up. It's just next week, in fact. And so you know what? I wanted to also do a drawing of her in her best Easter dress, chat. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Look at her! In her best Easter dress. Rosa John. Looking fantastic. I hope you like that, chat. All right, so that uh, concludes the art block for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We're going to go back to a, a quick intermission here in just a moment. Um, I wanted to thank you guys again for joining me today on this April 1st. Uh, and... I'm Tom. Tom? What are you doing in my house? I worry about my friends sometimes. I remember this time. Uh, yep. That was how we started the stream. All right, I gotta know how long were you laughing when you got this? Oh, I was laughing a bunch. I more so poked fun at the at the wig more than anything, because I I showed Chatia the same wig that Masay used when she had to dress up as me for a panel back in 2018. I just found it funny that everyone kept picking the blondest wigs possible they could do they could get for me. It's quite fitting, I'd say, right? Yeah. All right. Uh, so before we hop into the actual shuffler for real. Let's get that Wisma Duke in that was supposed to be done at the very beginning. Duke, bless, bless this beautiful stream. Let's bless this mess. Sorry, what were you going to say, Michael? I was going to say, I almost wish you kind of like incorporated Duke into like the Chazi a bit. I mean, so like, I didn't give her a script. She winged that. True, true, That's true. why she kept saying Baru instead of Buru, because she was thinking of the streamer. All right, Cody Chaotic, this Wisma Duke's for you. You want to dance? Let's dance. <laughs> All right. So what we're actually doing tonight, if you guys came in late, is we're doing a shuffler, a perfectly normal shuffler, where I let the entire mod team pick games for a shuffler. The mod team's in a couple of co-coms. I have, was it 24 games or 26? 24. 22 from us and like two from like one from Trey, one from Laughing Boy. All right. So yeah, I've got 24 games here. I don't know any of them except for the one that's currently on screen, which is uh, Bill and Ted's video game adventure for the NES. Which is Ryan's. Yep. But I don't know any of the others. So we're going to just see how well we can get through tonight, I guess. Let's we'll see if we can beat something. I can't believe you're not reading out the dialogue here. What? I said I can't believe you're not reading out the dialogue. Well, I knew we didn't have time. Oh, who the fuck, Gex, did you do this? Ah, uh, yes. So welcome to Super Mario Brothers Frustration. Yeah, this is Dragon Fire's I, choice. I, I, this was drag. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <sighs> so for those who don't know Super Mario Frustration, this was basically the Mario 1 equivalent of Kaizo Mario. <laughs> It, around the same time that the Kaizo video got famous on YouTube, well, this video also got famous about a just, a just as painful Mario 1 ROM hack. The video of the guy talking over it was actually talking over pre-recorded footage from Nico Nico Duga, but most people don't care about that because that's just how the internet works. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, yeah, that was a video that just was about as popular around the same time as uh, the original Kaizo video was. Mm -hmm. Go for this one just to beat it. Please yeah. Your best to do so. Yeah. <laughs> I 
Mario and this is this like, is Dragon Fire's Beyond. I don't even like Mario One physics as it is. I don't know why. I know. I know. I know this was just to troll me, but I'm just like, oh, great. Yeah, ROM hacks are very much fair game tonight. Mm hmm. I don't know if anyone actually took any any pity on me at all. Someone must uh, have. There's a, there's a few in there, but for like pity. It's a good thing I know that you can actually like jump at the beginning of like, when this loads in. Otherwise, this would actually be impossible. Mm hmm. I need to watch that YouTube video actually. I've heard like I've been hearing people talk about that one recently. Dragonfire like literally showed me like the video. I really, really linked it to me. I, I I I haven't watched it yet. It's like half an hour long. <laughs> I just realized I'm doing this without save states. It's gonna blow chunks. Ugh. I can't wait for the other games. Tomorrow says, I most definitely did not take pity. I heard the prompt and could only think of one game that fit to me. Oh, God. I would say, I think this might be the hardest game. I would fucking here. hope so! I think. There we go. Nice. I don't remember the order of operations for this, by the way. I've never played this before, and it's been... When I last I saw that video, Kaizo was still fresh in my mind, so... So I know that block I'm supposed to hit to actually make any progress. Mm -hmm. Tom ate the eggplant tonight. How was your day so far? The Fellowship of the Ring? Yes, Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring. This was Crimson's choice. Interesting choice, Crimson. Uh, go for this one. Uh, see the cutscene with the Black Knight. Pig. Pig on a stick. Pig on a spit. This is GBA, yes. Uh, shuffles are 30 seconds to 3 minutes. Dude, I can't believe we just cooked up LeChonk there. Poor LeChonk, he will be missed. Oh my god, these pictures! They're so ugly, dude. <laughs> 71st birthday! This is the end. I am going. I wish there was I a mean, shuffle right then and there. I was so hopeful. It would have been so I funny. almost want to just sit on the screen and wait for the shuffle, but it's going to take too long. I am leaving now. <laughs> 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 All right, we'll get on with it then. Go and leave. Goodbye. It really is going to be the whole three. There it is. Finally. I knew I stalled long <laughs> enough. I knew I stalled long enough. Oh, uh, who's this, this? I wonder. All right, Sega. That doesn't narrow it down enough. Oh, oh God! I just read the title bar. Ugh. Who picked this one? Sonic the Hedgehog Genesis, picked by Cole. Uh, Am I doing original well, anniversary? Point. Gonna get you. Got to get two and beat Spring Yard Zone Act Three. Original or anniversary. Uh, let's do anniversary just just for fun, just for fun's sake. Why not? Give you a spin dash. Let's be nice. Wait, did I miss that still? No, I think you got it. Oh, I got the enemy. I guess that's the springboard. But that was the, the invincibility. That's the one I was thinking of. There it is. There you go. I love. You, you thought this was the last time you'd see this game on stream? No. <laughs> I knew it wasn't going to be the last time I saw this game on stream. I was just hoping it would be a while until I saw this game again on stream. Mm hmm. Good times I raced a while back. I remember I accidentally made people suffer over an hour and a half of it rather than an hour. Oopsie. Yes. <laughs> Why do my eyes hurt? Why does my everything hurt? Call a doctor today. Want to do the rematch of this game? Do you want to rematch that that badly, Dalton? All right. Who the fuck? <laughs> I refuse to believe Dan would go this low. 
This was Tomoyo's. Oh, god damn it, Tomoyo. <laughs> I laughed when Tomoyo sent me this. I said I did not have mercy. You fucking didn't. You're right. Uh, you're being like level 15. I'll be nice. Jesus. Be 25. I was gonna be level like 25. Like, no, I'll be nice and say 15. I just want to point out, I didn't submit this solely because I wanted this joke to fucking die, and Tomoyo just kind of spit in my face with his suggestion. God damn it, Tomoyo. All right, well, don't worry, it's gone for now because I have Star Trek: The Next Generation Futures Past for the Super Nintendo. This is Bubba's. I'm not surprised. Here's an awkward close-up of Jean-Luc Picard. Captain Jean-Luc Picard, USS, USS Enterprise. Enterprise. Scroll that text over his face. Let him not read it. All right, for this one, goal, uh, rescue the crew of the unknown, or rather the unnamed, oh yeah, yeah, unknown damaged spacecraft. That's what Bubba wanted, and yeah, that's what we'd be doing. Riker's not doing the Riker maneuver. This game sucks. This game is also, is also really fucking quiet for some reason. Yeah, I don't know what's up with that. Oh, I already missed where she said she was. Shit. <laughs> uh, was it Corax? I think it was Alpha 6, I want to say. Well, oh, CODIS. CODIS. Oops, yeah, this one's a fun one. Oops, I think I... No, I don't know. We're good. We're good. Press the right, right button. Oh, Amber Free. Oh, who picked... Oh, this is Popsky. <laughs> Really? How could you tell? Because it's Killer Instinct. Yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> At least I'll get one of them right tonight, I guess. Uh, go for this one. From I'm seeing here is just beat it. Beat it. Oh my God. Your best beat all the fights. Pick your character. Cinder. Cinder. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We we'll have nine fights. Oh, I should have picked Glacius, not Cinder. Shit. That's yeah, kind of hard to tell. It's fine. All right, who the fuck? <laughs> this Sonic Joker. Sonic Jam Six. This is picked by He's Evil Genius. Oh no, that's another fair person to pick this. Uh, uh go for this one. Try to beat it, but if you can't beat it, like with like warps and such, maybe just try and beat five four. It's a lot of Mario in this uh, There's shuffler. a lot of well, Mario in quotation marks. <laughs> Them quotes doing some heavy fucking lifting. I love the way the Goomba dies. And this is why I called it a perfectly normal shuffler, because I knew there would be a lot of suffering tonight. Guys, can we for the Mario movie? This is it kind of wild that's actually out in like a week, give or take? Not even, it's like Wednesday, isn't it? The fifth? Yeah. Yeah, you beat a level, nice. He's even going properly. <laughs> <laughs> I see him running behind the castle too. Nice Oops. Da -da 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 -da. Akari Warriors. All right, this is actually something I would have guessed for uh, for Tom. This is actually Laughing Boys. Really? Yeah. Huh. All right. He actually was the only one to repeat a uh, suggestion for a game that we've not seen yet. I actually had to ask him for another one. Uh, go for this one just to be the first two areas. Look at them dance when they die! Oh my god, the, oh, yeah. the music is so loud in this one. I <laughs> compare that to, like, Star Trek. <laughs> oh, this tank will not stop firing at me. There we go. 
But what a rude tank. I hate, I hate when tanks don't stop shooting at me. I love how drunk a bunch of these soldiers look when they just kind of wobble. <laughs> They're like walking in circles. Ah! Ralph, uh, no! Not Ralph. Ralph, no! Kari Warriors is not an easy game. I could use the ABBA cheat, but... What's the ABBA cheat do? Uh, I literally lets you continue from where you died. Uh... But it, it only works up to stage four? I think the final stage you actually can't use it on. So you have to beat the game legit. Like, there's an ABGN episode about it. Mm hmm I mean, if you want to use it, I'd say why not, right? It helps you beat it. That way, like, because otherwise, like, if you're not going to use it, we can just do, like, just stage one, just to make it a bit more fair. So I was right that I knew Juker would pick a hack. <laughs> yes. I should have known it was going to be Donkey Kong 5, The Journey of Overtime and Space. Correct. So it's time for DK. So I have two Mario... three Mario 1 hacks. Of the text, dude. <laughs> oh, there he is. The flower bloomed no longer, and the tree blasted slowly. The banana and the wild fruit the Donkey Kong loved had been lacked too. The world became desolate at once. There were no anything to eat. Donkey Kong felt very hungry, and the famine made him thinner and thinner. Finally, he became a monkey. Finally. What the fuck is this one? I think this is Trey's. Which? Oh, no. What? This is Camille's, actually. Okay, I had a feeling because yeah. it says Europe ROM. That was my guess, but I because I don't recognize this. Is this Winx Club? No, this is Witch. This is a separate series. I've never heard of this. Uh, it was about like these fairies all had elements to them. You all like use the different elements. It's pretty cool. Uh, go after this one just to beat five stages. Who picked Friday the 13th? <laughs> <laughs> this is Ailita's. What? <laughs> uh, go for this one. Uh, I wrote it down just basically. Get the message, watch out, Jason's still alive and stronger than before. So, so just try and knock it, out know. Jason okay. once is what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, why not? Oh, God. I, I used to watch LNR play through this. I used to remember an actual method for this, but I don't think I fully do now. Uh, let's, start with, let's start with Laura. Laura. Use the torch to light the fireplaces. Play a bit of this one out of curiosity. This one's, uh, this one's a thing. <laughs> So this, so this one's actually, like, if you know what to do in the game, it's not that bad. You can beat it actually pretty fast, like under an hour. Problem mm -hmm. is, you have to keep fucking dealing with Jason, murdering children and camp counselors. So hang on, I gotta... Uh, who's the closest? I guess there's, I can just play as Chrissy. Now Chrissy has to fight Jason. Mm -hmm. I do not remember how to fight and do the boxing matches with Jason. Jason! Are you ready? Jason! Jason. Oh, there he's outside. I don't hate that. Yeah, those are actually the worst to deal with. All right, so I have the deal. I have to kill enough zombies. To oh my god, Jay. Oh, because he's running around. So Jason has like two pass he takes around the entire camp or something like that. He's got an actual mm -hmm. like it depends on. There's two rotations he can go through. And if I'm not careful, he's gonna keep meeting me on this path, and I'm gonna keep fighting him as Chrissy with just throwing rocks at him. 
But I need to kill... Okay, I got a lighter. That's good. Oh, he's actually going for another counselor just directly ahead of me. You're alright, Paul. Don't worry. Paul. I'm out, Paul. I think I actually do have to fight Jason. Though. Yeah, I actually do have to fight Jason. Uh, alright, Jason. You're in here somewhere. Just in the same house? Dang. There he is. I don't know how to dodge, so... I think it's oh, A. No. I think it's A. Who was in there? That was Paul was in there. Yeah, Paul, you should probably... Yeah. Oh, alright. Let, let me leave. Okay. Yeah, he's gone. <laughs> Paul's just in the other room, just like, yeah, whatever. I love brown screens, my favorite video game. Uh-oh. This says Dan. So I'm going to assume brown screen has broken. Oh no, did I not switch them around? Oh shit. Uh I shit. love brown screen. Boop, 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 boop. I love brown screen. What do we do? Dan's, Dan's might be broken. Oh, fuck, that's on me. You said you had a fixed uh, version, though. Well, no, I had to. I, did, I had to get a different game because I just realized I did not. I did not swap them out on the fire. I sent you shit. Uh, is it a ROM hack or is it a regular game? Because if it's a regular game, it I might have one to swap in there. Uh, it is a regular game. Let me hang on a moment. I think I could just swap the games. Yeah, give me a I, moment. Let me I have a library it. of. If it's an official release, I have a library of NES ROMs. Want well, to just tell you what it is then? Yeah, let me just pause the shuffler so we don't lose our progress here. Okay. Uh, uh you're loading. All right, so this. So, I mean, you're gonna see Dan's anyways. You're loading in Deadly Towers. God, why? Oh. All right. I definitely know I have that. I did it for Custo Grande. All right, good. We could we could fix this. All right. Uh, make sure you rename it Dan, by the way. Yeah, I know. I gotta, I gotta replace the old ROM. I actually gotta wait for the next swap to do that. So, yeah. D E A. So this was supposed to be Dragon Power, but it broke. I mean, I also have Dragon Power. I could have put that in too. Which would you rather? Um, I was like, if you have a working Dragon Power, we could just do that. I'll leave that to Dan's choice on that one, but since it was his. Yeah, I've moved both into the folder just in case. Yeah. Dan, which one would you rather? Keep Deadly Keep Towers. Towers. Okay, let's do that one then. Ay, ay, ay. All right. So I have to wait for the next game swap before I can do anything with this. Yeah. But the second that swaps, don't remind me to pause. Are we starting Future Connected this week? I don't think so. Uh... Wednesday is already claimed. We're going to do a cookie jar because we're overdue for it. Just a bit, yeah. Yeah. Monday is going to be a whatever day because we're doing sponsored on Monday. Tuesday is disc only. Wednesday is going to be cookie jar. And Saturday is fortune cookie. Okay. Cool, cool. Oh. God. Okay, there we go. Swap. Radical Rex. I'm going to guess that's yeah, Gex. Yeah. How could you tell? Because he's the <laughs> only one I know who knows what this fucking game is. All right, so yeah, I, I apologize on the like the mess up with Dan there. That that's on me for not double checking that one. Well, hopefully this should work now. So Deadly Tower should to Dan dot NES. Delete the old Dan. Bring in the new Dan. <laughs> Delete the old Dan. The old Dan has been deleted. All hail the new Dan. All right. Unpause and let's play Radical Rex. All right. Shall play work, right? Zip! Zip! So! Radical! Radical! All right, so the objective I wrote down for this one was to, like, beat the water stage. I'm sorry, the uh, the bone graveyard level. But specifically, I want you to, like, fight, like, a wizard in there. I feel like that should be enough time. Fight a wizard. Okay. All right. Yeah, there's, there's a wizard in like the fucking like there's like a wizard boss in the bone graveyard level. So is this like a cartoon or something? Like, who picked the Jungle Book? Ah, <laughs> uh, this was Trey's. Uh, let's go for this one. Uh, beat the fourth stage of the Tree Village. All right. Well, luckily I beat this game as a kid. 
Unfortunately, I don't know if I remember how I beat this game as a kid. I'm so strange with the story of a small boy named Mowgli. Yo, did you ever watch like the live action Jungle Book from like a years like a few years back? Oh, I watched like the old old live action one. Mhm. Mm like the like 2000s one. Right. Yeah, like there was like a more recent like live action one and like it was actually not too bad. I saw it with my mother. Uh, the voice cast was actually really good. <laughs> That's some crazy ass like choices in there. Like, oh god, let me like look up like who exactly was in that movie. So, yeah, you say, Jungle Book 2016. Would you say this is harder or easier than The Lion King? I mean, I remember I, be, I think I beat this one faster than I beat The Lion King, so I'd say this one's easier. But I remember the platforming also being a little interesting, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had like, let's see here Idris Elba, Sher Khan, Bill Murray's Baloo, Scarlett Johansson's Ka, Christopher Walken as King Louie, and Ben Kingsley is back. Kira. Fate of the Galaxy is in your hands! Great! Awesome. Fantastic. Oh god, do I even remember how to fuck to play this? Well, apparently I do. Much to my chagrin. Can't believe it's back. It never truly leaves, honestly. You never, you never escape Warp 3D. Oh, I fucked up with that one. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, this was Tomoyo's choice. Oh, I hear that drum roll. Level up, FC! Thank you for the raid! I gotta run countermeasures for them. I gotta I got do it for them, because they did us a solid yesterday. So, for those who didn't see, yesterday we played over at Level Up FC's channel, because I assume they finished their inaugural round of Mario Party 7 for their current season of Mario Party. Yes, it looks like they did. Uh, we played a show match yesterday for charity, uh, and we ended up earning $1,000 US for our charity of choice, Skipping Stone, the local trans charity here in Calgary. So... Woo. Fuck yeah, trans rights baby. And on trans day of visibility nonetheless too. So that was a good day for that. But let's Hell go yeah. and uh, let's go run some countermeasures for him, shall we? Let's do it. Level Up FC, thank you so much for the raid, and again, for the money donated towards uh, Skipping Stone. Also, Montaru, thank you for the raid as well. Your game hasn't come up yet, so I'm not mad at you yet. <laughs> I assume, I'm... I assume he's got a game in there. Ah, uh, Montaru was actually one of the ones who didn't submit anything. Oh, never mind, then, then you, peace be with you, Montaru, peace be with you. If you guys are coming in here now, uh... We're doing a perfectly normal shuffler stream where my mod team and some of my CoCom friends all picked terrible games for me. <laughs> terrible games. Mm-hmm. 
Tom, oh, Tom. I A, two things. Tom, first off, I heard about your video stream you did today. How did that go? Eggplant. Uh, how was eating an eggplant? And secondly, I'm going to do it again because, uh, Tom, I don't think you saw what we actually did for the start of our April Fool's stream. So we're going to show it a third time here now in the hour. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Fuck yeah, let's go, baby. Stalling the pain. Oh. Stalling the pain. All right, everybody. How's it going? Sorry I'm a bit late. Uh, my computer exploded again. So, you know, we're here. That's what matters, right? Well, today uh, on this April 1st, uh, we are going to be playing one of my favorite games. I know you guys were probably expecting some fortune cookie and stuff, but the fortune cookie, uh, you know, system just isn't working today. So, we're just going to try and wing it. So, um, uh, let, should we get into it right away? Should we not just waste any time and just get right into the game? Uh, all right. So, uh, as you can see, we are, in fact, playing my favorite game, Superman 64. Now, did you guys know in short time, that your fate will in, be sealed, uh, Superman. Eric Kane, who is the French developer of Titus Interactive, he was the one that actually garnered the rights for the game. Uh, then from there's no WB time to waste. Licensing. Oh, Luther, if you want to save your friends, solve my maze. What a glorious game this is. And all of you know that I absolutely love this game with every fiber of my being. Uh, now, did you guys know that this game was in fact based on the animated series of Superman? And that the development lasted two years for it. Um, uh, initially, they were gonna go for a style of gameplay, uh, that only Tomb Raider, uh, from 1996 had tried before, a 3D open-world action adventure game. Uh, but as you can see, they added this wonderful and glorious section of flying through the rings, which I know, you know, we all love. Oh! So, that, guys, that was so much fun. But I think right now we just need to quickly uh, go to an intermission. All right, let's just quickly switch up to our intermission. Give me one sec. My intermission screen is broken, as you can see. It's all right. It. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. All right. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Thank you guys for waiting. So, uh, you guys guessed it. It's art time. But we're going to do something a little bit different today. So, normally we go to the bar. Bagel! Bagel! You can't go outside. We're going to do something different today. Uh, the Baru, unfortunately, the server went down. Uh, so, instead of looking at the art that you guys gave me, I went ahead and made something for you guys. And what else could I do? except draw the lovely Rosa John. So are you all ready to see my interpretation of Rosa John? This is for you, chat. This is for you. All right! What do you guys think? I worked really hard on this. Uh, as you can see, it is in fact Rosa John, and she's looking lovely today. Now, as some of you know, Easter's coming up. It's just next week, in fact. And so you know what? I wanted to also do a drawing of her in her best Easter dress, chat. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Look at her! In her best Easter dress. Rosa John, looking fantastic. I hope you like that, chat. All right, so that uh, concludes the art block for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We're gonna go back to a, a quick intermission here in just a moment. Um, I wanted to thank you guys again for joining me today on this April 1st, uh, and I'm Tom. Tom, what are you doing in my house? Every time. All right. 
Let's get back to the shuffler, shall we? Let's go. Heroin Mari as well, thank you for the raid. I'm gonna just run the... Robocop turned himself into the authorities. He's currently serving a life sentence inside John's computer. Alright, so we are doing a perfectly normal shuffler stream where we have 24 games given to me by the mod team and some of the COCOM buds as well. And they have all been bangers. <laughs> Such as Orb 3D. Everyone knows my favorite. Of course, yes. <sighs> Bangers. And oh, sorry, hindsight minus slow. tame. Yeah, Cole, yours by by proxy is pretty pretty tame by comparison. I'm more than okay with that. Ah, shit. I wonder if I should notice it like 10 levels instead of 15, just for the sake of time, but we also have like quite a while to go. Hmm. We'll see. Yeah. Be right, because this game this game has like a gas meter to it, I forgot about that. Yeah. Keep these two in play, this actually both should be cleared quick. But the problem is, timing it, there's a delay on when you can actually make the move again. Mm -hmm. Which is what complicates this so much. Got it. Nice. That's one level down, there you go. By bangers, do you mean you want to bang your head against the wall? Yes. <laughs> yes, I do. Exactly what I mean. Ah, oh, speaking of banging my head against the wall. He's back. Mario frustration. Those I didn't see, this one was a dragon fire choice. Out of the fire and into the oven. <laughs> oh my god. I have to press jump right as it's switching over to the screen. As it's transitioning, you have to press it, and it is not as forgiving as you think at times. Did everyone just pick the most cursed shit? Oh, everyone! There's a lot of cursed shit in this so far. Bubba's might be the most tame, and I think it's just gonna be because by the proxy being the most boring option. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no, no, because I've, I've played... I've watched, like, my... One of my girlfriends in the past play it, and it's just like, mm -hmm. it's just dry. Especially when you're comparing it to, like, all these hacks. Mm -hmm. John, you gotta get to the first Goomba, it's 1-1. One, one. I'm trying, Dalton, I'm trying! Which one was Bubba's? It was a Star Trek game. It was the Next Generation game. Yeah. Next Generation, Future Past. Oh yeah, Jungle Book is not terrible. It is known for being a little tricky, but I wouldn't say it's a terrible game. Although, depending on who you ask, they might say that. Oh god, where was that block? Oh, it's that far. I can't use that to clear that. I have just avoid it. John, apologize above it. No. <laughs> he apologized to me. Why am I apologizing to you? I don't know. I just want to. I just want you to say you're sorry to me. <laughs> <laughs> Can I apologize to Bubba for having to apologize to you? Yeah. Okay. Bubba, I'm sorry that I have to apologize to Maniacal. See, there we go. The world the world is now right. <laughs> you, you know what, Dalton? Apology accepted. I have two coins so far. You're doing great. Nice. More than a decade ago on YouTube, in fact, the guy playing the game Rage Quit. So here's the thing. We talked about this earlier. This video came out around the same time that the... Uh, that my Kaizo video came out. Uh, the video that got famous for this, the guy's not even playing it. He's literally dubbing a, a video from Nico Nico Duga. No so progress. it was just some guy dubbed over the footage that was on Nico Nico and put it on YouTube. That's interesting, actually. And of course, because most people wouldn't have that kind of information, they don't know that, so. 
And based on how many people are saying I didn't know that, yeah, no, that's... Yeah, that video was just a dub over. Alright. Oh, right, because Jason's not here. Uh... <laughs> yeah, that's a fun part. I gotta remember where Jason is every time it goes back. <laughs> You've still only seen maybe like like a fourth of the games. Yeah, sometimes that's just how the shuffle will work. Mm-hmm. There's something I'm really excited to like see. Okay, later for you. Uh which buildings have the campfires? I'm trying to remember. Fun fact, I do believe this game was made by Atlas. Um I believe that's correct. Go from this to Persona 5, baby. It just took a few years. <laughs> like that. 15 out of 24, really? Huh. No, that's more than I thought we've seen. That's, I yeah. mean, that's still 9 we haven't seen. That's still a fair amount. Mm hmm. That's still over a third. Maybe 14, because Dan's really didn't get played yet. I mean, yeah, but we know what it is. We know it's Deadly Tower. Yeah. Torches. I think I only need to do that if I want to get the pitchfork, or is it the, or is it the sweater? Or is it both? All right, who's closest to the campgrounds? Anyone? Okay, Laura, you're close to the lake. So's Debbie. Debbie. Sure. Actually, a bunch of you are really close to the lake. All right, that's pretty good, actually. Cutthroat Island. Cutthroat Island. Who would have picked this, this? This is Draco's, actually. Interesting. So this is one of the first games I played on Cuso Grande. I think this is the second or third, and it's also based off of a movie. Correct. It is 1688, an age when pirates with a thirst for adventure sailed under a black banner bearing a skull and crossbones, the Jolly Roger. The most dangerous pirate of all, Dog Brown, terrorized the Caribbean in a quest to find the three map pieces of the legendary Cutthroat Island. Morgan Adams, the notorious lady pirate, was given a piece of this map by her dying father. Dog will stop at nothing to get it, but Morgan also seeks the treasure which is hidden in Cutthroat Island. The pirate hunter Governor Ainsley of Jamaica has sworn to stop them all. Now as captain of her father's ship, the Morning Star, Morgan is out to find the treasure for herself. Before she can set sail for the Lost Island, she must find the three map pieces. Her journey begins at a prison in Jamaica, run by a vile man simply known as the Warden. The Warden? Everyone's favorite Samurai Showdown DLC character. Hmm? She's just standing there, enjoying the wind. Cutthroat Island. Fighting styles, sword play. What? Sure. Don't know what those the difference between the two were. Oh! Super Mario R? Super Mario R. This was Kion's. Why'd you give me so many Mario 1 hacks? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm just like, you know, I'm just gonna let this happen. <laughs> this is the fourth Mario 1 hack! <laughs> I was thinking to myself, man, there's a lot of Mario 1 in here. Oh well. To be fair, we didn't know what the other submitted. I mean, that's fair. It's just funny how many people have just been like, yeah, play this version of Mario 1. Uh, for this one, you want to just try and see this. Damn, who died in here? Oh no, it's oh, randomized. Up. That's what the R stood for. Mm-hmm. Oh, you didn't notice like the Hammer Brothers in 1-1? One, one? Well, Just no, I noticed that, but I figured it was like a hack hack. Slacker. Good thing it's shooting blanks. I'm out of here. Hang on. Pause the shuffle for a second. All right, Goldlight tried to kill Duke with kindness and blanks and says, it's fine if you can't pick up Assault Suit Vulcan Declassified. Pick up SD Shin Kamen Rider Rumble English on Switch. Kamen Rider Memory of Heroes in English. On Switch, both Kamen Rider games are on PlayAsia. 
Gotcha, gold light. Oh my god, I just realized how much you sent gold light. Thank you so much for that. And yeah, uh, it's weird. I can't get Valken because the game, for some reason, is not getting a Canadian release because there's no French version of the game. But they misinterpreted the rules for releasing games in Canada, and they could have released it because they're not releasing one in France. So it's a weird situation that hopefully gets fixed. All right, back to this. But either way, thank you so much, Gold Light. Appreciate it. Welcome to the journey of overtime and space, aka Mario One again. <laughs> Mario 1 with DK! DK! And, and Diddy. And Pokemon pinball music for some reason. Yeah, why not? That counted? Okay. Yeah, no, don't. This game lets you get away with a lot. <laughs> the fucking run! Oh, right. Yeah, hang on. If you've never seen this before, when you run, you do the Taz Tasmanian Devil run. Yep. Mario 1 hacks are in here. I've got four so far. Oh, I almost a little heart. Heart. Yeah, I got the bell. Nice. All right. Well, I'm going to pick girl. 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 Uh, for this one, I just wanted you... I wrote it down as... to find it here for cutthroat. Just to get to beat the harbor stage. It's like, what, four levels in? You'll never make it out of here alive, pirate. Guard sees her! Sees her. So you say you've actually played this one before. I have. That doesn't mean much, though, all things considered, because um, stage two is notoriously difficult. Mm hmm. I have the rage! Oh, I Why lost the rage. Like, the beat-em-up part's actually not that bad of a beat-em-up. Y'all never get past me. It is a guy. More action! More wow, suspense! More romance. More thrills. More spills. Oh, just dead. Radical Rex. You still here? Press those buttons. Play! 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 God, the intro for this game reminds me so much of the, uh, you know, fuck it. It defaulted easy. I'm sticking on easy. Fuck you. Yeah, why not? I didn't think about that part, but sure, whatever. <laughs> uh, the intro for this game reminds me so much of the one for Chuck Rock, which I think it's the same team. Mm hmm. But yeah, no, the Chuck Rock one is literally just them. It's just a bunch of cavemen having a rock concert. It's amazing. Okay. Yeah, Sethron. That's the ones you want to go and beat up in the in the uh, bone graveyard stage. Oh no, they're all evil now. No, except for Rex, who slept through magic. <laughs> Let's just hate that. I hate sleeping through magic. Well, guess I'll go fight crime. Okay, so I can breathe fire. Yeah, uh, you know, as you do, as a radical Rex. Karate kick. Got some real Liu Kang kicks on you. Hang on, I, th I wonder, are my buttons mapped correctly? No, they are. Okay, so that is a jump and kick at the same time. And 
now we're back to fighting Jason. Let's go. I am surprised we've not seen some of the others yet. Uh, all right, Laura, let's do it. Let's see, what have we not seen yet? We haven't seen 10 Mars. Not seen Mayos. Meds. Mine. Allison's. Plus, it's not shown up. Kaya hasn't shown up yet. Uh, Albinos hasn't shown up yet, actually, and that looks to be it. Jason! Alright, we saved the small children. Well, sort of. How do I dodge this fight? Oh, it's back, okay. No, it's not back. How, how? Just gotta, like, dodge to the side. Okay, it, it, it's, it's down and right or down and left. It's not pressing a button. It's literally just those two buttons together. Interesting. Or those two right. directions together, rather. Ah, damn it, he went for the double. Laura's oh. dead. George and Debbie are the closest. Let's, let's at least keep one girl alive. <laughs> that. So you're supposed to kill a bunch of these zombies with the rocks to get better weapons. Eventually, I think it's like killing like five or six of these guys gets you a knife or something like that. We can also just get them as random drops in midair. There we go. Speaking of. So there you go. Way faster. Straight shot. Kills things quicker. But... Taking too long, I'm gonna lose all the kids. If I lose all the kids, then unfortunately I get a game over. Well, we're about it later, because here is this is K Head. This is K Head, yes. <sighs> Genzo, why? I like how you just knew. <laughs> I can't think of anyone else in the group that would pick Athena. Get fucked, so job! <laughs> <laughs> Love so too, this but... was the game that Laughing Boy tried to actually suggest. Of course, this was the fucking duplicate. Yep. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, as in King of Fighters Athena, this is the NES port of her original game. It's not a good game. No, no, it's not. World of Forest. Well, the forest. Uh, for Athena, by the way, I have you going up to War of the Sky. Brave, but you think I'm gonna make it there? Yeah, if, if we need to, we'll lower it. Okay, great weapon. Also work with, like, some of the other, like, mods and co comps right now that, like, change things around. No, what am I... <laughs> Gotta find the number. What number, though? I don't know who I'm supposed to go to. It's randomized. Just find the one that has, like, red numbers under it. Oh, here we there go. There you go. So go to the red number? 555-6842. Yeah. How do I do that? <laughs> Gotta click on his name. Should be one of the buttons that you should let you uh, go into there. There we go. Right around to the circus of time! By which we mean- Who the fuck paid the page master? Ah, uh, yes, this was Little Foos, Allison. Oh my god, Allison. I'm amazed you didn't try to slide Pocahontas in here. <laughs> I should have guessed when it was a Genesis game. Because uh, I grew up with the SNES version of this. You recognize it by the Sega logo? Oh, it says the name of a bunch of these games up top, so that's why I know them in advance. Yeah, some of them should say our names, but some of them, I guess, like, get loaded up as, like, the some, actual game name. Some have, yeah, some have the, uh, the mod names, but most have had the actual game name. Which is a little odd, actually, but I would assume that's just because it texts the file somewhere in your, like, stuff. God, is this actually different than the SNES one? No, maybe not. Some of it looks similar. Horror World. Horror World. Oh no, this is this is the same as the SNES one. No, I remember this. I remember this screen explicitly. 
This game gave my mom and I so much grief when I was a kid, so I wanted to see it again. Well, you'll get to see it later, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I, I grew up, I played that game. I actually did beat Page Master, but to get the actual ending, you have to get all the pieces of your fucking library card, and those are hidden in random stages. <laughs> like, you don't know what stages they're in otherwise, so I never got to see the true ending of the game, but I just, I beat it and got credits. Sorry, Orca, I'm just gonna keep punching the boob till you let me win. We never made it anywhere near that far. I read you that game a lot. Supreme victory! Saber Wolf. Have you ever watched the movie? Oh, yeah. I used to love Macaulay Culkin movies back in the day. Weird enough, I haven't watched My Girl. But, like, I watched Page Master. I watched both um, Home Alone movies that he was in. Because I know I have to specify that now. Oh, right. Uh, do I just have to get to the end of this? I forget how this even works. I think if I recall right, the idea is you want to, like, line up the red circle and, like, kind of like do, like, it's like you're calling the number. I have to make sure I don't hit the skull. I remember that much. Yeah. And I think I just did. Okay, well, we got lucky on that one. Okay, well, we're here. Yeah. Entering the circuits of time. Ugh. <sighs> Jump's gonna suck so much. You know what the worst part is? Like, we're, we're basically, we're close to break time now. We're not quite there yet. We're gonna get to break and still have a bunch of people's games we haven't seen yet. Yeah. Less infinite lives, cause I'm gonna fucking need it. Mhm. Mm I feel like at this point I should just have it to where just beat a stage for this one. <laughs> to I the mean, thing. I don't. I to be fair, I remember this stage being not easy, like any of these stages, obviously. It's called mm -hmm. Mario Frustration for a reason. True. True. I'm gonna call that a pity. That's a pity Ryu if I've ever seen one. You know, so I was hanging on the hard Mario hacks for a while. Oh, I'm aware. I'm I'm feeling it. Damn, every time I think I got the timing for that. Dark Liger kills Rhea with kindness and bullets and says, Hi John, I'm older today, so I would be here for birthday luck, but given the mod shuffler, I think you need it more again. Happy birthday, Liger. So wishing you good luck regardless, but I appreciate the offer of letting me keep my luck today. Because clearly it's a little tainted. Clearly, it's a little tainted. Clearly. Uh, uh, yeah, let's just let's just make this one just beat beat this level for Mario frustration. Because <laughs> yeah. I'm starting to feel bad now. <laughs> hey, John, I just got back from a concert for my favorite punk band, and now I get to watch you be tortured. It really is my lucky day. Jesus. <clears throat> wow. Uh, what band did you go see, Xander? Crown Iceberg lives left, so clearly we're doing great. Every time. Every time. Oop. Okay, this is bad, dudes, which means it's Tanmar. It is Tanmar, yes. 
he's the only one I know who would pick this. Maybe Tom, he's an evil genius, but Tenmar loves his bad dudes. Let's go, let's let's play a striker. A striker. There's Duke! Uh, so There's Duke himself! The president's been kidnapped by ninjas. Are you a bad enough dude to rescue the president? Well, there's only one thing I say to that. Damn. Thank you, Duke. So have you played this before, by chance? Yes. We okay. we played this and my cart was dirty, so we had a... This was another Glitch Fest game. Ah, oh, okay. So you don't but need I've, to I've also this? played the arcade Bad Dudes, and I played the NES one with uh, my buddy uh, TJ Thrilla. Mm-hmm. So remember that. This, this is the move I gotta remember, this helicopter kick, because I remember this is being very helpful. The, the, the Tatsumaki, if you will. Yeah. Ah, the dudes truck is here! Ah, oh, dudes. A truck just for dudes. It lets you move dudes By around. Dude. <laughs> By dudes for dudes. To move dudes. So many dudes. Temar on his, uh, actually asked for you to just beat the game. So, the game is short enough that you could do that, but, like, it's a Data East game, so it's either going to be a really easy playthrough or a really stupidly difficult playthrough. It kind of has no middle ground. Mm hmm We'll see how it goes. And here's Karnov. Karnov! Freeze fire. Yep, that's, that's the thing Karnov's known for. Or he can breathe low. Data East loved Karnov so much. He shows up in so many other games. Time. I'm bad. I'm bad. <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. Pan Anik, thank you so much for the raid. Go to next stage, Pan. I'm bad. Is that Karnov from the hit series Karnov? You better believe it. It is. All right. Is this bad, dudes? Pan, you came in on an interesting night. We're doing a shuffler tonight, but it's a shuffler of games my mods picked and didn't tell me. And let's say this is one of the nicest ones I've had so far on the list. It's that it kind actually, of night. It actually is, huh? It really is. Let's run countermeasures. What? No. Oh, there we go. Thank you so much for the raid. Hopefully your stream was good. Uh, like I mentioned earlier, it's April Fools, so I foolishly let the mods Bullsh build a uh, BizHawk shuffler for me. So I have 24 random games I'm swapping through anywhere from 30 seconds to 3 minutes into playing it. And it uh, it's been a thing tonight. It's been a thing. They've all got preset goals I'm trying to reach, and I am not close on any of them. Case in point. Page master. Back to page master. Okay, so I've uh, got high jump boots now. That's a one-off. 
page master. We just want you to just uh, beat the horror book. It's like on the levels here. Wow! Wow! It's mentioning uh off uh, what is it? Mentioning a moment ago there to John. We've actually have only seen not seen four games left actually. Uh, rather four people games. Uh, Shamrocks, Mine, Meds, and Mayos. I believe that is it that we've not seen. I don't remember what the health meter is in this game. Wake up! <laughs> Wake up! Throw this poor dude around. I think this is the. I can't tell because their colors are wrong. But I almost thought this was the. Oh no, that's the. This is the monster dude, right? It's not the fairy at all. So like, what's this movie about, anyways? Macaulay Culkin goes to a library. That's pretty much it. He goes to a library and like. Is he think, I forget if he thinks books are stupid, or if he thinks books are cool but no one else likes them, and then he ends up getting sucked into a book, turned into a cartoon, and then shit goes sideways. It's something like that. I see. I forget if it's a Don Bluth film or not, but it might be in the fact that it's like, like weirdly one of those movies that just kind of is a bit freakier than it needs to be for a kid's movie. Mm -hmm. For the sake of time, let's lower. I'm gonna lower Ikari Wars to just beat the first stage. Right. Just because there's. I'm, I'm realizing, like, some of these go maybe a bit too long for how many games we have. So we're gonna start lowering some here. Oh shit, I forgot this game has fucking limited bullets. Oh god. God, does it? Ew. But now I'm in tank and blew up the other tank. <laughs> I ran the tank into the other tank, which exploded and killed me. <laughs> Oh my god, Akari Warriors for NES is so stupid. I was very surprised you could just do that. You know, SNK didn't know how to make fair games back then, nor did they care to. That's a mine, don't touch that. I think that's why they call it SNK hard. SNK difficulty, that's usually for their fighting games. True, yeah, that guy's like Rugal and stuff like that. Okay, you can just drink the fuel. Powers you up. Very thirsty. There's a lot of enemies on screen. Yeah, there sure is. That's why the game is flashing so much, because it can't really handle as many sprites as they put into it. I give them points for trying, if anything. I think that's the game over. I just don't remember how. Is it just A B B A? I forget where you're supposed to type that code in. Uh, let's see if I can look it up here. No, it's not ABBA. It's not ABBA. You don't have to sing Dancing Queen, but I appreciate it. I am the Shuffling Queen. Thank you. Thank you, Clockwork. Finally, my true calling, being the Queen of Shuffles. Only upon running out of lives, press A B B A. Really wants Page Master. All right. Okay, got the one up. Nice. Good news, you're the queen of shuffles. Bad news, it's the truffle shuffle. Ah, son of a bitch. Give me that key slowly sliding off screen there. I need them, but I think they're like I can use them as a weapon or something like that. Because mm -hmm. otherwise, I think the only way to fight enemies is to just jump on them. Or maybe I can't do anything with them at all. Then never mind. Oh, there go my jump shoes. Yeah. 
come back. Oh, that was otherwise how you're supposed to get that one up. Okay. How much do we donate to see you shuffle on camera? Yeah, you don't want to see me dance. Simply because I don't know how to. You're just gonna see someone flail around randomly, which I know is what you want, but you're still not getting that either! <laughs> well, can I wall jump with this thing? I can. I'm not gonna lie, I watched Jared stream today where Evil Jared did the stream. And uh, they had it so that it was a stream that every donation, or sorry, every sub lowered the length of the stream, but every donation raised it. I kinda wanna do something like that, because I think we could do something absolutely stupid with that. I kind of want to do a subathon that's just, it, I guess it's a reverse subathon is what you call it. Where it's just like, it's planned to be a 12 hour stream and just every donation or bit or whatever just shrink and shrinkens. Shrinkens it down! Hello. Mistor. Welcome back to Mistor. Mistor. Nigga wants the weed. That stream was hilarious. We ended up going 30 minutes over time. Oh yeah, because someone donated 500 bucks and made Jared... Because Jared only added on for like another half hour at most. Mm -hmm. So he was like, yeah, it'll probably take a while to get to this. And it was like five minutes into the stream, someone did that. I'm just sure. Reverse subathon. Every five bucks raised or lowered the timer by 15 seconds. And yet chat managed to push evil Jared over the usual stream time. Yeah, that sounds right. Wow, all right. A sacrifice for me. You did this. Think about your action. Wait, Leaf, that's the wrong Ryu. Hi, John. It's been a while since I could watch live or donate, but now I can. Thank you for all the amazing content, and I hope you and everyone are doing well. I'm doing good, Leaf. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Even Bale's doing good, right, buddy? <laughs> I can't believe I was on stream. Oh my god. Oh, he ate cat food on the stream? Okay. So, Bagel today at the start of Reese's stream, she did a gardening stream test. Uh, mm -hmm. Bagel had caught a mouse and brought it up to Reese. No! <laughs> God. Oh my god. <laughs> Even my own wife has no sympathy for me. That went so good, though. I mean, like, no one, like, I think the nicest game I've gotten so far is Bad Dudes. She said Takeshi's challenge. Uh, no sympathy. No sympathy for me. Okay. I think I've got her adjusted all the challenges. So I think they should be a bit more doable now in a more reasonable time. Alright. 
We're gonna go to break yeah. soon here, too. I just realized it's almost we're at uh, an hour and a half. Yeah. I just listen to uh, DK here just to beat all, like, World 1 and 2. Rather than, like, beat the whole game. I just realized I paused the shuffle because Bagel came down. <laughs> Love these beams! <laughs> I don't can! I don't can! I don't can! Watch this, little buddy! I do can! What's the, what's the star man in this one? Oh, there is no star man. <laughs> Can't break that block, uh, sadly. It Ooh, it's a diamond. Diamond Kong. Hey, it's slowing down. <laughs> the game cannot handle this much Kong power. Oh yeah, so I think that yeah, the the oh no, the one up is there, or it's just a banana. So when I had to do this for the uh, Donkey Kong Country playthrough, I definitely had to use save states because, as you can tell, this game does not exactly run the best. Yeah. This game apparently pushed the Game Boy Color to its limits. And that's why we appreciate it for that. Oh boy, Mega Man Twelve. P -p 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 hey, it's mine. What? <laughs> Why is it Chippendale? It's Chippendale. Our cute little neighbor Mandy. What? <laughs> half on with controls. Like I said, half on with the controls. You randomize the controls? No, that's or just how the game is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this up is left, down is right, left is jump, right is nothing, which I assume means pick up. Uh, and A and B, oh, the B is duck. How yeah, the I, fuck? I picked this purely for the trash control scheme. <laughs> I'm just have you, like, just, like, beat, like, one level of this one. That'd be nice. Thank you, because I still don't know how to pick up and things, and I kind of need that to fight the boss. There's only six. Oh no, there's more. It could. No, pause. Start and select seem to be the same. I still don't know how to pick up anything! Should there be like. How, what's like down, like picking up something normally? Or was it like A? Your friend Bill asked me to give you one of these highly dangerous textbooks. I got seven pudding cups, eight dynamite, five books, four radios, and seven coins. And now the music's just gone. It's a college textbook. It's dangerous for your wallet. Yeah, that tracks. That definitely tracks. Friend Bill asked me to give you one of these highly dangerous textbooks. Clumsy oaf, pay me one coin or I'll have you locked up. Your friend Bill asked me to give you one of these shiny coins. Friend Bell asked me to give you one of these cassette tapes. Goodbye! <laughs> hey, we're back to this. Glad to find you visible, Bilbo. I suppose you feel everything has gone to plan. Yes, I do. You've had your joke and given the shy or something to talk about. Are you going any further? I am. I need a holiday. A permanent holiday. You'll keep an eye on Frodo for me. Two eyes as often as I can spare him. I'm leaving him everything. Everything? The ring as well? You agreed to that, remember? You're always badgering me about my ring. 
I the badger you, Bilbo. Magic rings are well magical, and I think you've had it long enough. It is mine, my precious! It's been called that before, but not by you. Let it go and be free. Very well, the ring goes to Frodo. That is that. I feel better already. Now I'm off. Bilbo's disappearance was discussed in a hobbiton and all over the Shire for many a year. And that's why Shere Khan showed up instead. The Jungle Book. All right, next shuffle, we'll go to break. All right, sounds good. Chapter one, the beginning. The beginning. All right. <laughs> the rest can't be full names you. <laughs> So Mowgli can huck bananas. Yes, he can. I don't remember. There we go. All right. Nope. Never mind. We'll read it later. Back to Killer Instinct. Winner. Meow. Supreme victory! Glacius versus Glacius. This Glacius thinks he's so cool just because he knows how to do moves. What a jerk. Oh god. Oh, Maze actually landed on here before the shuffle happened. Yeah, that's good. Problem is, you need that's momentum for the start. Yeah. Oh yeah, I said I was going to break after the shuffle. You did, yes. But I don't want to come back to start on this one either. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, stop now for all we know the next game could just be Orb 3D. That's true, that's still in there. Let's be real, are there any games you want to come back to after break? There's a couple on these I don't mind. I don't mind Bad Dudes, I don't mind Page Master. You don't, you don't, want, you don't want more Chip and Dale with heavy parentheses? Ugh. <laughs> I wouldn't mind that as much if I could control that one. Can't figure so out why... Double... I gotta figure out how to pick up things, otherwise I can't beat the first stage. I'm double checking some stuff on that, actually, and like... Uh... So I looked at the like, actual Chip and Dale, and saw how like to pick things up, you have to just like go next to something and just like... Pick it up, right? Yeah. I can't do that same motion in the hack here. So I'm thinking, was this just a hack I just couldn't do that in? And you just have to, like, survive without hitting things? Because oh, it's also possible. I'm gonna make that. Monaco, you can pluck stuff off. I beat that hack. You can't? Okay. What's the input I need to do, Jake? Because that's the thing I can't seem to figure out. Yeah, that's the one I'm getting confused on here myself. I'm like, I could have picked something up in this hack. There we go. Oh, I think I'm not supposed to pick that mushroom up, actually. I don't know why I expected anything else. Oh, yeah, you can. Good news, it's, uh, up and right to pick something up. Oh, my God. All right. At least that explains that. Yeah. I was gonna say, I could have could have done it. I don't think I can get this well big, actually. Do you not? I, well, oh, that's a garbage place to come back to. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's gonna suck. All right, shuffles pause. Let's go to break. Let's go. Oh, Bubba just texted me saying, I felt like I gave you too easy a game. Yeah, I'm starting to turn around in your pick, Bubba. Now I'm like, oh, maybe that was actually one of the nicer ones. <laughs> maybe, maybe I do need the nicer ones. 
All right, gift subs wise, go kind of give to the sub to this is not John. Still give to the sub to pee pee poo poo and egg fetish. Sabri, give to the sub to Chatia. Still give to the sub to blonde wig. Aerialand, give to the sub to Gibber Woods. Still give to the sub to drop the eggs. Aerialand was the Gibber Woods one, by the way. I don't know if I said that. Anonymous, give to the sub to Sailor Sevy on Moon. And Alf Yui, give to the sub to the dude. The dude, the dudest of dudes, one, two, three. That's a pretty good username. Everyone else, the list is a little too long to read, but shout out to the long, long timers and the newcomers, such as Fox Gamer 01 at 109, Raina Thrown Away at 86, Afro Blade Master at 108, Talos at 100, Banaktarski at 102, Kerbinator at 104. Red Cinder, sorry, Red Cinder at 102. Frosty Yeti at three. Storm Rider 225 at two. Calvin Hobbs 1010 at one. Hundo. Proof Gold at 105. And Trojan at 96. Alongside Grand Spectre gifting a sub to Eloquence Aegis, it looks like. Thanks for subbing and hanging out tonight, folks. Your eggs tonight are courtesy of. God, I'm scared to look in the carton. Let's see what's in the carton for today. Ah, oh, shoot. You told me how to say your name, and I always forget how to say it. Uh, the C A C T A C E A E. Cactasa? Cactasa? Something like that? Duke feels the need to dance. Let's dance. Damn. I might, I might need that for the rotation. I really might. <laughs> you may have to send me a version that I can use. Uh, they also sent me, uh, Duke has an inner body experience. Suggestion from Enzo. Two not. I gotta tell you, this is pretty terrific. Oh, cute. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I need that one too. I need that one too. That one is very good. Oh my god. So I don't know if you guys saw it going around. Uh, fuck, who did it yesterday? Someone did uh, the Duke Nukem three uh, 3D theme with Kirby's sound font. I have to go yeah. find it. It's really good. Was it Johnny Amma? It was Johnny Amma. There you go. Yeah, Brawler just said it. I'll play that during break just to show you guys that. For my Alita, it's time for the next alt of the month. There's a video for this one? All right. You can say deploying derps to fight against them spoilers. Go to 17 to skip or perhaps not. These derps be catchy. I forgot Alita made this. Oh Did no. To Boo, I baked an absolute dog shit glitch. It just completely fucked up the place. You can't even get through the door. I'm sorry. Yours truly, Peach John. <laughs> Enjoy April's Alt of the Month. Special thanks to. Oh, and then it's gone. <laughs> Special thanks to Prime Explorer for the art and the Gex for providing the voice. Well, I guess that means Peach John is the Alt of the Month for April. There we go. All right, we'll see that art, I'm sure, in Art Block at some point tonight. Green Day rocks with a not-so-innocent kids game character. Give me the butt. <laughs> I don't know what I expected. I don't know what I expected. I need more of these, man. <laughs> oh, we got a Magus Andrews with Go Get Some. I'm shopping this egg. It's time to kick ass and chew bubble gum, and I'm all out of gum. Emergency! Emergency. 
code. Collect. Yeah! I didn't get that reference, but I'm going to assume it's Common Rider related. <laughs> Probably. Oh, no, PSO2. It's PSO2, apparently. Oh, okay. I do appreciate the yeah! I'm just gonna, I want that yeah back in there. Yeah! It's a solid yeah. All right. We're gonna get a break when we come back. Oh, More of the curse shuffler for April Fool's Day. See you guys in a bit. Oh, right, I was gonna find that. Did I click ad? No, ad break hasn't happened yet. Let me go find the Johnny Atma one I was talking about. And of course, now that I've said that, I'm not gonna fucking find it. Probably just see if we can find it on Johnny's Twitter. I try. I don't. I can't remember what Johnny's Twitter is because I typed Johnny Atma and got nothing. So I know it's something else. No, it should be Johnny Atma. Hang on. Yep, I got it right here. Yeah, because he, he changed his name to Game Metal. That's what it was. That's why I couldn't find it. Or did you post it in Modern? Uh, I posted it in Twitch chat actually. I throw in Modern as well. Oh, perfect. Oh no, oh, oh, I'm spelling his name wrong, there's no H. That's what I was goofing. Here we go. Alright, so this is this is the tweet that he put out. Kirby's here to kick ass and eat snacks, and he's all out of snacks. Kirby cross Duke Nukem theme. Lube in the background, it's only 24 seconds. It will get annoying after a while. So, gonna go to break when we come back. More Shuffler and some Art Block. See you guys in a bit. Let's go. Art Block is very busy today. Goddamn. Oh, yeah. <laughs> some people doing April Fools and some people not. All right. See you guys in a bit. Hey, chat. How's it going? You guys got any questions in the meantime while we're waiting for John to come back here? Watch the D and D movie. Yeah, I heard the movie actually wasn't too bad. Like, interestingly enough, I heard people kind of were saying it was more. They were just trying to do like more of a fantasy movie thing, but kind of called it a D and D movie just to kind of get the, uh, I guess, like the funding. I don't know. That, that's like. Like, like, it, was, it was like one thing I heard about that. Yeah, like a pleasant, su a pleasant surprise. Yeah. How you be? I be good. I guess. Hope you be good too. Make my game show up next. Here's open meds. Why'd you just crack on the way that it is? What's wrong with it? It's a monkey. It's got a sombrero. It's just like me. He's just like me for real. Do you feel evil? I actually just kind of feel bad, actually. <laughs> but you know what? That's kind of the spirit of like what's going on here, so it's fine. Saying is it's not D and D, but just grab back and it's fun. Yeah, that's all you need sometimes, honestly. I feel bad that I, after I orchestrated John's personal Saturday disaster. 
Well, when you put it like that... <laughs> How do you like your eggs? Personally, I, I can't really have eggs by themselves anymore. I feel like I gotta like have them with something. So I, my preference is like scrambled eggs with like either mixed with like potato or like turkey, like 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 cold turkey, or uh, it's like what potato or turkey or bacon, like any of those three. So if I'm combining them, I would probably do like potato and bacon, specifically like little like chopped up like bacon bits. If you fell asleep one day and woke up in a completely different universe, real or fiction, which universe would you want to end up in? Hmm. Well, that sounds like it would be the least painful, or at least, like, bad. Maybe Yu-Gi-Oh, honestly. M mainly, like, well, actually, I don't know, because there's still fucked up shit that happens in Yu-Gi-Oh. The only reason I say that is just because of, like, the whole, like, holograms and the cards and stuff could be kind of fun. Animal Crossing? I mean, there's, I think that'd be fun to Animal Crossing. I feel like it'd get boring after a while. Kirby? I don't know if I want to live in Kirby world, man. <laughs> Pokemon? See, Pokemon sounds good on concept and, like, on paper and stuff. But then, like, you gotta remember, like, all, like, the actual, like, messed up aspects of Pokemon that would maybe, like, not be so fun. Like, all the killer creatures that just roam the Earth. That's part of the fun. It's fair enough. <laughs> Free health current Pokemon, you know what? There, there you go. Never the Kirby world, he does poof into existence after Kirby eats you. But what if Kirby doesn't eat me? That's the problem. I have Pokemon in the real world? Uh, not legally. <laughs> That's part of the fun. Gardevoirs exist. Down. <laughs> Down, boy. Hey, welcome back. Uh, let's see here. Art block is shuffled. <clears throat> let's read some alerts. If I can find where they start. There we go. Actually, a lot of these alerts don't even have a message on them. Oops. <laughs> There we go, Radiant Shadow, with the first one that has a message that says, uh, Pride for that performance. That would be for for Erica's impersonation of me, which I guess I'll show here again in a minute for those who came in late. I had, I had planned to do it every intermission, and then we ended up doing it after a bunch of counter, a bunch of raids we did, so it balanced out. Kiranai Hideyoshi says, Hey y'all, I've had a fine time myself, picked up art therapy, and I've gotten back on track with standard art fast because of it. Cools my head and puts me in a good mood. I've also got new glasses. One of my eyes actually got better when I got tested. Here's to a most foolish April. Nice. Good shit to hear. Samoan Fun1222 says, Have you ever tried Slice Soda? I've tried Fruit Punch and Lemon Lime, if I can remember correctly. And, and, if, and in my opinion, those two are my favorite flavors. I actually gave up uh, soft drinks. I haven't had like an actual soft drink since like 2004. Three, four, somewhere in that range. It's been about 20 years, basically, is what I'm saying. So, so I would not have tried sliced soda. Queen Bee Nev says, Well, it is the day of fools. Today I named myself King Waspajack, turning it around. This beginning stream was the best prank yet. I know, that video was actually pretty pretty enjoyable. Swarty's favorite soda. Cool. No 7-Up? No. How? I weaned myself off it. I went from, like, drinking Pepsi and Coke constantly to, uh, like, 7-Up and Sprite. And then from 7-Up and Sprite to, like, iced tea. And then from iced tea to just, like, fruit drinks. And then that was it. I didn't manage to stay on just, like, fruit drinks. And now I'm mainly just water now with the occasional, like, apple juice or orange juice. Does that include sparkling water? Yeah, no carbonated beverages at all. Probably one of the healthiest things I do, to be perfectly honest. Gibber Wood says at Proton John sees picture. Marv, what the heck are you doing in the stream? Lol, I joke, I joke. Happy to be here. Thanks, Gibber. 
Oh, 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 my dude says, whoa, man, I hope this wacky mod curation doesn't have any coca- sorry, cocainum in it. it. You might get in trouble with the contraband police available on Steam now, or you could buy the game and join them. They'll never expect an inside job. Hang on. I think I still have that on the soundboard. Where is it? Cocainum. No, I knew I had it on there. Cocainum. Hang on. Let me throw that on there. What was that called again? Contraband police. Take over the duties of a border guard inspector in a communist country of the 80s. Smuggling corruption and forgery are the order of the day here. Be vigilant and earn the respect of your superiors. Okay, so this looks very similar to um, Papers, Please, in a way, but it's a bit more involved. All right, add it to cart. Oh, I forgot I had to pick up Urge the other day, too, so I got two things to pick up tonight. Thank you, thank you, Owu, especially for reminding me about... Cocainum. Can never forget about... Cocainum. It's very important to always remember if you have... Cocainum. ...nearby. RB13 says, So whatever happened to the game clearing list that you collected from us at the end of the year? I don't think we ever discussed that. We did discuss it. We discussed that we'd be discussing it the first game clearing of the year. It is now April, and we haven't done game clearing yet. <laughs> so, it'll happen eventually. The twist this year is going to be game clearing one of the year. I think we've technically had two, we've cleared two games on stream, I think. Okay, well, you blew it. Hang on, let me see here. Uh, yeah, I haven't even... So, for reference's sake, every year I do, like, a nice-looking spreadsheet for myself for the most part. Oh, I do something like this, or like this, or like this, like stuff like this over the years. Or it's like just a very basic list, because we start with just basic lists at the very beginning. But like, it's usually like done up in a nice way. This this year's isn't even named yet. It's literally just the three games we did. <laughs> so like, game clearing nice. four four months now into the year has been a side thought. <laughs> it's been an afterthought. We'll get it. We'll get it going at some point, including that the the whole thing, the viewer submissions. But like, yeah, it has been very much an afterthought in my brain. I mean, you've had a couple strong years with that. Can, can kind of take a backseat for the year. I mean, this is year seven of game clearing. Yeah. Sheet seven. I, I didn't realize it was seven. Well, get, those are just the years <laughs> I tracked it. So yeah, we started yeah. game clearing in 2017. Yeah, 2017 Math was the was 52. Like 2018 was the 64. 2019 Dang, was the gaming alphabet. 2020 was democracy where all the subs picked the games. 21 was rotation where we jumped between a my choice, a uh, sub choice, and a mod choice. And 22 was remix. Which went off the rails halfway through the year, but yeah. <laughs> Alright, where were we here? BML42 says, Cole, why do you put, why do you, why do you do put this insanity onto John and why must we watch it? No hard feelings though, you both stay awesome. Thanks, BML. Philip J. Fry donates and says, All right, it's Saturday night. I have no date. A two liter bottle of Shasta and my all rush mixtape. Let's rock. Lakeside Park intensifies. Honestly, after Xenoblade Chronicles, I think you're allowed a good break from focusing on finishing games. Gives you a chance to build your backlog back up. Ah, uh, yes, because if there's anything I need, it's help <laughs> making my backlog bigger. Because, you know, 8,642 unfinished games. Oh, shit! It's my it's my backlog anniversary today! Of course nice. I fucking Yay! made my back- I thought I made it on April 2nd. I did, April 2nd. It's They're in Eastern time zone. Yes. Oh, yeah, it just crossed over in Eastern. Well, you, you're just like- you're like Scrooge McDuck, right? Just- just gotta get, like, larger and larger. More- more bloated with games. <laughs> That's not- is, is Scrooge McDuck bloated? <laughs> I don't remember that part of DuckTales. Well, his yeah. monthly is bloated. <laughs> That's the- <laughs> That's the series finale, he explodes! <laughs> Scrooge McDuck dies due to expansion. Jesus Christ. <laughs> but yeah, apparently, I've had my backloggery for 15 years now, so it's my backlog anniversary today. And of course, right. th this is the one day we didn't do cookies, so we're not using the backlog. 
Look, we could we could roll one game when we're done to start off like next Saturday with, obviously. Honestly, I'm surprised we don't do that too often, but at the same time, new releases. All right, uh, RB13 says, so terrible thought. What if they put Orb 3D or on NSO Online since it's an NES game? Uh, I'd hope they'd have better taste than that. Because they're clearly not putting every game from the platform on there, so. <laughs> Prime, no! Get that out of the chat! <laughs> oh my god. I'm trying to post my favorite tweet from you, dude. What? I'm just gonna post my favorite tweet from you in the Oh, I, I had a feeling from, that's what from it was. me? Yeah. yeah. I, I knew it. What? Oh, oh, no, I know what tweet that is. Yeah, no. <laughs> my, I, I didn't need to click tweet. it to know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I officially own more than 1,000 games. I feel so depressed realizing that. I like this response. I guess someone retweeted it recently because I got this response like two actually. days ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why? In terms of preservation, that's amazing. Not many people can put so much effort into a hobby to be able to share it with people across the world. I, I think they missed the part where this was from March 31st, 2010. So, you know, 13 years ago, almost to the day. 13 years and 9,000 games ago. Oh, More than 9,000. So like, I'm at 11,500. So, so you obviously weren't disappointed enough to stop. Did it like circle back around to that's, where like that's how addiction you stopped being works. disappointed? Man, that's how addiction that's works. Addiction you, just because you, you're depressed doesn't mean you stop. You're in a oh. vicious cycle. That's, that's, got, de that's got depressing, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Y'all had to learn the truth somehow. What, look, man. Why do you need to know about depression? I watch Proton John. Why do you think I go to therapy so much? <laughs> <laughs> it was Nintendo! <laughs> That's to me, Miyamoto. I'm coming for you. Is Scrooge McDuck thick? Nah, he thin and old. 69 votes. Nice. And the other nice. option was he can float on gold. <laughs> I watch Junk Seed distracted from my depression. Yo, can we get to hands in chat for that message? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Uh. Texas Bro says, ah, back to the good old classics. Hi, by the way. Hey, Texas Bro. The Funk Prophet says, and lo, the prophecy states that the coming of the Funk will be heralded by the mishmash of random ROM hacks. And Bleach Bummer says, Go Kai, I can't believe you gifted us up a thick McDuck. <laughs> Bleach Bummer says, Hey, John, so almost completely better from COVID. Still coughing, but should be well in a few more days. Sadly, though, I failed to finish raising the final Digimon I wanted on the vital bracelet, but still raised a good amount, as you'll see with these two pictures. Cool. Oh, wow, that's a fair amount. God damn. That's awesome. Cool. Thanks for sharing that, Bleach. All right. Let's uh, let's do the Wisdom of Duke here now first. How many games do you own now, though? Um, Backloggery says 11,548. So, yeah, it's it's over 10,000 compared to where I was when I made that tweet 13 years ago. All right. Wisdom of Duke goes out to Simidon. This one's for you. Mother key cards. You know, I'm throwing one for free. Take it easy. It's always the longest one, whenever I do it. Who's that handsome devil? Who the hell are you, my evil twin? That's my line, asshole. What the f is going on? Now what? Three. What the hell was that? There you go, Dr. Zock, there's there's what you're looking for there. Alright, let's go to Art Block. Art Block is a full page. And it starts right here. With this lovely picture from Yolk the Joke. I have 
Two sides of the same coin. The goddess and the devil. Hi, hey, you guys probably don't know this, so 13 is an eldritch demon. She's a bit funky, the form that she commonly see uh, as is not a true form. Also, did you know that the red spider lilies mean death, but also hell? I didn't know that. Found out while working on this piece. And also pinks, uh, Deanthus SPP means flowers of God. Also found out that through working on this. Huh, flower language is funky. That's cool. I like how we're acting like Juliana is the good, the good goddess in this situation. <laughs> She's absolutely not. So it's just evil and evil. It's very cute, oh, though. Thank you, Yoke. What's up? I'll just say, like, the lesser of two evils. Hmm. Depends on who you ask. Can we have five dukes running at the same time? Yeah, sure, we've done that before. One, two, three, four, five. Are they team pork chops in? Where am I? Or am I? <laughs> I'd love to where am I in the middle of that. <laughs> <laughs> Those are like maybe the five best ones that kept combined together, honestly. That was a pretty solid set. <laughs> that was so good. Where am I? Or am I? For Queen Bee Nev, Queen Bee challenged John to a battle. Insert Pokemon music. John sent out Jolteon. Queen Bee summoned Flare John. What? What? No, that's cheating. So here's me again, work doing all to the month last minute, but this took so long. I loved the idea so much, I took and I ran with it. After this, I'll just post close ups of Flare and me because I worked really hard on them. Uh, closing this by saying that Flareon is my favorite Pokemon of all times. So hope you enjoy. Oh, I got little lightning bolt earrings too. Cute. Nice. And here's the close up they were talking about. Here's the close-ups. Really proud of how these turned out. Ignore how tall she looks and how small I look. I'm very small and... Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Well, there you go. It works either way. Well, she's also wearing heels, so... Thank you, Nip. Where am I, or am I? What's the max? Uh... There's like, what, 50, 60 in there? Right now? I haven't loaded in all the ones I said I was gonna add, so I think there's like 60-something. So I could just play them all at once. It's just... It would take a while. No, It'd be funny. I'm not playing them all. It'd probably blow out your speakers. It would dude. absolutely blow out oh, some speakers. <laughs> Next up from Orpheus Lotus. Hey John, it's my first time ever making art for you and the rest of the community. I've been a fan for a very long time and wanted it to be special, so I made Rosa as one of the most amazing Digimon I could think of, uh, Sakuyamon. She kicks butt in her series, and I think it fits the role of an alt John well. I hope you have a great day, and if you see this on stream, have fun, and hope you get to play some good games. Well, this was not the day for it, sadly. Oh, well, it's like at least like one good game in here, right? There's at least one good game in here, but yeah, no, this is a really kick-ass design. Fuck yeah. Nicely done on this. This is the full evolution of Renamon, isn't it? Correct, yes. Or at least in like... At least like in like Tamers, it was like the final form of her. Good shit. Thank you, Orpheus. Appreciate it so much. Next up from Storm. So, I'm alive, whoop. As for why I've not done art, checks her last post in six months, yikes, it's simple, no inspiration. But seeing as you complete, competed in Twitch Rivals, I found inspiration, and that was to do a sprite edit of my favorite Gen 9 Mon Tinkaton, aka Gremlin Amy Rose. And while I don't care for Gen 9 Pokemon in the slightest, I just fell in love with Tinkaton, so art. The only other thing I really need to say is that Kahlo this year was just fantastic and well done for raising over 400,000 for direct relief. Oh, and turning my favorite 3D Mario game into nonsense with the 3D World segment. I know I have strange opinions. Sorry for all the text and see y'all in another six months. Thank you, Storm, for the recolor there. Nicely done on the sprite. I guess it wasn't a recolor. This is a proper done, properly done, but thank you, Storm. Uh, for those who don't know, the segments for Coliseum have been going up over on my YouTube VOD channel, youtube.com slash protonjohnlivestreams. Those have been going up daily. The, currently, the one that went up today was Switch Makes Music or TRG Makes Music. I forget what that one's actually called. But it's the one where they mashed up uh, Lonely Rolling Star with Raisins in My Toast. You can also see them all here as Meds. I actually highlighted them all on the Twitch channel here, too. And it's all in a collection. You can watch them all in together. Yeah, you get chat on Twitch. What? I think you get like the Twitch chats uh, on Twitch. Oh, I heard it's chat okay. on I heard Twitch. It. I heard it too, John. <laughs> <laughs> Good. I thought what? I was going crazy there. Even Mayo saying it. All right. All right. All right. We're fine. Oh, chat. Oh, no. I didn't they say chat. They definitely sound like chat. I'm like, Please what? Please do not do that on Twitch. Please, no. We get banned for it, I'm pretty sure. You would definitely get banned for that. All right. Next up, very lovely Flara John from Gaia. 
Wouldn't Flare John make for a cozy bed warmer? I swear I was gonna do this more elaborate, uh, Art Nouveau inspired background with stylized fire and gold pen and all. But my brain stopped at some point, and the more I stare at it, the more I think this could be a Dakimura, no? Am I alone in this? I could see that. Please don't leave me alone. <laughs> Kinda of figured out it's easier to draw on paper than on my digital setup for the time being, since it doesn't have to be plugged into the wall and all. By the way, I just had three captures straight asking me to identify rugby balls. Amazing. Ah, well, they gotta keep with the football-esque theme we have, so... Is the Mega Man X VOD beyond uploading? Oh, that's been uploaded for weeks. Yeah, that's been up for weeks on the, on the YouTube channel. Thank you, guy. By the way, this is a very lovely flare, John. And yes, this was March's alt of the month, which we've now shifted to Peach, John. Which is why I'm gonna leap up here for a second and jump to this one here from Rhyme. Yo, so I got to draw the alt of the month this time around. We had an immediate idea when Peach John came up with Aelita recruiting Gex to do the lines. Plus, it seemed funny that a Mario alt that isn't Rosa John came up for an April Fool's kind of alt. Had a lot of fun drawing her. Also, happy April Fool's. Oh, God damn it! There it is. I was waiting for the animation. I knew it had to happen at some point. It had to happen. I also have April Fools. I will go help Peach John get into the Buru somehow. Do not judge me, chat. Is she not getting into the Buru because she's too fucking wide to get through the door? Is that not a bustle? Is that what we're assuming? I'm assuming based on the whoa mama from Rhyme's face that that is the case. I also forgot to add the OG all creator is Mud Kiplings. Thank you, Mud Kip. And there's the Peach John wiki page as well. Thank you, Rhyme. Oh my god. I knew I knew there was too much detail in the top half that I'm like, there's gonna be a pan or something. It has to be. And since it's April 1st, let's go to the egg packs. April Fool's joke from Princess Skylar. It is the gremlin takeover, Square. Fear us for our smallness, for, for we are growing in our numbers. You can't stop it, but not in height. Womp womp. The egg pack mod team came to me wishing for me to draw them as gremlins for this year's April Fool's event, which I heavily enjoyed drawing these little gremmies. That's also the reason why I wasn't so active here lately and also a little burnt out, so hopefully I can come back soon finishing up a sort of poster design I had in mind for good old Rosa. And by the way, they didn't have to, but they also showed their support for these works as well. Because of it, I was able to afford a necklace so I could propose to my partner, which they said yes, and I'm now officially engaged. Yo, shit, congrats! Hell yeah! Yeah. Nice! We're gonna wait a bit before deciding on a date so we can afford it along with finding places that allow poly marriages since there aren't too many in the USA, but other than that, I'm really, really, really happy. Thank you to the Egg Pack Mod team for giving me the opportunity for them, and thank you all for the support on my works as well. It means so, so much. As long as I can make people laugh and smile and have a good old time, that makes me even more happy. P.S. And anyone curious at all, this was a necklace I got for him since we talked about it on numerous occasions, but it perfectly sums up how grimy we both are. An Etsy listing for a mac and cheese necklace. Hang on. Let me, let me make sure this is safe to show. And I will show this. Mac and cheese. Man, I've had some mac and cheese in a hot minute. Come on, some now. Look safe. I'm just making sure I'm not showing like my PO box or something, or my postal code or something like that. Yeah. There it is. It's literally a bowl of mac and cheese. <laughs> oh, that's cool. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. I'm just hearing Liz in the background. <laughs> Congrats again, Skylar. All right, what do we got here? We got the Pack Bear, unedited bear. I Miku Lass, Ailita, Pengi Man, Eudiptes, Tuba Queen, Felina. Whoa, Mecca. Look at his queen, Kid Ark. Benui, Lucy, aka Mooch. The Dwagon, Cupo. Mother of Beef, Rhyme. You grinding my gears, Time Thief. Boobs are cool, Jumney. It's wizard time, motherfucker, Bubba. Not a mod, just a gram. The Gremlin Army Leader, Gram herself, aka Skylar. Bowser Goat Cole, listen to my mixtape, Maniacal. And I don't know Moth. why that's mine, but sure. And Moth Camille. <laughs> thank you for making, thank, thanks for making these for us. Thanks for the opportunity. I'd love to do this again for you all. Question, how do we change back? <laughs> you don't, you sealed your fucking fate. <laughs> oh no. Sorry, I had to find out this way. What were we gonna say, Maniacal? Hmm? Oh no, you're fine. I, I, I was just like, kind of like, I, I found it funny. I was just like, mixtape, but all right, <laughs> sure. For the last time, dude, we're not gonna buy it. Stop asking. Oh, please buy I it. I don't care about your mixtape. Please buy it. It's the only way to turn him back. Egg pack, gram pack. This is also the banner I was left responsible for. Sometimes gremlins just want to see the world burn. I like how cute I made Rosa look. She looks so ha surprised and like a little impressed, I think, at the nukes in your eyes. Thank you, Skyler, for both of these. 
Next up from Germany, it's Chibi Rosa to go along with the gremlins. Fitting timing for that. Thank you for the very cute gremlin. All right, the, I guess the very cute Chibi, because I said gremlin because of everyone. I guess, yeah, gremlin Chibi, close enough. Thank you, Germany. Next up from Queen Autumn, fuck yeah, it's done. Finally finished! I enjoyed working on this so much, my favorite being that background. All together, it took 12 hours to finish this. I hope you all enjoy the final piece. There's the entire Coliseum crew, just chilling, having a good time. I mean, this is bas this is the entire last segment, basically, because there's the carpet cutouts in the back, the ones in the front. This is the ending crew of Mario Party. There's all the little figures, the spray bottle. There's the, the Care Bear, the Light Bright, which didn't even light up that well. The fucking monitor in the back. And there's the back of the bus crew and everything. Everyone's having a great time. Autumn, you did an amazing job on this. Fuck yeah. Thank you so much. I like, yeah, it, someone in chat says Tim looks so concerned. He does look like he's about to poop. But he also looked pretty stern in his actual, like, one, two, so it works out. And we'll end our block on this one here. This incredible one done by Mika. Might be a little late, but I wanted to hop on the swimsuit train. Mika, goddamn. I saw this on Twitter before the stream started. You did an incredible job on this one. I, she looks amazing. You did such a good fucking job on this. Thank you so much for this. I also like how this is becoming, I guess, her swimsuit now? Because this is what, like the fifth person, sixth person that's drawn her in this? Somewhere like that? Either way, thank you, Mika. Nicely done. And that is Art Block. We'll get to the rest later. You know, actually, I could keep stalling now that I think about it. <laughs> what? Just remember, just no. remember what I was going back to. You know what? And I'm going to do that. <laughs> Wait, John, but my game. All right, everybody. How's it going? Sorry I'm a bit late. Uh, my computer exploded again. So, you know, we're here. That's what matters, right? Well, today, uh, on this April 1st, uh, we are going to be playing one of my favorite games. I know you guys were probably expecting some fortune cookie and stuff, but the fortune cookie, uh, you know, system just isn't working today. So, we're just gonna try and wing it! So, um, uh, let, should we get into it right away? Should we not just waste any time and just get right into the game? Uh, alright, so... Uh, as you can see, we are in fact playing my favorite game, Superman 64. Now, did you guys know in short time, that your fate will in, be sealed, uh, Superman. Eric Kane, who is the French developer of Titus Interactive, he was the one that actually garnered the rights for the game uh, then from there's no WB time to waste. licensing. Oh, Luther, if you want to save your friend, solve my maze. What a glorious game this is, and all of you know that I absolutely love this game with every fiber of my being. Uh, now, did you guys know that this game was in fact based on the animated series of Superman, and that the development lasted two years for it? Uh, initially, they were going to go for a style of gameplay uh, that only Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider uh, from 1996 had tried before, a 3D open world action adventure game. Uh, but as you can see, they added this wonderful and glorious section of flying through the rings, which I know you know we all love. Oh! So, that, guys, that was so much fun. But I think right now we just need to quickly uh, go to an intermission. All right, let's just quickly switch up to our intermission. Give me one sec. My intermission screen is broken, as you can see. It's all right. It. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. All right. I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Thank you guys for waiting. So, 
Uh, you guys guessed it, it's art time. But we're gonna do something a little bit different today. So normally we go to the bar, bagel, bagel. You can't go outside. We're gonna do something different today. Uh, the Baru, unfortunately, the server went down. Uh, so instead of looking at the art that you guys gave me, I went ahead and made something for you guys. And what else could I do except draw the lovely Rosa John? So are you all ready to see my interpretation of Rosa John? This is for you, chat. This is for you. All right! What do you guys think? I worked really hard on this. Uh, as you can see, it is in fact Rosa John. And she's looking lovely today. Now, as some of you know, Easter's coming up. It's just next week, in fact. And so you know what? I wanted to also do a drawing of her in her best Easter dress, chat. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Look at her! In her best Easter dress. Rosa John, looking fantastic. I hope you like that, chat. All right, so that uh, concludes the art block for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. We're going to go back to a, a quick intermission here in just a moment. Um, I wanted to thank you guys again for joining me today on this April 1st. Uh, and I'm Tom. Tom, what are you doing in my house? I forgot how fast that cuts off at the end. So that was how we started the stream today for those that are coming in that came in late. All right. I stalled as long as I could. Let's get back to this damn shuffler. Let's go. Uh, oh my god. Alright. Alright, so if you came in late, uh, we're doing a cursed shuffler tonight. Or sorry, a perfectly normal shuffler tonight. Where uh, 24 of the mods and COCOM crew have picked games that I didn't know about. <coughs> oh, where? Oh, because I paused, paused. Yeah. They, I, I went in with a blind list of games, basically, for a shuffler, and it's changing anywhere from 30 seconds to 3 minutes randomly to another one of them. And they've right. all been... bangers? I did the same thing last time, didn't I? There's oh, still no. a couple we haven't seen yet, too. Yeah, there's still yeah. at least three we haven't seen. I hope Dance shows up again so I can see if it actually works properly. <laughs> we have to, like, <laughs> That's it. true, it never came back! So, John, what's your favorite one that's showed up so far? In the sense that it's actually like a game I would play? Bad Dudes, maybe? Yeah, I think Tenmar kind of took it easy on you. Tenmar took it the easiest, ironically, yeah. Uh, Allison might might have as well, because I, like I said, I've beaten... I've beaten Page Master before, but it has been a while. Mm -hmm. I kind of got you out of your tank. A-B-B-A. A-B-B-A. Oh, it has to be like three times, but I'm back. Oh, Jungle Book's also not that bad, too, because it's another one from my oh, childhood yeah. beat. Jungle Book. Yeah, I played it for the Genesis. It's a different game, but, like, it's not that bad. There's just some nasty platforming later. My, my, my man just, like, ate an entire watermelon in one bite. Oh, my God. He's a hungry boy. You know, you know, there's a snake later on, but I guess Mowgli was the real snake after all. I don't think snakes eat watermelon. I mean, they swallow things whole. Watermelon could be basically you swallowed whole. Mowgli does it. How many snakes have you seen eat a watermelon? Uh, personally, none. I could, they swallow eggs, yeah. Like, an egg is just, like, a pre-watermelon. Ah, the classic. Sonic Genesis. Yes. Oh, I'll go Get for it. the special stage. I'm trying! It wouldn't let me! Oh, that's right, <laughs> because it, like, it cuts you off really fast in this version. Right, right, I forgot about that. Yeah, so, after the adjustments, this is just to get to, like, Marble Zone Act 3. Okay. Bit... Meds, why? This isn't mine. You still haven't seen mine yet. Yeah, this was Cole's. Hit. Are you too maniacal? Yeah, it's a, it okay. says reconnecting. It is. It is trying okay. to restart. 
Okay, I thought that was like my internet. I was like, uh, did I, I thought it was it? too because my, mine's been acting kind of weird lately. Yeah. No, you guys are so good. Don't worry. All right. Yeah, you can't go back once you're going on that side. Nope. How a bummer, dude. Cole, I literally put in the thing we could have added rum hacks. God, apparently, I, I guess next time we just need to be like better about like adding people. Honestly. Oh, for fuck's sake. Who's left on the list? Shamrock. This this is Shamrock's. This, yeah, I was like, this has to be Shamrock. So me and Mayo are the only ones you haven't seen yet. Yep. Shrek Swamp Cart Speedway. <laughs> what is this Mario like, ass giant... music? You must be... bobblehead Shrek. Shrek. Oh my gosh, his head is so big. Princess Fiona. The the Hangman. I can't remember his name. Thelonious. Uh, Gnome, the gingerbread man, the three little pigs, three blind Wait, mice. Why is there a gnome? Goldilocks. Trouble Stiltskin, I think. I don't know. I mean, honestly, I would have picked him, but his handling is garbage, so I'm actually going to pick Fiona because she's actually got the most balanced stats. Yeah. Swamp Rally. Let's do it. Shrek's Bag and Bayou. So for this, I wrote down all Swamp Rally and Forest Run courses. We'll see how, like, the Swamp Rally goes. I don't recall these courses being that long. I tested, like, most of the games. I know this was one I tested for sure. Oh, God. <laughs> it turns to a pumpkin. And it reverses the controls <laughs> when that happens, too. Now I have a pumpkin shield. Red shells. And a glass slipper, apparently. What do you think that does? It's the star, I bet. I you become Cinderella, parts. and then you just plow through the course. <laughs> There's the star. Dang. A star, I guess. What do you mean there are multiple Shrek racing games? Yeah. <laughs> of course. Tiny Fiona. Tiny. Oh, back to space. Okay, so for this one, Bub was saying how, like, if you don't remember, you can go back to your command and they'll tell you what you need to do. The briefing room, the I briefing think? Briefing room, yes. Set course for Codus MV... Um, Codus Mu 6. Director Tilleris is one of the Federation's top archaeologists. It sounds like she could be in real trouble. Codus Mu 6. Codus Mu 6. quietest game in the world, dude. <laughs> oh Let's my go. gosh, there is audio. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Boom! Engage. Engage. Emblem, engage. I'm still sad there's no Riker maneuver. Look, he's just he's just sitting there normally. Damn. <laughs> You're in warp. Computers. Password system. Engineering. Guess we're doing okay. Guess so. Transporter room. Cow. Cow. See, Communications. You can go a bit faster. What? Hey, uh, when you're selecting your destination, I believe left or right will actually allow you to go faster or slower. Oh, he's right, actually. Uh... Oh, you're right. This oh, warp will so damage the engines. I didn't realize you're waiting to get to your destination right now. Yeah. Yes. Oh, that's hilarious. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're there. Like I said, I'm pretty sure. Oops. Um. Um, I'm pretty sure. I think uh, I, cha I, think I changed my location by by accident here. Whoop! Nope. And now my game's changed on purpose. You definitely changed your location. Yeah, my game is a lot nicer than the others. No, I did not pick Battletoads. That's a game I enjoy. 
Wow. You picking a good game? No. I like how Battletoads is the marker for the good games. Yeah. I love Battletoads. I mean, I do too, but I'm just it's saying. Bullshit, like, it's bullshit, but that's I love just it. the kind of night and night we have. I think this game's come up the most, huh? I think so. I kept typing ABBA a ton there and it did not work, so I guess you have to do it at a certain rhythm. I guess so, yeah. I could believe that. On player two? No, it doesn't have to be player two. Because we already used it once. The code does Correct. work on player one. Maybe you have to sing Dancing Queen while you're actually doing it. That's not even my favorite what? ABBA song. Well, unfortunately for you, that's the one they programmed into the game, so you're going to have to deal with it. John, you've played Z Delete 1 on stream. Gar Planes is just Dancing Queen. <laughs> is it? What? Yeah, there, okay, there are, like, elements of Gar Planes that is very similar to Dancing Queen by ABBA. This, this is news to me. Like, that's like a mashup on like, YouTube, I'm pretty sure. So what's the story of this game anyways? Uh, Ralph and Clark are the Akari Warriors. They're, they're going into enemy lines to stop the bad guys. That's pretty, that's a pretty good know. story. Yeah. yeah. So, Maniacal, I have a question. Mm -hmm. What's up? So my game, uh, technically there is no uh, you win scenario. The uh, manual defines any game over is an actual win. <laughs> what, what's, you game did it! Want a game over in, like, uh, Star Trek? Am I understanding that right? Yeah. So uh, fastest way to die wins. <laughs> fastest way to kill your crew. <laughs> uh, no, the fastest way is actually to get a court martial. You can get fucking oh. court martial? Yeah, on the first mission. What the fuck? We gotta figure out how to get court martialed, dude. We might need to. <laughs> that's, that's a way funnier objective. Man, I remember playing like a little bit like the newest Killer Instinct one time, and I just never went back to it. New Killer Instinct is good. I was liking like when I was playing with the tutorial. It seemed neat. New one's like the 2013 one or whatever, right? Yeah. <laughs> newest 10 years ago. I was gonna say, I thought... I didn't remember one coming out. For some reason in my head, I mix up Mortal Kombat and Killer Instinct every once in a while. I can see why you say that. Winner! Player one. Jago! The only thing I, the only thing I know about the new Killer Instinct is that Rash is in it. Correct. Yeah, like Rash, General Rom from Years of War, the yeah. Arbiter from Halo. They, they I didn't know that. They started sort of making it into like season two or three. Basically, started trying to make like a Smash Brothers esque version. That's I mean, sick. Which is like, like Microsoft guest characters. But I see what you mean. Oh yeah, because I guess it's Rare owned, so it would be Microsoft. Yeah. yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Although Rare didn't work on it, it was um, yeah, but Iron Galaxy and they own the property. Over. This is what fight three of this. Four, five. How many fights does he have to win for a victory? Eight or nine? Nine was the imaginary number that I came up with in my head, so... Nine is like the was like the total amount of guys like on the right. Winner! Combo! TJ Combo, like the best fucking theme in the new Killer Instinct. Master Combo! Back to Rise. So if you're buying Combo and you kill Combo, does that make you a Combo Breaker? Yes. yes. They actually named a Combo Breaker after him, if you can believe it. Yeah, one dude beat him so bad, and they're like, dude, you broke him! Like, wait a sec. <laughs> Winner! Supreme victory! Alright, who's next? Thunder! Thunder. You're making your way through this one. Yeah. I actually beat this one pretty well, quickly. Well, Thunder is usually the one that messed me up when I used to play the SNES one, so let's see here. I might get walled here now. I mean, yeah, I can tell. You're doing the try and true method, just punch oh, over hey, and Mads, over. hey, Mads, your game finally came up. Hey! Well, the state. 
Alright. Oh, the fuck Sonic off! MZ! <laughs> Underwater <laughs> Metropolis Zone. Good luck. You know, I was actually expecting Sonic XL. No, that's, no, too, that's easy. too easy. People know about that, that one. Nobody knows about this one. So this is Metropolis Zone. All of it's underwater. I went the extra mile, though, and used a level select code to get you a bunch more lives. Thank God the rest of the game was not underwater. <laughs> <laughs> so you have 24 lives and, like, I don't know, 10 continues? Jesus. Thank you, Matt. See if we can beat all Metropolis. Because Matt's light and no Oh, really man, this is, this is bad. Gross, this stage already <laughs> sucks on a good day. So now I have to deal with it being slow and hey, air. It's only one stage, though. Well, I mean, it's the whole, it, it's three acts. But I mean, it, you know, all you got to do is just beat Metropolis Zone. It's easy. Yeah, so we have one good game in here, Sonic 2. <laughs> Funny enough, I think they actually changed the physics a little bit. Because whenever I was playing the game normally, like, it was a little bit off. It definitely does not feel right. We could have gone, like, Sonic 2 Forces Edition. That would have been funny. That was my other choice. Oh, that's so unfair. <sighs> oh, and it, it doesn't even hit zero. It just, it's, oh. <laughs> oh. That happens because the screen wraps around in Metropolis Zone. Back to Bill and Ted. Your friend Bill asked me to give you one of these highly dangerous textbooks. Get away from me, kid. You're bothering me. All right. Gotta get that concert, man. This is weird. There's so no only... music anymore in Bill and Ted for some reason. Can't go I was wondering. Mayos. I love his walk. Well, welcome, handsome, to Miss Fifi Saloon and Bingo Parlor. We have the finest games of chance gathered from all parts of the continent. And so, handsome, which game would you like to play? The one that allows you to instantly beat the game. Yeah, yeah. Why was so cursed with these like shelfers, by the way? His stuff like always like shows up last or never shows up. <laughs> Feels so bad. <laughs> Ma'am, how do I? You you offered gambling. How do I gamble? Don't you know you're like that's like a bad idea. I mean, it might actually let me make progress in the game, though. Oh, found the music. Hey! Oh, but, I, I, I oh. Know. oh, wait, no. Never mind. Kind of froze up for a second. I thought it was switching. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been a great time. It would be funny. I love... Dude, look at his fucking moon shoes activate. Cats have been grassed over some reason. That's how I was feeling about, like, the... There's some grass the... you can step on. Oh, <laughs> like, this grass... Because I'm that... Oh, I jumped the wrong way. Getting hurt? I don't. I don't know. I don't think I have a health mirror as much as I just have coins. Radical Rex. Radical now Re you do. This song is perfect, or the game is perfect for the intro. Absolutely. So this is my game from a childhood of mine. From a childhood of yours, you had multiple. Yeah. I'm jealous. I I'm on my third myself. Yeah. <laughs> you guys getting all these extra childhoods. Share it with the rest of the class. Man, oh. I earned it. Yeah, I earned mine. I'm sorry. You saying <laughs> I, I haven't fucking earned an extra childhood? Goddamn. What do you, you know how many lives I'm living right now? Like fucking a thousand plus, according to the Buru. I mean, there's some childs in there. Children, I think, is the word you wanted. <laughs> no, some childs. There are some <laughs> childs in the Buru. <laughs> Are so, we sure about that? So I was about to say, like, I thought my game choice is actually pretty easy, honestly. Um, it's not really terrible, it's just difficult, because one thing about this game that it's a real pain in the ass, it makes you play this game twice. Really? Yes. But here's the other thing. Uh, you go through one through like one through five, but then it makes you go backwards through five through ten. But the whole level, the all the levels are different, but you still get the environment. So essentially, you're going forward and then you're walking backwards just to beat the game. So, 
I'm not really expecting you to really beat this because I know the second half of the game does get bullshit. So. I love his kick. Got the like, kicks of the days. Yeah, the radical Rex kick, yeah. I love that his kick also like moves automatically too. Like it's like a mini jump. Oh, <laughs> I so, thought that was you. No. So. Okay, well, that's a. Hey, back here. Bye. Bye. Some strange by Bye. a tree near the stable. There, there was a tree? There was a stable? Heard something strange can be found up north. Your friend Bill asked me to give you one of these highly dangerous textbooks. Are these textbooks supposed to be in uh, your inventory? Have we seen all the games yet? No, Dan's hasn't come back since we fixed it. And, uh... Miles. Oh, Dan's is back. <laughs> Hey, it works. Dead Yay, powers. Deadly powers. It's time for Deadly Towers. Oh, boy. Oh, I know this game now. Yep. <laughs> uh, go for this one. It wasn't too bad. I'm seeing at least by... Where was it? Hey, hang on, where to go? Buy at least one item from three separate shopkeepers. From three separate shopkeepers. Yes. I figured, like, eh, there's not, like, a weird sort of way of progression. Might be better just go, like, buying things for stuff. And back to Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th. Haven't seen this in a bit. The knife. Uh, kids need saving. Save them kids. John. Come on, George. Are, are, you, are you the hero of children? Sure. Yeah. I guess? <laughs> How am I supposed to answer that, water. Maniacal? My god! What do you mean? I just... It's a yes or no question. I guess! I just, this is not a question you normally ask people! That's what I'm here I for. I fucking Gamera? Do you want to be Gamera? Oh, I don't want to be this, I'll tell you that much! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even see how you got here! <laughs> oh no! Is everyone a question, Maniacal? Mm. Why? <laughs> now that's a question oh, I I ask a lot about Maniacal. Why? Well, he's call him Gamera Alita. <laughs> Gamera, wait, what? Gamera Alita. <laughs> oh, that's you. Friend of all children. Gamera Alita. Yeah, you're a friend of children. <laughs> okay, I'm done with that. <laughs> I must save all the children. I think. I think some Windows update I did, like, change my volume settings because everyone's way louder than normal. Perhaps. Oh, really? Yeah, there you go. I bumped you down, too, so that should balance it all out. Now there's some Discord update or some Windows, Windows update. Uh, let's uh, <laughs> what? No. You sing a dancing uh, wind queen? Because he's young and sweet, only 17. I got it in my head now, dude. <laughs> oh, no, Allison, why'd you remind me of fucking Washington? He'll save children, but not the British children. He'll save children, but not the British children. I have with my, my friend and old roommate who actually didn't even show me that in the first place. Like, just this week. Mm -hmm. God. It's too good. So many fucking memories. That motherfucker had like 30 goddamn dicks. What? That's Wait, part of the what? song from Washington. Yeah, I, I actually. I heard thought... that motherfucker had like 30 goddamn dicks. I'm just going to say I thought I was going to be off the table because the rule of you only do Kaizo for charity now. It's not Kaizo, it's frustration. It's not, this is not Kaizo, yes, yeah, frustration is different. I'm sorry, this is Kaizo enough. I keep seeing the life counter as a bed. <laughs> Are you sure that's actually part of the song, John? Oh, I am 100%. That is not a thing you would forget about that song. In fact, this, I'm, this I'm gonna prove this. I'm proving this right now. Mario's gonna keep dying so I can prove this. Oh. Allison just linked it. Is this anything like uh, the, the Grandpa's bed in Stardew Valley where he has like multiple resting places? Yes. Here we go, where, where is the part? He's coming, he's coming, he's coming. Did I mention his four nuts? Well, he also had four dicks. If you took off his boots, you'd see the dicks growing off his feet. It's too early I in the morning for this. It's never too early like for this. 30 goddamn dicks. There you go. I, I heard that motherfucker <laughs> had like 30 goddamn dicks. Telling you. <laughs> what a rush me on my, my internet lore knowledge. How dare. 
How dare. <laughs> You've been right here long enough. If you're wondering what this is, uh, Brad Neely did this. It's called George Washington. George Washington. They, did a, they did a couple, but the Washington one's, I think, the most famous one. I love Chip and Dale. Okay, there we go. It is up and to the right to actually throw. Yeah. Gross. Oh, yep. no. I mean, it's already bad enough left on the D-pad is jump. Oh, that's yeah. the only that's the only pick it up if you're on the right side of it, by the way. You need to do, like, I guess up and left for, uh... No, it's down, down and right to pick up from the left. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. Down left, then. Down left to pick up from the from the left and up. Sorry, down right to pick up from the left. Up right to pick up from the left. Or from the, God, I can't even do it. <laughs> I will say this choice was made purely to annoy you. <laughs> it's working. <laughs> yeah, I mean, good job. I don't know what else to think. I remember I had this lying around. Like you know what, this is perfect. I'm... I love the skinny little Mega Man sprite. <laughs> so skinny, dude. <laughs> I'm glad not, I went low balls because that you... means Sean is, isn't going to want to kill me at the end of this. Yeah, Bubba, you, you play it somehow safe by comparison. <laughs> I don't know what else I would have gone if it wasn't Mega Man here. So since mine came up, the reason I picked Friday the 13th that was the only bad game I could think of. Thanks, AVGN. Yeah, it's not even that bad of a game, all things considered. A part of me almost wanted Jackie Chan. I got—I feel like I got that already. It's to be too easy. Hey, yeah, it's too easy. Yeah, exactly. I—I got—I got I to go with the unexpected shit like this. Nobody would have ever expected this. True, I didn't. I've never heard of this hack, so. I got this because I think from like Okami Games like years ago. Because I think they did oh, it for like, something. Of course, Nick. God, I hate controlling this with like an Xbox D pad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got the Xbox. <laughs> also, those apples being blue now, I wonder what they taste like. Blue apples. Blueberries. Blue apple. Little black apple. Apples. Wait, that Oh, means thank God, somebody like controls these. better. A, a hack. <laughs> he says that he almost falls into a pit because his jump wasn't red. I never thought someone would describe this game as a game that controls better than anything else. <laughs> oh my god. I would Mega Man 12 and not like this. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's an Xbox One D-pad. I'm not using like a fucking the weird circle pad on the Xbox oh, okay. X. Like it's a decent D-pad. Yeah. I thought you were talking like a 360 D-pad. <laughs> I'm like, ew. The blue apple makes you shrink to the size of a chipmunk for five seconds? For five seconds? Okay. What is the slowdown? <laughs> How did you not get hit? Okay, never mind. I'm more confused. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, yeah, that didn't damage somehow. It's <laughs> neat. Wait. Dude, does I love game have? Does this game have the warps? Uh, I, I think I'm gonna try. It. Oh God damn it! Apparently, it was not active. I hate when I think little, it like... just ended. Damn yeah. it! No. Ah, oh, that's something better. <laughs> oh yeah, shit! Where do I need to hit it for the strike? Oh. <laughs> so I guess I should explain why I picked my game. Uh, why it's not? the. It's the first licensed game I ever played, mm -hmm. and the reason why I'm like, let's just go for any game over, because the space combat kind of sucks. It's kind of top-down, you have tank, your ship has tank controls, and generally, uh, the RNG is, unless you can get them to surrender and heal, you will die because... As soon as you blow up the first ship, uh, nine times out of ten, you get a second ship to uh, spawn in e immediately. That sounds like fun. Yeah. So the only way to actually make progress is to get the enemy to ship to surrender, then go into engineering, heal your ship, and sit there until everything's healed. The only one you don't ever need to touch is communications, because 
all that does is affect the viewing screen when people are talking to you. But even if it's completely destroyed, you'll still can go to briefing room. Uh, hey, which pin did I hit that knocked them all down? Or most of them? I was gonna say, what's going on here? Are you playing like a whole 10 frames or what? No, I have I have two hits to knock down the entire group, and I have to figure out where do I have to hit the 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 pins to actually make them do that. Of course, it's Orb 3D, mm. so nothing is really that standard. I gotta go to Vern's. Mr. Burns. How do you go to Burns in this it's game? It's literally just the B button. God damn it. Uh, I'm saying boo Burns. <laughs> You're like closing off gas on you? Like, what's happening here? Yeah, it's, it's all on a oh, timer. Oh, you can eat. You have, to, you have to go through those, like, doorways to get gas, which is your mm -hmm. health. It also said you could Good start eat. there. Oh, because it's just it's just a gas station, that's the joke. That's a good start. Aren't you happy you have spin dash this time? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? It's better than the original version because you have iframes off of spikes, so Oh yeah. That's true. I was trying to remember if this had that or not. This is this is a, this is a functionally better Sonic one as a result of that. Well It's not saying much. <laughs> I say Sonic One is Sonic One. More so, like there's there's other things this version fucks up. <laughs> really? I think it's fine. L lest we forget trying to escape <laughs> the uh, the the aquatic stage. Oh, aquatic mine. This is bad. Aquatic aquatic mine. That's adventure too. <laughs> anyway, friend. time to take a dive through aquatic mine. Gonna kill Knuckles. I'm my name's Knuckles. <laughs> My name's Muck, oh, not wait, I'm being Knuckles murdered. is playing that stage! <laughs> <laughs> I want my emerald. still haven't gotten the gameplay of this yet. Yeah, what's going on here? That's a great question, honestly. I, I loved how Gandalf's face was just a black hole. I need to watch these movies, man. <laughs> <laughs> They'll probably look better than this. You shall not pass! The One Ring. Yeah, isn't that the thing on uh, Lucasfilm's hand? Yeah, dude, stole it from Gollum. When when did my wife steal Gollum's ring? Uh, you know, last Thursday. Oh, okay. When they were hanging out, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. He didn't see. Sh it was all over Twitter. Shamrock yeah. says, "I'm not sorry." I mean, yours seems a little more playable, Shamrock, than some of the other options. Yeah, I had no clue uh, Kaizo was on the table. This game is okay, but no manga is better. I'm surprised someone didn't actually give me Kaizo. I... Yeah, it's too easy. People were being nice to you on this one. Like, no Kaizo. I don't know. I wouldn't say they were being nice. <laughs> nice? Is this what you call nice? Manai? Nice is a relative term. Oh my god, I can actually move. Oh my god, I'm actually in control, finally. Let's go. Freedom! Absolutely Here comes the game. The game. It's time for game. Wow, this is taking a while to save. There we go. No, I no, I still wanted to play. <laughs> Imagine if it starts you over. Shall we play a game, John? I want to play a game. Frodo, 11 HP, 4 sword. I've got the yeah, one let's ring. Go to, let's go to Frodo's letterbox. Can I, can I drop the one ring? Nope. Why would Proto have a litter box? Oh, it's just a gold coin. That was a huge coin. A gold yeah, coin? Dude. That's worth three bronze coins. There's no, no silver in this world? Oh my god, it's fucking isometric tank controls. Ew. Ew. This, this is me holding up. This no. is me holding down. He has to rotate That's before gross. he can do either. Ew. I have never that? heard of isometric tank controls. <laughs> That's disgusting. Why? Of the choice there, huh? At least it's not maniacal hat. What's wrong with my game? Uh, do you want me to be Damn serious? It. Damn it! Get that! Get it! Get it! Get that soda! Get the soda! Nope. Soda. Soda, 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 soda. 
Thank you. I was waiting for that. <laughs> I love this thing everywhere now. Soda, soda, so, 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 soda. It's so oh, funny because like I only was hearing that amongst like a small group of friends, and now it's just spread. <laughs> no, that was a that was a meme for quite a while. Was the soda thing? No, I like, know, I know, but it's like. Uh, I, I guess like I don't really heard it amongst like some friends, and then yeah, it's not just here. Every everywhere. time I see this game, I just keep thinking back to uh, the dirty cartridge edition. Yeah, that's what I mentioned earlier. Was like that. That's what we when we played before was the dirty cartridge version. I think they call it batter dudes in that one. And also, uh, what was it, Burger Time or something? <laughs> yep, Cole, that's the, that's the tweet. Yes, I love that tweet. President Biden just BLJ up the stairs. <laughs> Have you guys so, seen, uh, <laughs> <laughs> seen Leon accepting the mission from Biden? Because that was my favorite one recently. That's another good one. Yeah. All <laughs> oh, right, I forgot you were racist. Not anymore, sir. I speak Spanish now. <laughs> <laughs> that line killed me when I first heard it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I did not see that one. <laughs> Let me see if I can find it. Hang on. <laughs> You guys been seeing like the Rat Ashley going around like, recently? Rat as well. Ashley's been pretty funny too. Yeah. yeah. I think a couple of people in the community have been drawing that too. I know Otaku did. <laughs> what have you played Resident Evil 4 Remake? The only thing that changed was the fact that Ashley's just a little tiny mouse who just wants some cheese. I was wondering what was going on with that mouse. Yep. People people just wanted that little, little mouse Ashley get some cheese. I wonder... I haven't actually seen a full playthrough of it. And I'm probably not going to get the game. Um, so I have no idea if Ashley is more or less annoying. And, Annoying uh, less. She still has her moments, though. I know there's um, Maximilian's playthrough. She definitely ran right in front of her his rifle and died instantly from it. From a fucking yep. headshot. <laughs> I love stuff like that, dude. <laughs> There was another video I saw of someone who was just like really into like the zone of Resident Evil 4 killing a bunch of like zombies and stuff. Ashley walks in front and they just shoot her in the head. It's like, oh crap. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Leon uh, Biden thing. Oh no. I'm, Leon, back to this. I'm kind of curious how they're going to remake, what changes they would do to Resident Evil 5. John, can you do me a favor? What's that? Can you check if Myos is in that fucking folder? Because he needs to know that it should be in there. Hang on. Yeah? I know. For Game Boy okay. Color file. Yeah, I know for a fact it's there. It's just like, where the fuck is it? <laughs> I have a feeling I know what Myos' game is. Game Boy Color file? You'll see. That's, uh. Alright, I guess we went with that choice then. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um. Hmm. I'll be real, we went for that because I accidentally replaced it and I forgot I did it till it was too late, so I, I guess we're running that one now. Cool. Well, I tried, John. I tried. <laughs> In a good way or a bad way? No Just... comment. Uh, yes. He pleads the pimp. <laughs> and and he's gone. Okay, Zero does actually still oh. give me time. Okay. Yeah, you get, you get a little bit of time at Zero. Oh. I will say there is a correct path. Uh, some paths, I, I really only noticed it in Act 1, but there are some paths that you go down that just don't have bubbles. I, I'm trying to Rude. say- My problem is I, I can't I literally react to these enemies. I, there's, because you slow down in water. Oh, don't worry, even when the water's not there, you can't react to them. <laughs> Pretty it's Metropolis much. Zone. <laughs> yep. Out. And the winner for worst enemy in Metropolis Zone goes to all of them. Yeah, all uh, of them is the correct answer. I would have said the water. Well, that's not normally in Metropolis Zone, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, where am I supposed to go? It was like CODIS Moo. Moo 6. We need court martialed, though. That, that's our main goal right now. CODIS Moo 6. Yeah. Am I am I there now? It looks like yeah, engage impulse. Yeah, uh, you went to six alpha. You want to go to regular six? Did I go to six alpha? I didn't even. No, see you actually you went oh. to. Uh, sh one of the binds should allow you to go back one. 
Hit me. Yeah, yeah press speed engage impulse. Hey, there we are. I played this enough, uh, the first mission enough to know exactly what it looks like. <sighs> oh. All right. Well, I gotta have Riker. Um, my recommendations would be Data. Data's already in my team. How do I, how do I pick Warp. people? Because it's it's staying on just the one. It should. I think Select. you have to do. Uh, All right, well, uh, never mind. There's a. I guess that party's going down. <laughs> All right. How do we get court marshaled? Uh, there's a person you're supposed to rescue. Instead of rescuing them, uh, shoot them with the phaser. Perfect. We're on a mission to kill. <laughs> Riker's on a spree. <laughs> I was going to say, phaser's on stun or a kill? Uh, that's a good question. I I would assume kill at this. Yeah, I would definitely say kill. I would assume kill. <laughs> it's really funny what said it to me. All right, boys. Phaser's on kill. <laughs> Come on, Jordy. Let's go. So the two important What is characters... this Doug ass music here? <laughs> uh one of your binds on your should open. Hang on a second. Uh, if we were casually showing this off and not in the shuffler, I'd say Hey, could you do me a favor? Become Beverly and just kill yourself. Jesus. No, it's kind of funny because Beverly, when any of the uh, non ensigns uh, get injured, Beverly is healing uh, them. I mean, she's uh, a doctor. When, Bev <laughs> when Beverly's the one that gets cuffed, it's they transposed the face of one of the. <laughs> Other doctors onto Beverly's face. Oh. Ah. Oops, my shoes. No, time for more page master. Oh, I think I have a weapon now, actually. Yes, I do. I have a weapon. I have a weapon and high jump. So what do the keys do? Um, I think they're like your coin equivalents. Uh, how do I wall jump again? I don't remember here. There we go. A very sparkly jump. It smells fun! Yeah, this yeah, video yeah, game yeah. is fun! Uh, how many capital letters of fun are we having? I think the FU is there at least. Three. <laughs> capital uh, punishments of fun. Capital foo. Anybody has capital punishment? I should look that up. I'm actually curious now. What? I just realized the irony because Little Foo is the one that picked this. I'm sorry, Allison. <laughs> oh, yeah. capital is okay. <laughs> oh, oh, tank, tank. And is for no survivors when you. Plankton. Yeah. <laughs> What, what, Dalton? <laughs> you were looking up capital punishment. Look, I got curious about capital punishment. I wasn't sure. <laughs> as you, as you do <laughs> on a regular basis. Sometimes you're just wondering, like, what's it like being capitally punished? <laughs> you really don't know. Oh, what wow, they're really angry. They <laughs> angry. <laughs> <laughs> What about lowercase punishment? <laughs> Not as good as that. Uh, like when you get spanked. That's <laughs> when you get spanked. You're just like annihilating these guys. As long as I hang out to the tank, I'll be okay, but I'm almost out of gas. And there's the tank. Get out. Oh. 
How do I get out of the tank? Oh, that's me dying. <laughs> that's one way. Oh, no! Oh, right in front of fuel, too. Oh, new tank, though. If I can make it there. Gotta get into it. It's a tank, it's a tank. Come on, Ralph. Tank, tank, tank. Tank! Man, wasn't that like a, like a lost OG video? Tank, tank, tank. I lost? I thought that one got posted. Did it? Did our tank, tank, tank video never got posted? So, question why is your tank pink? Because that's the manly color. Yeah. And it's I'm also color say. contrast from everyone else. You bring me a bagel. Bagel! Oh, it's snowing again? It actually is snowing? Oh, god damn it. Yeah, looking this up, no, that, there's no TNG tank to tank video. That's weird, I thought for sure we did a tank 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 video. How do I get out of the tank? Like, I remember you like mentioning it once, I just thought you said like the footage got corrupted or something. It might be, because Emil lost a bunch of footage that we, we shot on like a hard drive. Mm -hmm. It's like, we lost our, oh, Sonic, Sonic jump. None of those were jumping. <laughs> hey, back to this. He did not want to. He forgot how to jump. No, Trojan, I'm absolutely thinking of Tank Tank Tank, because we love Tank Tank Tank. I, I love that, like, when he's small, he's red. Yeah, it's so <laughs> random. I got a bagel here. Hello. Bagel. <laughs> Merpster. You were covered in snow. April snow. Uh, I'm tired of snow. Mother Nature goes April Fools by giving you snow and me thunderstorms. Alright, so C is jump, B is run, and A is fireball. Just been hot over here. Don't you live in Texas? Isn't it supposed to be hot there? Eh, depends on the day. I love this music. Okay. It was like, it was As like someone who lives in like... Wisconsin, any temperature in Texas I'd consider warm or hot. When you're Even hot, whenever you're hot. it was like 11 degrees? Yeah, <laughs> I remember that, the blizzard. That... <laughs> it gets cold here too. Mario? Fucking Mario. Like, you know, fucking don't, Mario. Let the... don't let the hot propaganda tell you otherwise it, it does get cold in texas not as cold but you know uh, we, we go down i don't towards know what you're talking about sometimes. 11 degrees that's still shirts in short weather prove it <laughs> okay do you want me to, like, oh they changed the warps <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, no. it's not that easy what the I mean, just Can you get time. lives off of that? I mm -hmm. no, because the score wasn't going up. Oh, you're right. Mm. Mm. I don't think uh, combo score multipliers existed in one. It absolutely did, because that was how you got um, one ups back in the day. Remember oh, the, the one up trick? Yep. Let's do a new game. Chapter okay. one: Swamp water. Lighten up. Working in the garden. Wilderness breeze. Mm -hmm. Whose game was this? This is Camille's. Kaylin's vision. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited about a whole evening watching Vance Michael Justin. Oh, my favorite! You know, oh, she right. actually flirted with the guy at the video shop just so she could get this film two days early. It's not like I'll see him again. I gave him your mobile number. Tareen. Or ter 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 Tarany? I think it's Tarany. Tarany. Yeah, Tarany? that is Tarany. What? How could you? It's no big deal, Tarani. She's used our number with other guys. Guess she's afraid one of them might actually want to call her. Guys, keep it down, would you? I'm trying to get some shut-eye over here while I'm reading this book sitting up <laughs> on the couch. Say yeah, that does not look like <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> That's probably fine. Hashtag sleeping. She's still thinking about that story she's got to write for her English lesson. Yeah, she always does her best reading when she's asleep. <laughs> Oh, they weren't kidding. Okay then. All right, well back to back to oh, it's oh. Puppet Master. It's back, the dream. Back to Page Master. This, this oh, is actually well. Puppet Master of the game. 
Oh well, fucking hell! I, I knew that I was dreaming about another game, and in this game there was another game, and this in this game there was another game, and in this game there was another game, and in this I think I'm looping right now. This game, there's another game. In this game, there's another. Guys, <laughs> I, I, I got an OS issue here. Uh, my my Camille's broken. In this we're game, there's another like game. In this game, there's another game. In this game, there's another game. <laughs> Chip and Dale time. The Camille's still under warranty. We gotta fix her. Ah! Crap, crap. <laughs> <laughs> this game's great. This wouldn't be that bad if the controls weren't reversed. They're not reversed. Completely fucked. They'd just be <laughs> Chip and Dale. They're, they're like, like sideways, dude. <laughs> So again, for those who weren't here before, left on the D-pad is jump, down on the D-pad is run to the right, uh, up is run to the left, right is nothing, but I think it actually might be also grab, because that's why upright grabs stuff, and B is duck, and I guess, I don't know what A does. So if you're wondering why I'm, like, having such a hard time with, of all games, Chippendale Rescue Rangers, that's why. How does it feel to almost enjoy a game? Kind of sucks. <laughs> <laughs> so the reason I hate crowd control whenever I, they have to do like, the control fuck up ones. That's why it's my least favorite crowd control bug. You know, I went to get on stream because now next crowd control. That's probably. I mean, I can turn. I turn off that feature routinely. So honestly, don't worry about it. It it gives money. It gives money. money. It gives money, but yo, some things are above money, such as my sanity. That's true, That's I feel true. Right. That's nonsense. Uh, sanity's overrated. Mads, you have no sanity. You have no reason to speak. <laughs> I mean, that's fair. You've made my friend depressed, Camille. You have to apologize. Listen, I'm already fucking depressed too, so welcome to the group. Hi, do you want a cookie? Here, I, I have a I would love cookies. one. <laughs> Okay, um, let me just fax oh. them to you. Um, oh, wait. I don't have a fax. <laughs> oh, go to like a Kinko's and get get a give them the fax number. I don't even know what that is. A what? That's like a FedEx. Yeah, that'd be like I, I, it. The funny thing is, that's an American company, so if anything, I shouldn't know Hang what a Kinko's on. is. John, I, I thought that when you said a Kinko's, it was like I don't know a shop for kinks. No, uh, it does yeah, not say kink like shop. It's literally like what would be a FedEx now. Yeah, it just says FedEx office whenever I Google it. Oh, okay. so I guess, yes, I, FedEx probably bought them then at that point. You go to a yeah. Kinko's like get like printer, I mean posters like printed out for like projects and such that like look good, you know. How much and for it, your sanity, right. John? You gave us a number for a boob job. Yeah, a number that's never going to happen because it was two point nine million dollars. Two point okay. eight million dollars for your sanity. Here's a question. What happens if someone in chat wins the lottery and says, you know what, I'm going to just see if you actually do it. Then I'm going to have a rock and pair of tits. PayPal is also going to yeah. scream at it. No, but also, I'm going to make sure I have enough saved up to, like, you know, take care of my family, which is the actual reason I would want $2.9 million. Yeah, I, do I like forgot that. about his exactly. pants parachute. And that's why we say support the tits. <laughs> now that's one two point nine million dollar donation. Oh, I can't stop spinning. What's happening? Okay. Why can't I stop spinning? Oh, <laughs> Spin. See, this is actually the effect of the insides of the bird that she blew up when she was singing that one time in the forest. Just... <laughs> mm. uh, who the fuck picked this? Oh, game? my special ability turns me Shamrock. into Ogre Fio, and I just realized. Oh, that's hilarious. Ah, <laughs> uh, this was uh, Shamrocks. Fuck, f fuck him, <laughs> fuck him. Because once again, I recognize a game where there's fucking Comic Sans. Why the fuck do you guys pick games with Comic Sans in it? I now see Comic Sans everywhere. <laughs> because we know it triggers some artists. Fair point. Raise his hands, Are you ready for more Swamp Rally? Sure am. I mean, to be fair, I don't mind playing this. This isn't terrible, it's just jank. Yeah. Get some. Oh, my. Mine isn't exactly terrible. That's why I was kind of dreading mine because I was thinking, oh, it's not as shit as everyone else. You were being nice with yours, I'll say. 
Listen, it was either that, it was either that, or it was alone in the dark. Oh my God, I can't get out of this spot. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think. I thought that was like an oil slick, not a pit. Nope. Uh, that seems quite the pit. Honestly, I'm surprised nobody was actually like, like I gave people the free reign to actually give me like a good game if they wanted to. Just very few people actually did it. You know, I'm not like, surprised. They, they did, like everyone was like, it's April first. Give John the worst thing we got. Um, I probably now would have actually forced you to. I'd ask Monaco if I could do a randomizer of a game you play because the specific randomizer I think is funny. A randomizer. The issue is that we're still like in a like 24 plus a 24 game shuffler. I don't know what you can do with a rando. And again, Miles' game still has not shown up yet. So out of the 24 games, one still has not appeared. Yeah, which is insane. It's a good thing it's coming up next. Right now. Hello. <laughs> and, and there he is. The game. He speaks. You know, you know, I already feel bad about myself. The shuffler doesn't mean you need to make me feel even worse about myself. <laughs> Don't worry, my own. Yeah, April Fool's shuffler. Bringing the worst twice. out of everyone except for the person actually playing the shuffler. <laughs> like I said, I have like... I reserve my comments for my choice for if it pops up at this rate. I would say like when, but I don't know. Like, I figured from wars, I really shouldn't up. do too much, a uh, too evil of a choice, because I kind of want to be on call sometime again this year. Man, we haven't seen like Cutthroat Island in a bit. We haven't seen like Mario R in a bit, Athena. You haven't seen the gameplay part of my game. That's also that true. true. So don't worry, Mayo. I, I feel you on this. It's just, you know. E hello, I'm the outsider. I'm the imposter of the mod group. Hello, hi, hi, hi. No, Which outsider are you? Oh, like you're Dally, staying good. Or like, what was his no. fucking name? Like Pony Boy? Uh, what? You know, like Dally, uh, Pony Boy, The Outsiders. You ever read that book? Oh, okay, okay. I, I don't think I, she I'm read, a read that book. I'm a, I'm a I was going to say. Boy. Hey. I I I, I don't yeah. know if that's in the French education system. Yeah, it was like a book about like some like kids who were like in a gang, but then like one kid was like the you greasers. Know, like, yeah, the greasers. In, yeah. In French, we don't. In French, we don't teach to become horses. We teach to become no. two thousand teenage rock magical girls, baby. That's why I picked this game. <laughs> that was a movie, correct? Is that Patrick Swayze in it? And uh, young Tom Cruise as well. Yeah. No, uh, okay, so, uh, because maybe my game might not be back there, so I might as well explain why I chose my game. Um, so that was a game that I had when I was a kid, and I was like, yeah, I want to show this game, because, I don't know, it's kind of cool, and I don't think it's really well-known. Yes, it isn't well-known, because Witch is mostly a European-known series. It was, uh, there was a comic I, I, that was... I've seen it. There was a comic that mostly. was... Bas yeah. yeah, basically... Basically, what happens is that um, the witch is a Disney is a Disney pr uh, production, oh. and it is from Italy. The original comics was done by an Italian, and it was mostly distributed and well known in America, in French. Uh, well, not French, but uh, in Europe, France was also very popular. In this so popular that it also made an animated series, which was produced in France. And the game that you're playing right now is actually based on the animated series. So you're gonna see a character. If you go far into the game, you're gonna see a character that only appears in the actual animation. Fun. That was a Eat. lot to take in at once. Goddamn. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I should probably have slowed down. Sorry. No, no, no I'm just fine. saying there's a lot to it. <laughs> All right. Just can slow down. <laughs> uh, maybe not the slowdown exactly I wanted. This the well, now it's telling you speed up. The oh, low trust me, I'm trying. Warning is why I will not play the Sonic games. Like I said, this stage already sucks on a good day without water physics. Oh, right. Uh, also, apparently... You not... Wow, you did that. That's really hard, That's actually. Done, actually. Holy shit. No, I'm not going to make it through the next thing, though. At least it's not ice physics. Did, you, did that guy have to kill me? 
Uh, Chunk. Uh, oh, oh, there's the ball. Oh, 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 of course. Uh, also, John, you just mixed... love when that happens. I think, John, you mixed up Witch and Wink, which are two different series. Yeah, I don't know, because I they never grew up on really either. They look really similar, though. There's a similar style to Fate. both. Fate! At least from the Game Boy. Well, for the for the Game Boy, maybe I could maybe for a C for it for the Game Boy. But ah, dang it! If you oh, see us, uh, different. I know. Yes, basically, <laughs> Winx is um, a magical fairy school, and Winx is more a magical girl team that is uh, solving problems between worlds. They may have similar-ish universes, but it's have, yeah. not the same. It's different enough. Plus, something very interesting is that one of the creators of Winx actually worked in the production of Witch. So... That makes a lot of sense, then. Yeah. Hi, mister. Eagle. Eagle. Idiot me is like, why are you running away? Just shoot <laughs> <laughs> Don't what are you shoot doing, John? It's I... Mega Man 12. I would love to shoot. Yeah, the problem is there's no checkpoints in Chippendale unless you get to the next room. So I've got to get to the next room if I want to actually be okay. It's like Smash Brothers Brawl. Got to get to the next room for a checkpoint. What was your like yep. challenge completion criterion, criterion again, Maniacal? Stage beat the, one. Beat one stage. Just a single stage. Okay. Yeah. I'm not that mean. Are we sure about that? I mean... God damn it. Hi, Mr. Yeah, I can't, I can't spend time with you. I have to suffer for some reason. <laughs> Hi, yeah, you, you're now on my desk. Hello. John, John, do you know you can say no. I have to suffer can for I? I'm a streamer. I don't think I actually can. <laughs> you can. Repeat after me. No. no say, say this, like, say this. Bake, I have to suffer for financial yes. benefit. Boy, 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 boy. Hi, mister. Mister, I have to suffer so Jeez. I can pay for your cat food. And do you know how John can pay for his cat food? Oh it's... my god, Bagel just clicked on the Washington video. He wants to be a star's hand. I have that goddamn dicks. He wants to be a star's hand. 30 goddamn dicks. <laughs> Got him all right, wieners. I'll pause the shuffle for you right now, so... All right. Since you want the tension so bad. I was say, I thought I saw the the cursor moving to the right. Yeah. Is that Bagel? That is Bagel. <laughs> nice. Here, let, me, let me see if I can get him on screen here without him noticing. He's probably going to notice. Bagel going, yes, more dicks. I know what you like, wieners. Thanks, Kathy. Abby. He's noticing. Hello. Mister. Oh, We've made eye contact. Mister, the mister, the mister. Look at this boy. This, this is the Excellent thing he does all the time, boy. huh? Yeah, you just get Excellent used to it. Boy. You just yeah. accept it. He's so it. excellent. Oh, I don't know so what he just... pretty. Mister Rip. Such nice. excellent cat. Excellent catsmanship. Ow. Wow. So the only the other thing I'll say about my choice, I had down to between two games, either Friday the thirteenth or the other one, believe it or not, Double Dare for an ES. Yeah. The only reason for that was because I have that game in a shuffler and I could never beat the obstacle course because it keeps shuffling when I'm in the middle of going back and forth in the deep pad. <laughs> so when it swaps over, you're like, oh shit, go back! <laughs> I'll say for mine, I wasn't really sure like what to pick at first. I was like, you know what? I guess I have this lying around. Like if I, if I can't think of anything else, I'll go for it. And well, here we are. If, if you want to know the chronicles of dumb Camille, I did not beat the game, the game that I picked when I was a kid because there was one level that involved spiders, and I was so fucking scared of spiders, and I was like, No, I'm not gonna progress in this level. I hate spiders. Hi. Oh, there's... Oh, thank God. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good. My other pick, which should have been Alone in the Dark, is because it's basically French Resident Evil. 
Oh, I mean, it's the pro. It's like it came out before Resident Evil. It it is French Resident Evil. I'm sorry, we did it first, motherfuckers. <laughs> Hi, you having fun rolling around on my desk here? I literally, like, my keyboard is currently sideways right now. Oh my god, he's, like, <laughs> knocking over shit right now. Hi. French and the evil! <laughs> Mister, I can't do anything about the weather, but I do kind of need my desk here, you know. Are we sure about that? I, I It'll be like, I'm it's my sure. desk now. Hey, hang on a minute. No, chat is right. I, if alone, run. if alone in the dark came before Resident Evil, that means that Resident Evil is Japanese alone in the dark. Yep, you could say that, yeah. Nani, Nani. I love that like kunk sound effect. <laughs> it's so aggressive. Aggressive really kind of stands to be the word to use with this game, huh? Yeah. Yeah, playing it sure makes people aggressive. Yeah. When was the last time you felt aggressive, Meds? Um, probably last time you asked me a stupid question. <laughs> really? <laughs> well, I mean, the last time he asked a stupid question was like, what, an hour ago? Well, it wasn't directed towards me, so... Did they make me redo the same Question. stage? I think, we're gonna, I think so. I got third. Do I have to get first? Oh no, it's Groundhog Day. Except it's Swamp. Hey, where are you going? Swamp Hog Day! Hey, there's so many easier ways here to get off this desk. I don't know why you picked the hardest one each time. Yeah, Because I gotta be a good boy! But yeah, the hardest is the funnest! I literally have to stretch my knee out so he can use me as like a ladder to get down. <laughs> wait, wait, Thank that's not a jump it. pad? <laughs> I thought that was a jump pad! Why is it in front of the fucking pit? The game be like, April? Oh wait, I was going down, not up. Okay. <laughs> And now I retreat to my swamp. Bye. Oh shit, she goes to a oh. swamp, let me join her, no, bye! That's not a secret. Yeah, I would have probably done the exact same thing. Definitely thought that was a secret. Game on! I'm glad the game wizard showed up. Absolutely. Well, that, that's the actual page master, I believe. I, 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 I forget, I forget if Macaulay Culkin becomes the page master or like. Good spoilers. Go on. <laughs> Hi, Bagel. I, you can't. Can't stop, bud. <laughs> Sonic slipperiness to your dude. He's, dude. <laughs> I'm not even holding run for the re for reference's sake. I'm not holding run. Well, I think this is the Ron Pax way of saying Bagel! Mario is faster than up. Sonic. Go upstairs. Go to Mama. But it's Sonic. Do we really need that effect with the text? Yeah, why not? It's probably not on purpose. If I had to get it, guess, it was probably limitations. That's probably a more realistic answer, because, like, you know, with games like this, you gotta, like, cut around a few places to, like, really preserve your quality. Yeah, I, I don't think they really went the extra mile to optimize the game. <laughs> probably not. But... Alright, goodbye, Koopa Shell. <laughs> yes, yeah, hang on now. <laughs> uh, Koopa Shell had to go back to its planet. It needed it. Like, underground? There. Yay! So how do you win the shuffle, John? I don't think I do, Dan. I think that's it. I don't think I do. We gotta at least get you, like, some things beaten. You're, you're close on some things. I'd say right now you're the closest on beating, like... Probably Killer Instinct, actually. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's easily uh, the closest. If it oh my god, the swimming any... physics are garbage! That looked terrible. If we're going with for any game over online is a win, <laughs> you're like a minute. Because I thought was this close to being done as well, yeah. 
Dude, um, you get no vertical. Page master, my lower. And they're so can. fast. I don't know about that one. I think we're gonna be redoing this one. Yep. I love, like, the super crunch Sonic 3D Blast, like, little title card for the levels. Oh, right, Athena's in here. Yay! Hey, it's back. Hey. Hey, Flyer, what you got? I don't even get you to give me an item. If you even can. Okay. So, I'm gonna take a screenshot from uh, the manual and post it in mod room. Just so people don't think I'm the. <laughs> there we go, the big boy. Alright, armor. Armor. Shield. There's some way to get these things to like give you health. I don't remember how. Saying please would probably be a good start. Eh, you'd probably. think that would help, but no. That's not. Shrek cart. Oh god. Started like borrowing some of these even more. So I literally posted the part the manual talks about on it, it the game ends when you've either successfully completed each mission, your ship is captured by opposing vessel. Captain Picard is critically injured. A total number of three major officers are critically injured on an away mission. Or you commit uh, major breaches of Starfleet regulations, aka being court-martialed. Alright, so we're gonna try to get court-martialed then. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, yeah, Committing crimes. space crimes! <laughs> John, did you ever see yourself becoming a space criminal today? Uh, today? No. Eventually, yeah. Eventually? Okay, I see. <laughs> Figured Rosa hey, would lead me down the path of space crime. What would your ideal space offense be? Stealing like a giant space battalion? A whole battalion. I, I can't what move anymore. Happening? I'm literally stuck. <laughs> I'm literally stuck in the wall. <laughs> I'm going in the wall now. I literally can't move. I was winning this race and now I am stuck. Okay, I am now over here. Yay, you did it! You're out of bounds, I think. I am. I actually am like completely trapped inside the middle of this track and cannot make any more progress in this race. I literally have trapped myself. Anyways, back to Killer Instinct. Oh yeah. John, Hi, how bagel. did you do that? That was really good! <laughs> Dude, you got fucking schlorts with a wall, man. It just ate you. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, you hit the wall and it's like, mine now. <laughs> how dare you? I'm confiscating this. <laughs> bagel, you smell like you need to fart. Or go, you need to go use a litter box. Go, go use you a litter box. You smell like you need farts? <laughs> you smell like farts is what I meant. Is it that obvious, John? <laughs> yeah. Quote that one real quick. That one's way too good not to quote. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, we lost Killer Instinct. Oh, they even oh. did the fucking, like, the actual, like, kill move. They did their fatality. Fatality. I knew, I knew if anyone was gonna stop me, it was gonna be that jackass. You were doing so good until it switched. Well, here's the thing, like I said, Thunder is actually like the first proper wall in Killer Instinct, usually. 
Mm-hmm. Because he's well, got no, an anti-air. Saying, like, the... Oh, yeah. Ah. But your first attempt, you got him down pretty low. And then it switched and then didn't come back, like, until an hour later. <laughs> Dude, that anti-air is, like, rough. He just spams it out. Like, like, like the worst kind of, like, breaching dolphin. Oh! Now we're tied. Almost, almost. You're good, you're good. I love your strategy. I love your like, strategy. Just punch him really fast and really hard. <laughs> I mean, it's I'm otherwise gonna working. I'm gonna move my arms like this. If you get hit, it's your fault. <laughs> well, no! that's, not, that's not gonna be good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, that oh. that was a hit? Why did you keep going back to Page Master? Apparently, this I just I can't damage that one, I guess. I, this is quite the Page Turner of a game. Not... Talk about the Allison. I think we're just gonna make this one just like be like two levels, maybe at this rate. Oh no! Oh no! I'm trying to get my like, weapon back and I can't. That Castlevania death sound right there, my god! <laughs> game on! Game on! Get your game on! Come on, awesome. you better play your cards right. Dolphin submit a game? No. No. What oh, would you have submitted? Um... Honestly, I don't know. Maybe uh, Sonic 2 Forces Edition, because that is a nightmare. I just remember something talking to you, Dalton. I think I have my Patreon because, like, I had, like, a new card recently, and I just saw, like, the, like Patreon thing, like, your favorite Smash Tunes didn't go through. You should fix that Oh quick. my god, I, w I was wondering about that earlier! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, because I got my fucking info stolen again, I'm so mad. Yeah, I, I just checked Patreon, and I'm like, man, what did I do to lose a subscriber? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't check the, and see it was you. Ask the dude who stole like 90 bucks from me to use like use it on Lyft. What the fuck are you doing using a $60 Lyft ride? It was Dalton. Really <laughs> I wanted more money for his Patreon. <laughs> like I really needed a ride. Cut me some <laughs> slack. <laughs> like, ah, this guy already pays me, he won't mind. <laughs> That's gonna be the new tier on my Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> the lift right tier. Oh, that's not a platform I can stand on, too. Shit. If I reach this goal, I can go one place a month. <laughs> I can't so get why, back. <laughs> so in this game, why can't you land on the grass? Mm -hmm. I think th someone says, please keep off the grass or something like that. Grass ain't gnarly oh, enough. Oh, and I've been arrested. Oh, right. <laughs> it said, don't step on the grass. All right, well, now I have no fucking clue where I am. Uh, that's a great question. Uh, you're definitely on the grass. The map, you're here. <laughs> but that grass hurts you. <laughs> oh my god, this game makes no sense. Okay, so the path you're walking on to me kind of looks like a flower field for some reason. <laughs> really? All right, you gave me a cassette tape. What about you two? Cans of pudding. Look for something strange by a tree near the stable. Well, I just need to find the stable. Or is it the stable? Oops, that's not jump. <laughs> okay, this is the grass I can't walk on. All right. Okay. Well, unless I land in a bush. Yeah, well, the bush maybe don't try to walk on. Bush or bush, big hairy bush. Excellent! Six cans of pudding! <laughs> Excellent! Insert guitar riff here. Wait, isn't this like the 1700s? Probably. Well, because well, you went to go to George Washington or whatever, right? Well, think of it this way, Mitch. When you screw around with the space-time continuum enough, um... Things get invented in the wrong place and time. 
Yeah, like cans of pudding. Yeah. Okay, so I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing in this game. So Frodo's got the one ring. Got and the ring. Sam's got nothing. This is as far as I've ever been before. <laughs> God damn it. I'm so mad that video got taken down. Same. <laughs> How long was that video by the end of it? Like nine hours. Oh my god. <laughs> For those that don't know, that video was like Lord of the Rings, but every time Sam takes a step, he says this is as far as I've ever been before. <laughs> so funny, dude. Oh. Uh... Good old Donkey Kong 5, the journey of overtime and space. Yeah, never forget. Never forget that journey. I mean, how could you? Look at this. You can never forget Donkey Kong. I'm mad for you that the freaking shells don't kill other enemies. <laughs> yeah, my, my blue ape. I thought we wanted to be the great ape. No, this is this is blue ape, different ape. More powerful ape. This is the ape I feel like when I'm playing DKC Returns with the uh, with Tim and Emil. I have to be the blue ape to carry us through. Where's my jump? Uh, so how unfortunately, the... the blue ape is crippled. <laughs> the so blue ape does not started. know how to jump. Sorry, I had to find how... out this way. How did uh, that I input taste? Very eaten. Very, very eaten. Whoa, slow down. So what's the music from? Because I guarantee you it's not original. Pokemon Pinball. Yeah. Ah. Uh, I haven't played Pokemon Pinball since I was like, I don't know, dude, like seven. I've only ever played, like, original, but I've never played, uh, I'm sorry, I've, I've only ever played a Ruby and Sapphire, but not the original. The current song is the, uh, score entry song, when you, like, ah. game over. Score I entry. Yeah. The pulse was, like, Blue Board, which is, like, Prototype Ecritique City. Mm-hmm. I did know that. Yeah. Did he yeah, I used to have a cartridge, I don't know what happened to it. Dude, I feel that with some cartridges. I'm just like, what do I do with this thing? I just I, like can't. I haven't seen it in over 20 years, but like I I know I had it at some point and then it was gone. I think mm -hmm. I'm that way with like Mario Sunshine, but I also wouldn't miss it if it was missing. <laughs> <laughs> World four one. World four. I kind of like the background here. I don't Two. know what song this would be from. The Journey of Over Time and Space City. You know? This is what, your what third title. stage now? That's my third stage I'm doing now, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Which I think I want to go about this. How am I running Radical Rex? Can you? That's the thing I is don't it know. possible for John to beat that game? Yeah, but I was just going to have a game? Journey? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's just Mario 1, isn't it? It's Mario 1 that ends at 5-5, five, five, I believe. Or, sorry, 5-4. Oh. I thought you were talking about the actual game Journey. <laughs> no. No, I no. That game. I mean, it I is played... eatable on a stream, I think, but, you know. Yeah. I played the uh, the Water Journey uh, oh, Abzu. God. Mm. <laughs> you transformed. <laughs> Hold down the B button to create a shield of energy. The longer the shield is active, the more elemental powers you use. Time for which? Oh my gosh! Holy shit. I wasn't ready for that. Yeah, I was expecting like a, a key blast or something, not a full on Kamehameha. Oh wow, it, it like, it stays. Oh yeah. I love the Star Wars blaster sound. <laughs> Hold down on the control pad and press the A button to drop down levels or staircases. So for this one, you need to go find gems. Go search. Fly through the air by tapping the A button quickly, although the heart of Garen Gandragar is carried by the Guardian Will, your power will recharge from also drawing energy. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> you gotta match this one, dude. I played the first oh, one. Okay, so that uses that uses energy, but yeah. 
Yeah. I love the A buttons on the, on the wall. <laughs> right. Ay, 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 ay. Sounds like you're talking the bagel with all that A. Only one stone at a time. Being stupid. Yeah, I... so that was only one stone at a time. Oh. Yeah. Never mind the fact that there's three icons for it. You can only hold one at a time. Yeah, that's what I thought was also kind of weird, too. Break soon? Break in six minutes. Two breaks in a single Mayo game. It's bullshit. <laughs> God. We're gonna have to make oh, green stone. <laughs> oh. I dropped it yeah. off and didn't realize it. Okay. You put it into the uh, pedestal. Time to speculate now, chat. What is the final mystery game? What could it be? Box off. <laughs> we already know what game one? <laughs> So we all, all we know is that that's Game Boy Code. That's the only hint. So uh, put on your socks because you're, they're gonna be rocked off. All oh, right. Uh, <laughs> Just know Mario Bros. Deluxe. It was, Game Boy, <laughs> <laughs> it was <laughs> Game Boy Color, but it wasn't supposed to be. <laughs> <laughs> There's yeah, so uh, there's there's <laughs> going to be a story behind that. Yeah, there's a bit of a mix-up, and we'll get into that. Honestly, I, I hope you never see it. Neat. Anyway. I would, I would feel bad, dude. <laughs> I feel like, really, like, of all, like, the luck. Dude, this always happens last... with... This always happens with like every shuffler thing on John's things, you know. My it's stuff weird never how consistently up. it happens to you too. That's the thing. It's weirdly yeah. consistent. All right, Jason, let's go. If I can find you. Oh, he's still got a lot of health. Yeah. Where the fuck is he? How do you know where he is? He is in here simply because his health bar is here. If his health bar is here, that means he's in the Oh, house. okay, I gotcha. There he is. See, if this was Game Boy Advance, I'd probably say that's a rape. Would the Miles game but Game Boy Color? Yeah, I that's a raven know. was the easy choice, but that was way too easy. It was already on stream anyway, so... You win for now. Wait, so is that the clear? No. I have to, I have to erase his entire health bar. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, can, I, can I change kids here? Or am I might have no choice. Oh, God, I can't. <laughs> That's when you go to the fucking daycare. It's like, can I change kids here? <laughs> yeah, I'm done oh, with this no. kid. Can I get a new one? I really can't. I guess oh, you're not sucks. camera. I get why, but that sucks. Well, I don't think I don't think George is gonna survive, unfortunately. Well, that's what he gets for being too curious. Really? Ah, <laughs> oh, that fucking what an anti-air! With all the bad. Oh, we sneaked it out. Uh, tonight. Magic oh, nice. I'm surprised that was that so gets close. You to say really. All right, one more, one more fight Spinal. for Kevin, and we're done. Well, I got three fights left. I thought I had to f finish the game, or did you cut down the number? I cut it down a little bit to like That's six good. or seven or whatever. I don't know where we're at. This is the last one. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> so, we, so we can beat more games. Well, challenges, but yes. Honestly, you could beat this whole thing at this rate, but also I don't know. Have you beaten this before? No. You want to you want to try and beat it actually in the, We're gonna have to the game clearing list if I beat it. I don't know. Yeah. Idol is usually pretty cheap in like normal Killer Instinct. Yo, Jay Brian, thank you for the raid. I guess all the state honestly, you could just like call it. Yo, sixty nine, nice. Winner, supreme all right. victory. All right, K Ki is done. We can move on. Okay, so I actually am removing it. Yes, if you want to beat the rest later, we have state for it. Even if you don't have a state, it'll take you like five minutes to get back here. <laughs> yeah, could have seen that.
You know, I'll fucking timer scam if I got to, Fulgore. Ah, damn it. <laughs> no, you won't! We made it to the final boss. Oh my god, <laughs> nice. Never mind, we did not. Oh. And the here final he boss is. is Sonic? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Dr. Robotnik right here. <laughs> Just gonna oh, play some live and learn while we're at it. Dude, it has to be like really crunchy GBA live and learn. <laughs> <laughs> Rap, 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 rap. That is illegal. You're not supposed to be able to do that. <laughs> it's funny that you can't do it in this version. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Alright, well, we made it through the first world, so we gotta get to the end of Marble, Marble Zone, you said? Yeah, Act 3. Uh, have fun. It's not too bad. Yeah. You did it before. I did do it I before. Love the, game... the Game Boy Advance harmonica. <laughs> this is for all the sad Sonics out there. <laughs> Bust out your harmonicas and sing along if you know the words. <laughs> I thought you were. Well, like, I don't know why that? I thought it was going to like a Sarah McLaughlin ad. <laughs> <laughs> In the arms oh of the Sonic Spin Away. <laughs> but it's the Game Boy Advance harmonica. <laughs> I'm glad that the ultimate strategy is just punching fast. <laughs> I have the whole forward to do this, by the way. If I'm not holding forward, I don't punch fast enough. Oh my god. Oh god. Go. That's the sign for a break. Holy shit! I think we actually beat it. Holy shit. Yo! Did you expect to beat a game tonight, John? I did not expect <laughs> to beat a game tonight, no. <laughs> An actual game clear. I think we got a supreme victory on the final boss, too. After escaping the grasp of Ultra Tech. Glacius finds and repairs his spacecraft. Soon after, he starts the long and dangerous trip home. I can't believe we beat Continues something. used oh, oh. one. Dang. You did it. I think if I use zero continues, I get like something different, but yeah. Maybe, or it might be because I did it in one, I'm fine. I don't remember. So I think Killer Instinct used on the SNES was whatever your difficulty was that dictated the ending you got. But yeah, that's actually a game clear. Amazing. Yeah. I did it. Alright, so what's the combo to remove this game? It's like Control Shift Escape or something like that? Um. Yes, it is. Okay, Popski.gb cool. marked complete. Cool. So we actually did beat one of the challenges tonight. One of the nicer games on the list. Oops, that is not good. The <laughs> I don't think you were supposed to go that way. Yeah. Updating the challenges a bit to make them like a lot more like doable here. What's what a number the number for you again? That put us at four. What's that, Mets? What was the win condition for this one? Uh, Gex at stage three. We're on stage one still, I believe. Yep. Boy, how do you hope I'm going the right way? Because <laughs> I kind of can't tell anymore. Nope, sure wasn't.
There we go. So, chat, how are you guys doing tonight? You guys yeah. like this idea at all? all right, when do oh, we want to go to break, by the way? Because the alarm just went off, so. Probably, maybe like next, like shuffle, perhaps. Okay. Or you could do pause now and take it now. That way, in case one of the evil games come. I mean, he's got a, a point. That's true. I mean, would you want to stop at an evil game? I don't know where I, I mean, generally, that's me. whenever I'm like, okay, I'm not doing this. <laughs> oh, the exit. Hop in the egg. Very cool. Go to Very bonus cool. level. Welcome to bonus stage. Collect all the eggs oh, and exit safely that. to win a free continue. It's got a pogo stick. Oh it's fucking God, like... This does not control well. What, was this like Haunted Tower? Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, no he bonus. Melted. Wow. Apparently it, was, apparently it was acid. Toxic Tower, DKC2, that's what I'm thinking of. Oh, okay, bye. Guess Dying I'm going this way. Time. That pterodactyl is pissed. Acid! Nope, acid only hurts a little. It's it's just a small burn. Just a little singed. He's still good. A little bit of a singe. Yes. Yeah, look at this fucking climbing animation. His head stays perfectly still. <laughs> <laughs> Your head doesn't when you climb. Have you climbed anything recently, John? Stair? Uh... Do stairs count? Hmm, I guess. No, I'm page master. I don't have the gloves, so I can't go that way. Oh, your shoes. Oh, and that's the end of the stage. Hey, you're halfway done. One more stage. I want to get the pick. Let's try this yeah. one, guys. Door here. Oh, shit, I said I was going to go to break. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> After this one. One more. Listen, it got exciting. Two stages cleared. Oh, these are my nice shoes. Oh no, not the Jordans. I mean, here's the thing, that's also what dictates how many hits I can take, too, is how many items I have. Right. Your equipment is your, uh... Your equipment is your health meter. Oh, what it's was like it? Mario. I, I guess like Mario? I was thinking about, like, another game that did that, but maybe Mario? Mario's pretty What do you mean, I guess like Mario? Which Mario? It's exactly like Mario. You have like, what, three or four Marios going at? The side scroll. They're all ones. the same Mario, technically. Oh, that's just. Oh, that's rude. So, Christopher Lloyd actually in the movie played uh, the librarian. Well, that's cool. Unless I miss. If I'm pretty sure I remember. Nice, wow, nice. that was uh, that was close. Yeah, a little too close for comfort. Oh wait, sorry. He played the uh, page master, the keeper of books and guardian of the written world. He's implied to be the library's alternate form. Uh, Mister D D. I don't know why there was a question mark there. I can't seem to open it. To make you curious. Oh wait, I no. Guess. He, he asked Christopher Lloyd played both Mr. Dewey and the Page Master. Okay. Oh what? What? How did that? I don't get this game sometimes, man. There, there are times this game just makes no fucking sense. So, uh, if the wiki is right. Patrick Stewart played one of the adventure book. Uh, I can Whoopi, believe that. Uh, Whoopi Goldberg played the fantasy book. Yeah, that sounds right in my head. And Frank Wel Welker played uh, the horror book. Yeah, I can believe that. That sounds right. All right, let's drop some eggs. Gokai gifted. Oh my god, I forgot about this. Gokai gifted a sub to Thick McDuck. Mayo gives us a sub to Foss Extreme. Orion gifted a sub to Scrooge McFuck69. And Udiptes gifted a sub to Zombie Sparky. 
Mr. AD for 33. The Crates for 75. Crazy Crash 546 for 43. Ariel in for 45. Mr. Bry Guy for 109. Ikero for 53. Mikey DCT for 56. Home Run 1500 for 36. Tomoyo for 85. Yuki Mizuno for 107. Fanfi 985 for 25. Dusk the Silver uh, Silver Ghost Wolf for 24. Random Guy 5850 for 54. Nova Suna for 55. Shamrock for 74. HMO5 useless for 3. Maball for 27. And Alien Whale for 54. Thanks for subbing and hanging out tonight, folks. Alongside DJ PB and J for 53. Your eggs tonight are courtesy of. I got at least one in here. I need to skim Goat Kaisi for a second. It's got a tag on it, but I, I'm assuming it's okay. They've been pretty safe with their picks. So I'm going to assume that one's fine. Wednesday on the After School Special. Oh, that's, yeah, that's probably fine. Okay, we'll, just, we'll just skip that party list. But yeah, here we go. Uh, from Gokai, you nasty duke. Grade A fun. First the egg. Wednesday. I'm not gonna fight you. I'm gonna kick your balls of steel. Cock and ball torture. God damn it. <laughs> Gespent with, uh, wanna listen to some tunes? Hey. Wanna listen to some tunes? I forgot you could just see it land on the ground. For some reason, I thought he at least had it land at a shot. <laughs> Calvin with Duke sleeps, too. Oh my god. What is happening in this intermission? Intermission? The actual egg will happen when this bar gets to the end here. You are cozy and warm in your bed, my dear. Please, go the fuck to sleep. <laughs> no. I had a dream about kissing Master Halo from Halo. <laughs> 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 Calvin. All right, we're going to break when we come back. Our block and more shuffler. See you guys in a bit. Master right, Halo from Halo. Master Halo. And I got to write down. We beat Killer Instincts for the Game Boy uh, on April Fool's Day. I guess we're taking it to be April second. There, I guess, four beats, technically. All right. Back in a bit. Master Halo from Halo. Master Halo. That's like saying Metroid from Metroid. Yeah, Miss Metroid. Metro ever learn how to crawl? I don't know. I'll have to ask them sometime. Maybe we'll find out with Mayo's game. Maybe so. You know that Game Boy Color Metroid game. <laughs> that should exist somewhere, right? I guess ROM hacks are on the table. They are, that's true. That'd be a crazy ROM hack. Well, I mean, I guess... Game Boy did have... Metroid 2, just change it to a Game Boy Color game. And it's better. I don't think it had a color version, did it? No. Oh, I have a game in there. It's Chip and Dale. We've already seen it. Sort of. 
Yeah, chip and Dale with a heavy parenthesis around it. It's I Mega Man 12. A... Yeah, it's Mega Man 12. Oh, you're right. Yeah, my mistake. Chip it's and Dale. Mega Man quotations 12. needed. <laughs> it's Mega Man 12, the journey through time and space. I can't wait for Mega Man 13. I feel like that's when they're really gonna just... Get the yeah. gameplay perfect. Mega Man 13. We ran out of ideas, so we're reusing old ones. To make more money. It's always with the money. I have a feeling the Zelda CDI's being remastered for the Switch was an April Fool's joke. I'm very sure of that. I, there is 0% <laughs> chance that would ever happen. Uh, Man, I'm reminded... Okay, but, but what if? <laughs> <laughs> what if? I mean, Nintendo would just relive their worst nightmare. <laughs> yeah. Uh, for no reason. What if they remade it and it was actually, like, amazing? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'd be down. Like, it's just a completely different game. The only similarity is it's a side-scroller still. <laughs> <laughs> I'm reminded, though, of, like, when I was streaming yesterday, somebody came into my channel and was like, oh, did you see the new KH4 trailer? I'm like, what? I not look it up. I'm like, wait, I forgot what day it was. <laughs> I've, I've, been, I've been fooled over the prospect of Kingdom Hearts information. Well, yes, there was a new Kingdom Hearts game. It's uh, Kingdom Hearts... On Archipelago. There is, yeah. I haven't Miss done a Kate Shoe right in a hot minute. I like so, the sound of Sonic Shuffle DX director list cut. They, <laughs> the <director> list cut. <laughs> they just couldn't get one. <laughs> Archipelago for their April Fools. They've updated last year's April Fools to have another 100 joke checks for their Archipelago Idol. And the new game, their new joke game, is literally you push a button, you win. Unless you unless you want to be a masochist and do a hard mode where you have to click twice to win. And no, I'm not joking about that. Another good April Fools was OBS's. You get an official badge. For your, on your content for only six dollars ninety nine cents per stream or recording. Oh hell only, yeah! Finally, only, only charged for content more than ten minutes in length. Oh and well, that's easy. The badge says OBS verified stream super duper official. Good. I mean, just being super official isn't good enough. Did you guys see? <laughs> Did you guys see the Smash patch notes that came out today? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mario forward air attack. It's extended range of the high damage part of the attack. Jigglypuff other oh, decreased weight. There's some other good ones in here. All fighters made so opponents can no longer be trapped in place during Kazuya's taunt attack. <laughs> Let's see here. There's some other good ones on here. Yes, yeah, Sephiroth increased weight. Uh, Steve increased your ability of all golden tools. Hero increased appearance rate of the Kamikaze spell. <laughs> Listen, the patch was real to me. Like, there's some good ones in here. This is just some stupid ones. Like, Peach down air attack. It made it easier for one to escape. Increased the likelihood of pulling a bomb on. I'm not really sure what my favorite like April Fool's thing I saw today was. 
I guess hmm. like the murder of Sonic is a pretty neat one. That's that probably the like the big one everyone's talking about. Just because yeah. it's yeah. so well done. I haven't played yeah. it yet, but I, I haven't to. either. Yeah, I'm, I'm the same way. I don't know when I'm playing it. I feel like it's like, oh, if I stream it, it's like, you know, I, I shouldn't wait too long on it, you know, but also at the same time, it's like, I almost feel like at this rate, I might just end up playing it on my own time. I don't know. Not like I need to just fucking stream everything, I guess. One of my favorite ones was Kaze fixing grass in Super Mario 64. A problem that nobody cared about, but he just went out of his <laughs> way to produce. <laughs> like, how long was it? Like, 30 minute, yeah, 35 yeah. minute video fixing grass in Mario 64. <laughs> that video was like the equivalent of when you're in high school trying to write an essay and need to extend the word count. <laughs> I love that dude's videos. So good. I just love that kind of like extremely creative like content about like the stupidest of like topics. Yeah. I like my other favorite one that came today. It's a Smash thing. Whenever uh Gimmer was doing the the slingshot tech thing, but the mm -hmm. back to the lab again incident happened. So turned down for Walt, did a whole video. <laughs> like explaining how far Gimmer had walked in the intro <laughs> to the <laughs> thing that never happened. <laughs> oh yeah, I, dude. I, I, I posted it. Later. <laughs> I posted it in my Discord server. It's a great video. <laughs> Turned down for Walt's breakdowns are the best, but like his April Fools videos are legendary. Like he did like last year, I think it was how uh how much energy Hungry Box produces when he pops off or something. <laughs> God, that is the same guy, huh? God, I yeah. watch that stuff because I love the descriptions for the videos. They're just so stupid. Yeah. Turned out for Walt. Ah, turned down for Walt's content is great. Mm-hmm. Mostly melee stuff. So, like, if you're not into melee, you know. But I mean, yeah. there's some stuff in there for everybody. Of course, yeah. Oh yeah, let me run to the night trap FMVs on GBA. I didn't know that. Yeah. That's hilarious. I know, like, uh, Pokemon Showdown, what they do every April, April Fool's is just they just replace the sprites of all the Pokemon with just, like, dumb shit. <laughs> like, they turn, like, the fuck, what was it, Fido into just, like, just, like, a PNG of, like, a dog with, like, bread around it. It's, like, Ugh. just, like, dumb shit like that. Alright, I'm back. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back. Uh, I missed you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. I miss me on a regular basis, too. And I miss you. Da -da 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 -da. Do you miss all the different versions of you? Some of them. Who do you miss the least? <laughs> Pick one. <laughs> so choose your words carefully. Ooh. Ooh. To that. Ooh. I'm pretty sure that meant. Yeah. I don't know which me I hate the most. Can I say me me or is that too therapy ish? Maybe steer away from that one. <laughs> okay, I'll keep that in mind. Vanimal, thank you for the uh, the cow with no message. Cool Owl says, playing roulette, betting on Rosa. Did not get Rosa. Mikey DCT says, John's Sanity Fund. Then Oogie McTalk also says, John's Sanity Fund. Rosa cocks a gun. Yeah. Yeah. That tracks. Rosa's haunted. What? Not who you hate, who you miss the least. Yeah, no, I stand by my answer then. <laughs> I miss me the least, because I have so many problems. Sorry if I'm doing the glib thing again, but sometimes, sometimes it, it works. Becky Star Wait. says, Hey John, so this past week I went through the Yakuza ga uh, games I had since I already beat Zero last December, and I beat them all! Going up through six, Jesus. In the way, the past nice. week? In the past I, week? I'm week? guessing I they didn't, uh, full beat it, just... They didn't complete it, they just beat it. 
Even so, the storyline takes a bit for some of them. I went fast. All right, Becky confirms. Hey, hey, fair enough. And now I'm content to move on to other things. No more heavy action games for me because they wrecked my sleep. That's fair. Like I said, going through all those is a lot of games, so... But nice to done either way. Tiger Tiger says, for Bagel's Cat Food Fund. Codename Vixen says, Bagel is the best cat son you've ever had. Also cow. Thank you for the mission accomplished from Bad Chest Pun. And Bleach Bummer says... Little update as well, John. You probably remember I've been fighting the Data Organization 13 in my level 1 critical mode file for Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix since recovering. Well, after growing frustrations trying to fight Data Larksan, I decided to discard my desire for a fitting end and defeated both Roxas and Zenmus today, which now means I beat 12 out of 13, and well, you already know who that one left is. Pray for my sanity. Doesn't help I gave myself a panic attack by accidentally deleting my save file while still in the game. Oh, Jesus. Ooh. So I had a chance to resave and avoid losing progress. That would have been bad. Monaco can likely tell you how horrifying of a box lar boss Larksan is in Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix, so you can hopefully imagine how nightmarish she is at level 1 critical mode. Yeah, I'm gonna be real. I don't like a game enough to do that. <laughs> so, more power to you for doing it. She's kind of on the tough side, but there's ways that she's or like, Donald Duck is like the best cheese for Larksan. Donald's limits are, like, ex exceedingly good. It's great. Yuki Mizuno says, This was my favorite joke today. Made me smile. Summit Sphere says, Summit Sphere is proud to finally announce that we are working with Cartoon Network to deliver Ed, Ed, and Eddie the Miss Adventures Remaster Ed. We couldn't be more excited to revisit Peach Creek and Glorious Ed K. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, it was a... There's a joke post about Ed Ed and Eddie misadventures. Yeah. My favorite thing I've started saying to be stupid recently is like, when someone like tries to like fool me, I say, to quote Sha Shaquille O'Neal's interviews from Hot One, you tricked me. I don't know, I just, I just, I just find something really funny about just the way he says you tricked me in that video. You tricked me. <laughs> you tricked me. That's right, you gotta say it as basic as possible. You tricked me. Yeah. Alright, art block, what we got here? I think we just barely slid onto page two. Sure did. All right. Art block is a go. Starting with this piece right here. It's a mini Rosa from Junko. It's that time of year again when Rosa gets shrunken down as flat as pancakes, which she's enjoying right now. That is a nice stack of pancakes. I could really go for some pancakes right now. Should have had an almond bar while I was upstairs. Damn it. Thank I'm you, Junko. Pancakes now. I want pancakes. Next up from Arizona. So I've been a little too obsessed with Limbus Company, so I don't have a proper April Fool's drawing, but as a non-joke for today, I decided to finally give the incorrect TRG Quotes blog on Tumblr a new icon. The joke of the blog is that the icon is also incorrect, and for the longest time, the icon was some variation of John wears a popo mask for 100% orange juice because it was always a funny idea for TRG to play it, but I figured they wouldn't because it was a Steam game, and then they played it, so the icon was no longer incorrect. So now it's going to be really damn hard to make the icon correct because behold, John with the EGO telepole from Limbus Company. Basically, uh, Electric Cerberus Werewolf? Ooh, cool. Anyways, hope you enjoy. I might draw more TRG cross Limbus now that I've got 60 hours in the game. Sadly, turns the game back on. I've heard those who play those games tend to really like them. Like, once you're into those, you're really into them, so. Thank you, Eric. Next up. My god, it's Jen. It's Kawaii Jen. From Chaos Agents, it's been a bit, so I drew Jen in her usual getup. Huh? She looks different. What do you mean? She's always been really girly. This this sweet girl wouldn't hurt a fly. I feel like this is Jenny, not Jen. But there you go. I mean, that's at least the way you can do it outside of April Fool's Day, but thank you for the sweet Jen. She's so shy and demure. Definitely, definitely my opposite. Oh, we only have 11 April Fool's posts. Yeah, surprising. And they're probably all from this year, too. Probably. No, actually. Only, like, four using the tag this year. Next up, from Kiranai Hideyoshi. Yippee! Here's my April Fool's piece, <laughs> where I've depicted myself as the TBH creature, the Internet's manifestation of autism. 
And yes, I do indeed have autism, high functioning, therefore meaning that I reap more benefits than I suffer from drawbacks. But of course, it is a spectrum. I just got lucky and I'm willing to run with these rabbit feet to the finish. Kind of weird for me to reveal this during April Fools of all things, but this part ain't no joke. I'll continue contributing to, as another humble member of this undeserving com understanding community. <laughs> Thanks, Kira and I. Is that the thing that makes the yippee noise that Cole's always quoting and in a bunch of memes? Yeah, that's, it's that's from the one that this? Wow, I had no idea. I, I thought it was like a yeah. fucking Caillou thing. <laughs> Not quite. No. I've never seen an image. I've only heard the audio and I thought it was some weird Caillou thing. Dude, the, the internet just hates Caillou. There's no way they would ever Oh, I like, absolutely. Like, yeah, yeah, you're right. Good point. And they let him thrive. Oh, let me find the original. Again, I haven't seen any images. I've only heard the audio. It usually, like, superimposed over other footage. From Learn to Chillax, if I had a nickel for every time I did a butterfly meme recently, I'd have two nickels. Strange as it happens twice so soon. Congrats, John. You actually made me feel insulted by saying this about Witch. And mind you, I barely remember seeing the animated ad adaptation years ago. So here, this is your punishment. A meme for me. I, st I mean... It looked like Wings Club characters on the title screen, so I stand by my random ass guess. No, I'll, either I'll way, stand this, by it too. This either way, I don't think it was in my demographic, so. And honestly, still looking at some of these characters, you you could tell me these are from Wings, and I'd absolutely believe you. Like well, some of the smaller ones here on her shoulder. Look, she even looks like she got a butterfly wing there. That she's wearing Winks right there. Or Sky Dancers. She's wearing Sky Dancers. Whatever. Is that the one that like went to like that fireplace? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, just wondering. They were done by the same studio, so the wings comparison makes sense. Amazing, amazing. So I'm not wrong for thinking that. Next up is Rosa, waking up in the morning. A normal sleepy Rosa doing a stretch. Just your average Rosa, John. Mm-hmm. Tag. Very nice. Big old stretch. She's got a very nice bedroom. She's got little stars, those galaxy walls there. She's got a nice pink pillow. Nice blue blankets. Good shit. Thank you, Jomini, for this completely normal picture of Rosa John. Next up, this completely normal picture of Pon Pon. Huh? What are you doing? What's your ulterior motive? Is this a bait? From Horizon Strider. I was going to post a sad Pon Pon April Fool's lore, but because a game I was playing a decent amount of has announced end of service, it's kind of in a funk. So fine. Have some nice head pats for once, Pon Pon. Happy April Fool's, I guess. The big sad lore is still coming, but I figured it was probably a good idea to put a hold on that if I was also feeling the medium sad. Also, who knows? Maybe head patting Pon Pon becomes a good luck charm. Maybe. She's just more confused about it. I don't think most succubus are used to getting just that random head pat. Thank you, Horizon. If the game was Wings Club, the VOD would be super muted because the intro plays the 4Kids intro. Oh, God. Okay. I would have checked for that one, like, prior. Would it catch it on the Game Boy Advance, though? It could. That's why I can't technically watch those SpongeBob episodes. I mean, those are also episodes of a show. Yeah, I was yeah. gonna say. It's all Mario ROM hacks? Always has been. From No Account Gamer, Happy April Fools, John. I hope you recover from tonight. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. Someday. So I am threading, uh, I'm threading for the other mods and your, the other Colcoms that actually pick shit games. Threading how you're going to get us back for this. I showed that one. I'll find a way. <laughs> Love Drake and Josh. Noir. <laughs> God damn it, man. I could... <laughs> I forgot it was two years since I joined the Buru. Hee hee hee. Here's Rosa John enjoying pancakes. Hee hee. Beefroo's happy. Kermit's happy. Bagel or Bagel Luma's happy. Rosa got a pancake. Even Tiger's involved somehow. Two years of pancakes. And then the follow up piece, which does not want to load. Oh my god. <laughs> what the yeah, fuck? I saw this one earlier. <laughs> hee hee. Also doubles as Rosa Nigel's birthday. Sorry, Tiger. There's Tiger writing Mortis. Oh yeah, there's Tiger. Tiger's wow. just dead in the background. I didn't even see them there. Dead. Also, this Tiger. Kermit, hella cursed. I hella cursed. fucking love it. It's so dumb, but so good. <laughs> My god, thanks, Noir. You really enjoy more curse shit, honestly. I, I like thrive in curse shit. <laughs> Casual fill up, John versus Egg, the gift. It's an egg. What else did you expect? Egg. 
This fighter is so freaking broken, these hitboxes are way too huge and disjointed. The, the mobility is just everywhere, and they have an absurd amount of health. God, I can't fucking wait for this character to get nerfed. Egg with box. Egg with football charge, hits a boulder. Egg with Ouroboros, oh my god. So much range. Also from Philip, I, okay, in all seriousness, it, it usually takes me over a week to finish the John vs. Post. I came up with the idea an hour before the stream started and finished this four hours later. I don't know what this says about me. God damn, nicely done, though. All the different egg uh, versions we have for subs. I need to get new ones. I think I'm actually at the limit. I think people have been subbed longer than the ones that we have, so I think now we're, we've actually hit a, a peak and we actually need to get more done. I don't know if the artist that got them done for me in the first place is still available. I may have to get a new person to do them. That works if we have to, yeah. Yeah, but I need to figure out what to add to the list, so. I mean, you've had, like, new stream memes since then. That's true. Thank you, Philip, for both of those, for the most broken character in John of Versus. And now the most broken version of me. Hey, guys, it's me. Definitely the real John. I had to draw the fan art for the April Fool's intro. Erica did an amazing job. I was wheezing. I mean, I don't know if it's just Canadians know how to do Canadians, other Canadians' mannerisms perfectly, but yeah, she she got me dead to rights. So convincing. Thank you, Prism. Next up. Dear Mario, do not come to the castle. I baked an absolute dog shit cake. Just completely fucked it up. I'm so sorry. Peach. From Pluto. Look, how could I draw a peach and not make this joke? Anyways, Peach is pretty famous for her cake. Hee <laughs> hee. How bad could it be? Utterly dog shit. See? Utterly dog shit. Oh, cool beefaroo cake, Peach. Oh my god, it's melting. Who threw beefaroo into a volcano? Oh my god. It looks like something that... Uh... Either you or Emil would make. I am. I, I actually am not that bad at baking cakes. No. Oh. I mean, you learn from Little John, so I mean, it's in your name. <laughs> Jesus. I thought, I thought any form of cooking or baking would result in a house fire. No, no, no. I, baking, I'm actually not that bad at. Okay. I just well, don't do sorry. it that often. My old roommate okay, taught me how to make my own birthday cake, so I did that one. Well, then I'm sorry, oh, nice. but the uh, joke. We have to go. Get somewhere you won't fall out. Only if I get pancakes. Sure. Figured I'd just do some normal art today. No special occasion, says Tiger. Honestly, Rosa can get a little annoying, a little boob gremlin that she is, but she's kind of endearing, I guess. It's hard to stay mad at her. Let's just hope she doesn't try and sneak me any more Rosa brew while I have breakfast. I already usually have issues finding pants that uh, don't just immediately die. I don't need trouble finding shorts, too. Hmm. Hmm. Weird how this table has turned here, huh? Weird how that is. So weird. Thanks, Tiger. Alright, I think we might be able to finish the row here, and then we're fully caught up. From Grease Lightning, it's the Alt of the Month with Peach John! Hooray for her! Slight redesign for my version of her, anyways. She's no doubt glad to be April's alt as I am. I found that I drew a bunch of the art on her, of her on the Buru before this month. Where's the time go? Based her pose off a Precure Cure Wing, the first male-identifying Precure from Soaring Sky Precure the current season. He's a good boy, and a bird. Cool. Thank you for the cute. I almost said Rosa John, because I'm just so used to saying that for the Mario character. For the cute Peach John. Thank you, Greased. What happened to Luigi? I misheard Battalion as Italian, so have a space Italian. <laughs> for fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. I, I said that the console into space. I'm Italian. <laughs> <laughs> You did it, John. Your dream is complete. Finally. From Sam. What's that? Backlog got bigger by 20 games? Good thing I brought my stretchy pants. You seem proud of yourself. Maybe. I heard that the backlog was getting bigger, and suddenly the gloves came off. From Sam, Spotted Alien Monster. Becky backlog can get bigger or smaller. While I implied she gets bigger as the backlog does, I suspect she also just gets bigger because... The hair strand on the top of her head is supposed to look like a bee for backlog. I gave her green accents to her hair, but that could change. It seemed appropriate. Hope people dig. We also changed the name, seeing Becky also has an entire entity in the tags, and I'm now concerned about it. Do we have a Becky in the tags? Who the fuck is the other Becky? Oh, when we did Pocky and Rocky with Becky. Okay, so yeah, this is the character Becky from Pocky and Rocky with Becky. Ah. Sam, if this is a representation of my backlog, she's never getting smaller. <laughs> she's literally just gonna be constantly outgrowing everything. But she's a cute you design. Thank you. What? Yeah, exactly. This basically the two of them are competing. Thank you, Sam. This is a super cute design. And the last one I got here 
No message on this one, but it looks like it's... Oh, I was about to say it's it's Batgirl, it's Barbara, but no, it's not, because I see a little crown there. Did you do a Batgirl Rosa fusion? Very cute otherwise. Thank you, AMZ, John. Let's see if there's a message on that one later, but let's get back to the game and the shuffles now. Oh yeah, we're playing bad dudes. Oh, we were. Are you a bad enough dude to save the president? Uh, we'll find out. And now back to not Miles games. I mean, I really oh. hope Miles game actually comes up. Let's let's be I real. Do too. Yeah. At this rate, if it doesn't come up, I may have to just be like, "All right, next stream we'll we'll just play the game to make sure it actually gets played." <laughs> we'll we'll play like the whole time. The entire stream. Yeah, the entire stream is that game. Dude, finish in thirty minutes. Just like do it again. <laughs> you know, he, he ends in 30 minutes. He's like, alright guys, I'm gonna go take a nap now. Good night. <laughs> Good stream. Yeah, yeah. That, that, that hot, hot content. Yeah, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> I love his little scurry. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh, he got okay. me, actually. Oh, no. NES games with their lack right, of get, animation get ready. is my favorite. Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> Go to next stage. That sounds dangerous. So, what's the scale of bad to, like, even worse? What? Like, like, how do we know, like, the scale of bad these bad dudes are? I mean, they're they're bad in, like, the, the, the rad sense. Like, they're, like, they're cool. They're bad. Don't bring them home Can to your parents, like... kids, because they'll they'll do something. They'll steal your radios. Ah, oh, my radio. Oh, so many radios are being stolen by the bad dudes. No. As they go save the president. Not I definitely the almost president. the president's daughter because of fucking Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. President, I'm not racist anymore. <laughs> I took Spanish. <laughs> Is that actually a line in the game? No, oh, it's no, just, it's just no. something they did for that, that meme video. It's like just a video someone did. But he does actually know Spanish in this game, and he didn't in, in the original Resident Evil 4. That actually is neat. I didn't know that. Dude, everything I've been seeing and hearing about like Resident Evil 4 Remake has just been just so good. I am kind of curious how they're going to remake uh, 5. I'll, I'll be honest, dude, I don't want a 5 remake. I think it's too early for that. I feel like they should go and do stuff like Code Veronica and stuff before they even think about 5. Oh, come on! Oh, that's gonna be game over, isn't it? Because Zero doesn't camp. Oh! They fucking took my, my library, library card. card. My library card? Oh, I have to do the first stage again! Aw. Oh. Game on! I think you can get blow through it this time. Let me go grab that one up at the very least. I, I, would, not, mm. I would not have said that. If Allison is still here, I'm curious on her thoughts. So I'm thinking right now, like, do we have you beat this stage again in another stage, or just say, fuck it, have you beat this again and call it for that? I mean, I like, I'd say still make it two because I'm pretty sure pretty sure I can get this no problem now. Mm -hmm. so, this came up so many times I kind of got used to the controls again, so. Oh, shoot, I, oopsie, I didn't see this message earlier. So Allison was saying, actually, uh, given how much time Page Master has gone already, if you want to drop the objective to just finishing the one level, I think that's fair. Oh, shit, okay. Well, then we'll just refinish yeah. this and then we'll wrap it then. All right. It is funny how often this one came up so far in the shuffle, though. Yeah, right, right? Page Master has just been, like, just... Absolutely, like, booking it in terms of like length. <laughs> Good one. Thank My you. Library card. My library card. How am I supposed to have fun with that? I can't have fun without that. It's legally, like, you know, not allowed. <laughs> legally? Yeah, dude. Because having fun, having fun isn't hard without a library card. If you don't have a library card, you're not allowed to legally have fun. Oh, so took my, in took the... my attack. Oh, hey, look what hasn't come up in a while. Hey, it's Draco's game. So in the movie, uh, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde is voiced by Leonard Nimoy. According, according to the wiki. Do you mind if we cut through over? We're just going to want you to do the first two stages now. 
Yeah. I don't think we ever got back to Kion's game either. No, Kion's is not showing up in hours. What was his game again? Mario R. Oh. So it's like a Mario 1 randomizer. Randomizes like levels and enemies and all that. Yeah, apparently oh, I, I, I did not get the memos that we were supposed to give John the worst trash we've ever seen. I put on the announcement. I don't know what you want me to tell you. <laughs> I said, oh, I said all right, I'll give him a game from my childhood. And I, I do feel like I maybe could have like pinged like a little bit more on that one in hindsight. I'm sad. Jumney says they're sad they missed the memo completely. Oh, sorry, Jumney. Next time for sure. I, th I think for sure next time I will be better about it, like putting that like up in like uh, Cocom's room and all that. Starting to realize that a lot of our childhoods were bad. Yeah, why do you think I'm good at so many bad games? I played a lot of bad games in my childhood. And then as a game collector, that just transferred into just how game collecting goes. And mm -hmm. then the streams and everything else. Okay, question. Worst oh, yeah, game you've ever games. played? What? Worst game you ever played? Uh, that's a good question, actually. I don't know if I have an answer to that off the top of my head. Any of the games you've seen tonight? I don't think any of those games I've seen tonight are really the worst I've played. Do any of them get close? Wait. Probably, but like I'm blanking right now on like. Oh, there we go. That's where the health extension is. I'm guessing we're not counting ROM hacks because that's cheating. ROM hacks would be cheating because yeah, I could just say Kaiser or some shit like that. Orb 3D is probably is definitely up there. Yeah, Orb 3 might be, might be like my least favorite like regular game I've played, like actually commercially available game. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! Oh, it finally it just came up. Showed up. You gotta be it kidding me. Came up. <laughs> Yoda stories. I was just talking with Maya about swapping it too. <laughs> so Yoda yet. stories. Mm. I gave Michael two games to choose from, and we were talking, and judging by how rude the list was being, I was saying, "Go for the other game if the list is bad." And Manaiko went ahead with this anyway. So, this was the other game that I chose, but not the game that I had really meant for John. It, it's fine. <laughs> it's okay. Is it? Do you want me to I, say what the game, the other game would have been? I'm curious. Wayne's World? Which one? SNES. I would have enjoyed that one. I know, right? I, I was like, I was like, I was like, this was a bad game in my opinion but it would have been something that john would like because he had a positive reception to it mm -hmm. yeah that game was my childhood dude what is this choppy movement it, this is a <laughs> choppy zelda like like this is terrible it's pretty bad speaking of pretty bad just like this <laughs> well that's i forgot you were paused <laughs> That's the point, John. You're not supposed to enjoy yourself tonight? I mean, I guess. So I was talking with my own DMs just now, actually. John, do you want Wayne's World more right now than you do, like, Star Wars? Because you could just, like, get Wayne's World for it and just, like, swap it real quick. I mean, if you want, sure. We could just pretend Star, Star Wars never happened. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Let's just, let's just mulligan it. Say, <laughs> this is revisionist history. <laughs> I don't care. Look, you don't need to tell me about revisionism right now. I, I can make the rules. I'm the math. <laughs> that, that, um, okay. Well, um, um, <laughs> he is Wilder. the one who pages. I am the one who pages. <laughs> I am the one who knocks. I watch Breaking Bad. I'm not allowed to be a drug lord. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, they give you a certificate of permission. I don't think that's the point of Breaking Bad, but sure. <laughs> nah, that, that's definitely it. That was definitely what happened. Yeah, obviously. The showrunners mailed me the certificate. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, he mailed me my, my drug maker's license. <laughs> I was like a PhD because I'm a pharmacist now, apparently. Congrats. 
A student PhD in a pharmacy, whatever. No. No. To be a drug dealer? No. <laughs> <laughs> drug dealer? Like, I'm a pharmacy. I think you don't need a PhD for that, but you need it's like. It's different to uh, secondary PhD. degree. It's a different degree, yeah. 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 Like, Damn it, it's in the wrong order. School. Starting to get this nonsense under control now. I was about to say, <laughs> you look like you're moving now. Oh, wait, I just had a thought. Is it gonna work if it's a different system? Uh, you know what, it might not actually. I'm not sure, but I think it does look at the extension. Hmm. I don't know. I actually don't know how to answer that. Yeah, I'm thinking about that now. Like, uh -oh, I would cause... just play it safe and not mess with it. Because if it tries to load the wrong game, I think it might mess up. Maybe. All right, so here's here's how we fix this, fix this, right? We find a means to play Wayne's World on stream again. I mean, I feel like I need an excuse. <laughs> no, it's funny. Like one time, I was like playing like Wayne's World, and it was supposed to be part of like a whole like weird games or bad games marathon and then you shut up being all like oh man wayne's world and i'm all like oh so it's all like uh i still i still want to make the wayne's world extreme close-up and alert i oh, think man. oh hang on <laughs> With wayne's world snes i want to either make this part an alert let me quickly jump over here <laughs> I either want to make that an alert, or I want to make this an alert. Why not both? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You knew what it was going to be. I actually had a thought of like, if I went for Wayne's World, it would have just been to see this screen for the challenge. Oh yeah, for sure. This would have been a good challenge. Did they have to pay a license for this song? I think it's so far removed, it's fine. It's just bad, like, Bohemian Rhapsody. <laughs> it kind of works out. You can also watch the Genesis version of this, too. Oh, God. Is the oh, Genesis I'm sure that's even worse. What's the Genesis one like? Let's find out. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why I want this as an alert, because it just makes no fucking sense. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yeah, this, this is, totally is definitely bot safe. safe. This is definitely bot safe. And let me let me find the uh, the other one here. Genesis. Yeah. What time is it in this video? I'm like skimming through it. Uh, I hope they have the nasty Genesis guitar. No, it's it's you in there. I can hear it. Yeah. For the record, I love Genesis sounds. <laughs> Oh yeah, listen to that Genesis crunch. It's not even zooming in. It can't because <laughs> that's wiggling. the thing. It's a mode seven thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just go I left love the and right. Wiggle. Which was your favorite wiggle? All right, here we go. Here it is. Yeah, like fourteen minutes in, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't have enough sound channels. <laughs> Did you Faces hear the story of how the producers of Wayne's World asked for Queen's blessing to use Bohemian Rhapsody, and when they showed it to Freddy, he cracked up laughing while sick in bed? No, I didn't hear that. That's awesome. He has some really good faces. <laughs> this is the face of this one might be better, actually. <laughs> You, it looks like the guy in the back right is just disappearing for a second because the black <laughs> is so deep. All right, this reminds me. There's a new alert I've got Draco working on. Uh, I I will show you one version of it. It's gonna be another multi-version one, kind of like how. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's it's still in the works. Uh, 
Oh shoot, the regular one. He never actually gave me a viewable link. I only have it in. Uh... <laughs> I think if I show you, I'll show you the image of it, and and I think this, I think the image alone is I don't even shouldn't even show the actual alert. I think just showing you this image is all I should do. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's all I should do is just show you this image and like that's the alert. That's the alert. Is this all we need, dude? <laughs> is this uh, Hulk uh, playing the uh, Hulk song from the uh, that? Dovey made. I, should I should I show you a version of the alert, or should I just leave it with this mystery? Because I kind of love I like leaving the, it without any I context. I think the mystery is better. Leave I it as know it is now. Okay, I think you're right. I think the mystery is better. <laughs> <laughs> I think the mystery is way better. <laughs> oh my god, Draco, it's up to Everyone's you. Whatever you want me to, whatever you want me to show. If you want me to show anything. Uh, I, <laughs> I forgot that. I, I, I sent Draco this audio because I was like, yo, I, I can't. I want to think of an alert that uses this audio. You got any ideas? He's like, yeah, hang on. And like a couple days later, he sent me that image. <laughs> I'm just like, perfect. So you can do like any of the uh, four stages here, like any option you want. Just got one more. It's not the same one as in my dream. Whoa. These alerts will likely... Some of them will be running probably, like, next week. Once the $10 thing's done, you can show it probably. All right, that's what I figured. Sweet. Here we go again. Back to Sonic. Oh my God, if it wasn't for the fucking speed you move in the water, this wouldn't be that bad. It would still be pretty bad. <laughs> it would still be pretty bad. Let's, I guess let's not mince words too much here. But... I'm a Metropolis Zone apologist. I actually love Metropolis Zone. I, I don't mind why. it when I'm not using water physics. Oh, well, that's your problem. Just stop. I would love to. <laughs> get out of the water. Just I'd find the top of it. I've been trying. I found the top water. of the water. I can't get out of it because there's I a forget. ceiling there. Just who swim. Was, who is that? Uh, game with this? This is mine. Damn it. <laughs> there's so many Son- there's trick enough Sonic games I'm getting confused. Okay, that's fine. Oh, speaking of- <laughs> That's great. That's- that's just fine. Sure, why not? You'll be fine. There's a bubble okay. coming up after that. Oh, nice. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if John ends up missing the bubble when he goes back. Oh, no, don't nah, he'll have plenty of time. He's got four seconds. Yeah. I'll say on the on Metropolis Zone, just clear Act 1. Yeah, I would agree with that. You also have a lot of confidence if you're saying clear Act 1. Alright. So you can reach a checkpoint in Act 1. Speaking so of like Act 1, we haven't seen Mario Frustration in a while. I'm not gonna lie, I was originally waiting for that to pop up again before I joined the call, and then it just wouldn't pop up. <laughs> Man, so how, are you, how are you today, Dalton? Tired. Good. I'm doing a lot of drawing. I didn't even know that existed. Yeah. Wait, seriously? Yeah, I mean, I never go that way, so... Huh. Fair. I was trying to, I was something and I also too. rarely play Sonic 1. Spin dash, just do that. Something I thought there was something there too, but I guess not. There would be enough space to like run in normal Sonic one. To get, like, I think a, like, there was dash. another secret like that in like Act Two or Three. Something like that. There's, there's one in Act Three that skips where you half can just the stage. Go through a wall, yeah. Man, good times thinking about like this like game. We raced it all that, all those like months back. That was great. That wasn't even that many months ago. <laughs> Yeah, it, was, it, was like a, it was like half a year ago now. All those, like, three, four months ago. I I, I keep thinking back to this, uh, the Thomas the Tank Engine. Uh, oh, God. Act. That from, like, so many years ago, John streamed that, yeah. Oh, God, that was so good. When I'm through with you, they'll never <laughs> find your body. And even if they do, all they'd find would be teeth. Let's try this again. X Man. That 
That was like right around the Kermit stuff too, so like yeah. it, it was perfect timing on accident with that. Yeah. Never would have expected like a spy Muppets game to be like what would lead to just like a big like mascot of sorts. I, <laughs> I don't know what happened, but those like two years was a fever dream. <laughs> two years? Yeah. Let's be real, a lot of this stream can be summed up as fever dream. A lot of the history of this stream. I learned the bi-directional stab. Press X and A. It was at least a year. I don't want more stage for this one. Yeah, but the stage yeah. is the worst part. Quarry. Welcome to a minecart stage. Oh, that is so oh. bad. That's bad. Oh. Oh, you can go through that? Okay. I Yeah, I thought you were going to have to walk on top of that one. Well, the top hurt. Yeah, the top with spikes. Insta kill, I believe, too, with that. Ooh. Yeah. I missed the title screen. <laughs> <laughs> Most of us do. I think it now, like a game I would have chosen that wasn't like Mega Man. I just had the thought of like maybe like one of like the GBA like Spiros or something. Those aren't like super great. I mean, that that has to kind of all right, but maybe like one of like, the bad ones like. Like Spiral Orange or Crash Purple. Those can be kind of like decent, I think. <laughs> Climbing animation. Oh, God. Back to Kari. Yeah, we were actually doing pretty good in Akari Warriors, which is what worries me. We're just finishing one stage in this one, right? Yeah, if I can live long enough and if the ABBA code works. ABBA. One day we'll see Kion's game again. We okay. found Mayo's game. Anything's possible. This tank is my tank, not yours. Chain Memories? No, that's a good game. Chain Memories is great. Well, no, I picked that for like a bad game shuffler thing. Love Chain of Memories. Oh. Uh, next shuffler, we are giving John good games. I would, I would love that. That'd be great. Well, actually, let me out this time. Nice. I, I mean, a good game shuffler could be cool. Yeah. The game shuffler or John having fun that'd be great sure I'm down <laughs> yeah let's do that yeah yeah but what day is appropriate for that your birthday I mean, I've already done shuffles for my birthday so I guess um, that's true what's the opposite of April Fool's hmm Christmas yeah <laughs> Well, no, that would imply people to... steal things from you on April Fools, which I I, I don't think we've gotten to that point. <laughs> oh, it's not letting me back yet. Oh, it barely did. Oh my god. There you go. This code freaks me out every time. So is it like a rhythm, or do you just mash it? I I try. I had every time it works, I had I had to do it slower. Was it like level two of Jungle Book? Put him up, put him up, uh, put him no, up. This is still the first one, isn't it? This is, is the it? first one, yeah. I love his dance. <laughs> I think if you get all the gems in a stage, you get like a continue code, or just might just be the bonus stage. Jungle nice. It's a bonus stage. Chapter two is your last stage, so if you get this one, you're done with Jungle Book. Oh, yeah. I like how in the Jungle Book sequel movie, they have like Haley Joel Osment voicing Mowgli. There's a sequel? Yeah, it's not good. <laughs> like a lot of Disney sequels. Yeah. There's, this there's thing, some that are all This right. thing moves, and I forget how that activates it. It's a floating platform. Something activates it. I'd say, like, Kronk's New Groove is, like, not a bad Disney sequel, just because it's more Emperor's New Groove. I like Return of Jafar. Yeah, Return of Jafar is good. I know, like, King of Thieves is supposed to be, like, really good, too. Oh, there we go. Dragonfly surfing. Oh, God. So are there not different weapons in this game? Nope, bananas. That's it. Okay, yeah, there is in the Genesis. There's like five different weapons that you can oh, use. Oh, I have that too, yeah. No, there's like boomerangs and stuff, I think. Uh, I don't know, it's been a while. I know there's definitely boomerangs. There might be later weapons, I just don't, I only remember using the bananas. Yeah, Leo and Stitch, sequels aren't too bad. I'm seeing, uh, was not I just saw there. Oh yeah, Lanking one and a half. That one's oh. great, just, oh. <laughs> 
I right, forgot there's like about no, There's no iframes in this fucking game. That's what I forgot about. Oh, there's no death music! Cinderella 3... No, they, gotta, they gotta get their money's worth out of bare necessities. That's true. Man, they're... I, I mean, I know all the... The old... Disney games are, like, different between the consoles, but, like... This is the only one that I actually know, because I grew up with the Genesis Jungle Book. Really? Yeah. It's kind of making me want to go back and play it, but I know it's only fun for, like, the first four levels. <laughs> they added it to... You know that collection they did a while back of, like, uh, Aladdin and Lion King? They added it to that. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, it, it's the Genesis versions in that pack, isn't it? <laughs> or is it the SNES? Be, God damn it. I thought it was only one. Maybe I'm dumb. Maybe they're both there? I don't know. Like, I... I admittedly didn't go out of my way to go look. I didn't either. I, I know they re-released it with all three, and I think they did, did like a DLC pack you can get for the uh, if you bought the the two pack. Mm -hmm. Okay. Shit, shit. Bad dudes. I, I do appreciate like in Jungle Book, you're just infinite supply of bananas. Oh, SNES Aladdin isn't there because that was Capcom. Maybe that's what I'm thinking about. Oh yeah, that would be the that's one thing because they were all otherwise the uh, Virgin. Virgin. Yeah. That makes a lot more sense then. Out of my head. No. Dang, so that one's still in limbo then, huh? Because there's no way it's going to get released otherwise, I think. Probably not, yeah. It sucks too, because it is. I like that one more, personally. That's what yeah. I hear for the most part. If I played of like SNES and Genesis, I'd definitely prefer SNES Aladdin. But the Genesis has a sword! You idiots, yeah, we have animation. Too. Hey! I guess I'll you for saying that. Oh. Bless you. Wow, that came out of nowhere. Dude, I feel those sometimes. Sneak up on you. It's crazy. Oh, that's cheating. Yep. This boss sucks. There's like a there's like a way to trick him, but I forget what it is. I think it might be just jumping up and down. Do we all have like separate health bars or? You have to kill them all so the real one shows up and then you fight the real one for a bit and then he eventually makes more clones. Kind of reminds me of like the Murasaki fight from Dragon Ball Advance Adventure. I mean, you're like in like Muscle Tower, he's got like clones, they all have their own health bars and you fight the real one after. I see you're doing the Mortal Kombat. Problem is I have no lives left. Oh, SNES, well, yeah, SNES Aladdin is part of the collection now. Pre -star oh, thing. really? When'd they do that? Uh, whenever Jungle Book was added, apparently. Wild. Oh, actually, you know what? <laughs> I think I remember them that being part of the ads for it. Yeah, no. Cool. There's a lot of guys here. Oh, God. Hey, Star Wars. <laughs> Same move over and over. <laughs> Dude, you move so fast. And, like, <laughs> I don't know. It's just <laughs> something about it. They could have done better. I mean, of course they could have done better, but wouldn't it have made the money? That's the Did this make them money? Probably. Maybe. I don't know why, but this reminds me of Pokemon. I don't know why. I think it's the face. It's definitely the face. I could see that. <coughs> right, Wait, here. is that a... <laughs> what is that? I don't know, but I need a sample of real. Where we can find real at? I don't probably, know. Probably the bar. Probably. How much do you know your Star Wars? <laughs> I love the angry face on the freaking stormtrooper. <laughs> nice day.
Wait, where's the stormtrooper? On oh, the left. Oh. Oh. oh, well, not anymore. No, no, no get- Ah, oh, dang it, dude! Oh, that's that's so nice. I'm so curious, I don't know if you can- So, like, in the original Sonic the Hedgehog, you can- in the in the first special stage, if you do nothing, it'll drop you into the room with the emerald. Mm. So I wonder if it'll be like that in this one. It doesn't work in Origins because they changed it, and now the animation's too smooth and it doesn't work. Mm -hmm. I think we've actually seen Mayo's game more than we have Kion's by this point. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it came up which twice, is crazy. so yeah. Twice versus once. Let's see, Killer Instinct, uh, Page Match is almost done, Kari Warriors is almost done. I don't know what the fuck's going on with Build Set anymore, to be honest with you. <laughs> Man, I haven't figured that out in a while, yeah. Yeah. Where's that shield? Uh, let's see here. Mario Frustration has just refused to show up. It showed up a lot earlier. Yeah, right? Now it's just taking a break. Gotta or go fast! Beans. Trust me, I'm Shrek trying. Halfway done. It's weird how it, like, stores your speed on the wall. I mean, I ain't complaining. Yeah, no, right? It makes that section a little more bearable. <laughs> no, yeah. Like the one time. That was Sonic Origins. It's, it's fine. Let's hope the update fixes some weird stuff about it. It's got a lot of... It's very quirky, but, uh... Like, you know, it, it's playable. It's fine. Uh, I need a ring or a checkpoint. Otherwise, I'm going back to the beginning of the stage. I'm probably going to get neither. Uh, I can never see that spring without thinking of that Meverse pose. <laughs> oh, shit. Star Trek. All right, we gotta, we gotta go find the people and get court marshaled. These are not the. Joining the Enterprise, beam me to stick bay. Well, that's one strike. <coughs> I'm very sick. I got shot. No. I think Eleanor would allow you. <laughs> I would not have. Well, technically, that would be the fastest way to get a game over. Damn it, it won't <laughs> let me do it. Can't do four Picards. I tried. <laughs> Uh, Worf would have the strongest phaser. I love his strut. Data. <laughs> Got just it. Want, just wanted to see if that would work. <laughs> <laughs> no. He's, oh! Damn, he opened that with his teeth. That was impressive. <laughs> what did they call him, Data? Say that should be all the enemies. Where's this lady? We gotta, we gotta shoot her with our phaser. There she is. Crew member of the USS <laughs> Enterprise has been charged with the phaser stunning of Dr. Talirus, the note of Vulcan archaeologist. Dr. Talirus is expected to recover, but this action has so outraged the people of the Federation that the Enterprise has been recalled from its mission until a thorough investigation of the case can be made. And with that, that challenge is done. <laughs> <laughs> did it! <laughs> Court-martialed, yay! <laughs> oh, oh, great, right. Oh, back to the hole. <laughs> right, back to the pit for you, John. Back to the pit. I actually have to restart. I'm literally stuck. Yep. I cannot believe you did that earlier, dude. That thing fucking, like, slorped you. you, you it, it was like you were, like, the tubby custard in the fucking, like, vacuum like, cleaner was coming up to get you. <laughs> Sorry, okay, sorry. Lathering to repeat that? The what, what in the what? Did you make a fucking Teletubbies reference? Yeah, yeah. dude. <laughs> you, were, you were the scrolled tubby custard, and the vacuum's coming up to get you. I'd stay away yeah. from that wild, for that. John. I would stay away from that wall just to be safe. I, I don't even remember which wall it was at this point. I don't think he intentionally ran into it anyways. I would, so. I'm telling I would you, say all the walls. 
John, I was actually very disappointed to see recently you actually don't have a Teletubbies game. Wait, I thought I did. Oh. No, he yeah, played one one time, didn't so, he? So uh, that cost me a life just then, in case you were wondering. Oh, gross. Yeah. And there are no continues. You only earn continues from like getting like a high score, and you can't get a high score in the first stage. So when I did this for Cusa Grande, I literally had to memorize which order to hit things. See? Game over. Wow. That is some horse shit. If you hit trees or rocks or the giant dudes, uh, you lose a life. I swear there was a Teletubbies game on Cookie one time. I swear I have one for PS1. That's what I was thinking. I, I checked your backlog one time. I couldn't find it. Maybe I spelled Teletubbies wrong. I don't know. Maybe. I'm going to fucking check right now. I know it's not been on stream. That part is that part's correct. Oh, well then I'm a liar. It's play with Teletubbies, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay, well, that wasn't what I was expecting. I <laughs> I was on YouTube and typed in Teletubbies Proton John, the first link is is freaking Jules Teletubbies murdering in plain sight. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's the correct video. <laughs> Probably not. How did you warp through the block? <laughs> I'm, I don't know, I moved it. You moved it, but not enough. Would you like a circle of trees? There we go. I have a power coupling. I don't even remember what this power coupling was for anymore. I I, I don't see Teletubbies in your backlog, dude. All right, never mind. I don't have any Teletubbies games then. I really thought I had them. Now you know. They're coming now. You're gonna get like twelve of them. I don't think there are twelve of them. No, you're gonna get twelve of the same game. Oh, yeah. Just. I'll be the number. I can't move. What? <clears throat> oh, my controller died. Oh, oh, well, that's a problem. Um, it's four games. Uh, the battery is dead in my controller. You win! Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Man, these batteries do not want to last. I feel like I've been going through these stupid fast lately. What kind of controller is it that's using batteries? It's an Xbox One controller. Huh. So you use batteries in those things? Yeah. Yeah, uh, at Microsoft doesn't come with rechargeable battery packs. You buy those separately. In case, you know, so you can keep the controller cost down by comparison. Right, since, like, I guess, like, PlayStation, they got, like... The controllers that like charge, uh, but also those things die in like a few hours, anyways. Yeah. The, by comparison, the Xbox like battery packs hold their charge pretty well, actually. In fact, um, I'm gonna pause the shelf before it gets me in trouble. If I can remember what controller I have over here that has a battery pack, I'll just plug that in. Cause I don't think I've charged the battery pack in a while. But I've been playing like Xbox One stuff or Series X stuff, no problem. Which of course means now this will prove me wrong. The Teletubbies wiki has three games listed. Okay then. Why is there a Teletubbies wiki? Why is there? That what show's actually Why pretty big. There I can't be shocked by that. I mean, yeah. I'm not shocked. I'm just kind of like surprised. I guess I don't know. I guess I'm odd, like shock and awe. But I just took out the shock. Except, am I shocked? I mean, I'm shocked. I don't know what I am anymore. You were shocked that there was a thing. Oh, there's oh, also an Android game that would be the fourth one. It's Play with Teletubbies for PlayStation. Teletubbies Playground Pals. I can't tell who will what time. Talk about breaking and talk about wikis? I mean, I guess so, Mayo, yeah. Bibba Playground Game. Time for more Athena. Hooray. Hooray. One of my favorite things I think, like, I love, like, stupid articles in, like, a wiki, right? Like, the F-Zero wiki having an article for air. 
<laughs> it was pretty good. It's gone now, unfortunately. They're no fun. Yeah. Damn it. Oh, I thought it switched. <laughs> I did too, yeah. That was pretty abrupt. Me is what? Uh, me three. Come on, I need some gear again. I don't like the trees, like the hole in them, how it looks like an overly drawn mouth. These like things are grotesque. There we go. Dickery. That's how it gave me hearts. Nice, nice. I don't know how I did that. <laughs> I was gonna ask. Give me all my armor back. This game seems kind of neat. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> There are many ways in this game to get stuck in an unwinnable state. Mm. <laughs> Nick just lol, lamau. Yep, Nick would know. <laughs> what a fun and cool game. Could be worse. <laughs> I appreciate the Jar Jar is just like tumbling into the pit. He deserves it. That's a health extension, but not a health up. Oh, they're not a heal. Just keep spawning, don't they, huh? Ah, damn it, I didn't want the sword. I did want Shrek card, though. I'll stick with Shrek card. The sound effects are so much louder than the music in this game. They really are. Oh, that was the wall. <laughs> I'm just like, no, not again. <laughs> Honestly, ooh, can I get new chance just get stuck in the wall again? <laughs> so fuck the rest of the I'm courses. not doing it on purpose. <laughs> well, if we switch that to the goal, it's not going to happen again. The question is, can you do it? I, I swear this game's got like some weird ass turning. The turning is. I'm really sure it's bad. not good. But it's also got like the Mario Kart like boost sparking, but I you can't tell what level you're at for that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good. So you just kind of get like a ridiculous turbo boost without even trying. Yeah, you did it. Yes, I was the green one. Deadwood Dash. To the third one, I think. What even is the challenge for this one? Just to like beat this first like four set of courses. Okay. So you're getting there. Get some. Get some. Get some. Get some. There's so many like Shrek games like this, and they were just all bad. There's like one beat 'em up on like the GBA that's actually pretty good. I forget which one that was. Oh, uh, fuck! I forget the name of that one. It's the one where you had like Shrek and Donkey were your playable characters, and they had like special moves and shit. Mm hmm. What? Oh my god, that was a warp. I was gonna <laughs> say. It's hard to tell, but I will take your word on it that I definitely had. Yeah, I was looking at the uh, other racers. I know it was also like the bad, like, <laughs> what game you color. Gone? No idea. On a game switch is what we bonked on. Ow. Surfing on a leaf. Missed that I love somehow. the animations in this game. Wow. Yeah, I mean, the animations are genuinely not bad. And that's the one thing Virgin did really good, is they had their animation techniques were, like, really strong. Mm hmm but, Like, the games just always had just a, this weird amount of jank because of the animation priority. And just, like, a bit of unfairness to it. Yeah. Oh, there's the checkpoint. Nice. Yeah, because, like, the Genesis Aladdin was hand-drawn and digitized. I 
appreciate his banjo. How do I get to that? Health? It's pretty good. I think it's below, yeah. There you go. So much monkey screaming. I forgot how many like animal noises there are in this game. You know, aardvark sounds or anteater sounds rather. I think I can get that one up. Oh good checkpoint, I'll take that. Nice. Bird. Wizard hat gets me to the end of the stage, I think. <laughs> you know, Mowgli, known wizard. Yeah, I think it's supposed to represent like the the Fantasia hat, essentially. Yeah, that's the thing that's actually going for. I've actually never seen Fantasia. I haven't done same either. Like I've seen like a bit of the Night on Bald Mountain Bay, but that's about it. <laughs> Why does he have the test spin? Oh God! Oh. No. Lakitu that I cannot see. Who just throws bombs at me. At least it's not spinies. I mean, that's what they actually are. Blank Kingdom Hearts and actually watching the movies is a very different experience, James. There's a one-ups here. I don't think so. No. Only coins, dang. Uh, oh. Bananas? Oh, banana. Ooh, banana. I can't remember which pack this I can go down. There we go. Nice. I find it really annoying that each bunch of bananas is only one banana. <laughs> oh, can't get those now. Bummer. Oh, bummer, dude. Oh. Dude, it could be gaming. I could be gaming. Ah, fuck. Oh, oh what a jerk. Dude. Which color is better? I don't know. For like the sword or like... For everything. Like, most weapons come in like multiple colors. Yeah, because I know there was like a, like a yellow sword earlier. Yo, that dude has a maraca! Nice. Tom on Sanity Live! Duckass! Good hack! You know what? I could see Duckass helping a lot. There's a lot of things in my life that I think about duck ass, and it's like, yeah, that would have made this way easier. If only. If only that was an option. However, my life has a surprisingly low amount of duck ass in it. A non-zero amount, weirdly enough, but low enough that it is not helpful on a regular basis. Thanks to the Raidman, dude. General yelling for about three seconds like you're about to do a powerful attack. Think anime. Works. Damn it. Thank you for the raid, Tom. Hopefully the stream was good. 
Uh, based on the raid message, I'm going to stream his life hack bingo tonight. Tonight for us, we have been doing a cursed shuffler. I mean, a perfectly normal shuffler. Uh, my mods gave me 24, I almost said 26, 24 different games. Didn't tell me what was in it and just told me to play it on a shuffler so it changes randomly. And uh, they've all been choices. Generous. They've generous. Is what I would use. Generous choices. Yeah. Some are good. Most were uh, better. Showing showing you how much they like you as friends. Yeah, I now question thy friendship with a number of these people based on the games they've chosen for me. Really? You're no. welcome for the clarity. <laughs> Wait, just, just beat You're this welcome. guy for. I actually don't think I can. I, I think I literally cannot with this weapon. Really? Oh, gross. This dude looks like drunk Pac-Man. Except angry. He sucks. <laughs> <laughs> you were just saying this game looks cool. <laughs> <laughs> but having like unwinnable scenarios is not good. No, this game has a lot of unwinnable scenarios. It's actually kind of bad in that sense. What do you need for that tree? Then? Like a sword or like... Um, the yo-yo weapon helps the most, I believe. Okay. I there's, the also, there's also a warp in this stage that just lets you skip that boss fight completely. The fuck if I remember where that is. Apparently gold and yellow stuff is better than green stuff. Yeah, I should've known that was gonna happen. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> Did he just walk off the edge? I got hit up. He got hit off. Yeah, this game's got ridiculous knockback. If I could find any weapons to upgrade, this wouldn't be nearly as bad. The problem is, shit's expensive. Your starting weapon is weak and everything's very tanky. Mm-hmm. But the one good thing is if you can make it to those health extensions we've been picking up, those stay, like, permanently. And they, they respawn every time. Permanently, least, as in... one like, of them does. So when you say permanently, do you mean, like, permanently after, like, a death, or, like, just... Yeah, like, permanently after a death. Like, we just got a game over, and I still have 120. Like, oh! I where the other one was. I think it's down here somewhere. I'll get to 140. So, kind of an earlier roguelike, then, huh? Yeah, so, like, one strategy is literally just, like, get those and then just walk off a cliff, die. Continue. So now I have max 140. So you it, you still start with 100 HP, but your max goes up. Interesting. Right. Game's weird. No, the game yeah. is super weird. When you get gear, it's not nearly as bad, but the problem is, like, you can literally buy gear that's worse than what you currently have. Oh, gross. Yeah. Why? That, like, overwrites it? Yep. Oh. Uh, alright, what are we doing here? Let's see this in a bit. We're trying to get you out of here alive. You've got one hit point left. Fantastic. I love the jump animation. Damn it. I'm a dagger. So I'm gonna find a potion. Alright, let's almost put you in... Done. Here, uh, Mark, let's start go lighten these. I've only ever heard of Deadly Towers and Nightmare Frustration, I'm so sorry. Oh yeah, no, it, it's it's rough. I had to do it for a two-hour race, I think, for Cuso Grande once. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, it, uh, it was a thing. Did you win the race, at least? God, no. I, I was going against okay. the former champion. Oh, yeah, I can see why oh, that'd be Oh, I remember that race now, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, god damn it, that was a potion I needed. That was actually a heal. Ah. Oh. You haven't done Kuso in a hot minute, huh? No, I needed a break, because it was bringing out my my uh, competitive nature. It was pissing me off when I wasn't doing good. Yeah, that's fair. <clears throat> so I stepped away just to kind of cool down on it. Do you forgive earlier games for not knowing better, or are bad games still bad? Uh, little column A, little column B. A bad game is still a bad game, but sometimes the dev just didn't know better because there were no rules to gameplay. Like, you can forgive it, but that doesn't make it fun. Yeah. yeah. 
you know, I can find it yeah. here. Reminds me of my oh, favorite, like, time for Jason. Uh, to quote Shigeru Miyamoto, a delayed game is bad, a rush game is bad, all video games are bad. I fucking hate video games and making them. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to tell you, like, yeah, you know that quote's fake, and then like, oh no, you're doing the fake one. Okay. Yeah. And what a legend in the game industry. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love this Just came game. out and said it like it is. Alright, Debbie, let's go. So how does this game work? Is is Jason just like roaming around in random places, or does he just show up? Sometimes? There, there are two paths he can take. Oh, of course you got the fucking potion. Uh, there's two paths he can take, but they both lead back eventually to this game. Apparently, uh, they both <laughs> lead back to the lake in the middle where the kids mm -hmm. are. So you always have to keep okay. someone around the lake to make sure you can go stop Jason from murdering the small kids. Because if they all die, you just get a game over. But if all your kids right, okay. die, like all your like your playable characters die, you also get a game over. So basically, you have two two fail states. Okay. But he is actually roaming around. Yes. That's pretty cool for that time period. Yeah. It's a bad game you love. Uh, Dragon Ball Z saga. No, like, you can like love that. you can love a bad game, but it can still be a bad game. It's just you can forgive the issues with yeah. it. Yeah, I agree. I'm not, this this is not the previous discussion we've had before about like about like uh, like is something a rating thing like objective or subjective. This is a case of like actually this is a bad mechanic, but I can forgive it because of other things. So yeah, there are yeah. there are still actual <laughs> things that can be bad to make something a bad game, but you can still like a bad game. I have not been reading any of this text, by the way. I hope I do not need to know any of this. No, you don't. <laughs> You're fine. It's just all story. I guess the classic bad game that I like is Sonic 06. That game's hilarious. I Meganerd, give give me an example of a mechanic that is subjectively bad. Cause like I Cause like I, I get where you're going with that, but like if something like if a game has bad controls, like you're slippery for something like that, like I don't think that really counts, right? Like, okay, you know, okay. weapon durability would... is a much better example, actually, because some people absolutely despise that and think it's awful, but some people don't mind it or think it's okay. So, you know what? That's a good example of something that would be subjective. Mm -hmm. Something I would say is objectively bad is like a Ninja Gaiden. Whenever, like, you know, you die on, like, friggin' 4 1, you go back to 4 1. You die on 4 2, you go back to 4 2. You die on 4 3, like, on the boss, you go back all the way to the first one for some reason. Like, out of nowhere. Or whatever know. stage it is. is yeah, it, it's, is it it's, six? it's six. It's six. That's what it is. Yeah, for some reason, like, you know, you die on the stage you're on, you start back at the stage you're Damn on. It. If you get all the way that. to the boss and you die, you go back to the first stage in that zone. And it's like, it's why would you do that? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. And that's the thing right there, Mike, I'm seeing as well. Like, what's I kept using the rewind feature? People just didn't really have that option back in the day. You had to do it legit. And I still like Ninja Gaiden, but like, you know, that's that's just a little bit bullshit. <laughs> oh, look, it finally came oh, back. Hey! hey speaking, speaking of bullshit. Of bullshit. <laughs> ah, this game. Yay. How many stage levels are in this world, certain bullshit Mario? In, in this, like, four, but we're just doing one. Yeah, if, yeah it's still brave, you think you can still do one. Meds, why? What did I do? <laughs> this is Dragonfire. I, I was gonna say, I I think they were referring to Sonic at this point. Probably. Come on, I need to get a weapon for, for Debbie here. I need a weapon. Oh, because it's funny. Come on, come on. Honestly, this is probably like the best game in the shuffler. It's just the, it's just the, the circumstances are maybe not super hot. <laughs> yeah, it's just Sonic 2. Yeah. Crap. My favorite thing is you didn't uh 
you used the save state that I made, so you didn't see it, but like the game opens just normal and you just hit start and then it sends you into Metropolis Zone. You're like, oh. <laughs> mm. That's what UMZ stands for. Underwater Metropolis Zone. <laughs> Correct. Looks like Jason's here. And he's got a machete this time. Wow. Damn it, I hate when he does that. Sometimes he will just fake you out. A water marble for Sonic 1? Oh boy. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> oh she's no. She's super dead. So what's the objective of the game? Is it just keep killing Jason? Yes. Okay. But once you drain his health bar, Jason, they're like, Jason left for now, but he's going to come back even stronger. I think you have to defeat Jason like three times to actually beat the game. Gross. I believe that is correct, yes. Oh my god, those are holes. So okay. what's the point of walking around then? Just you, to have the, you have to power up your characters. Him? A, to find okay. him, and B, to power up your characters, yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Like, there's a, there's a, you can go in the forest if you know the layout, and you can find the head of Jason's mother, and she's guarding, I think, either a sweater or a pitchfork, which is, like, the best defense item and the best offense item in the game. Gotcha. <laughs> I love the idea. It's just, it's just his mother. She's just guarding his sweater. Yeah, I, I believe the actual strategy for the game is, like, you, you make one of the kids the absolute, like, powerhouse. Like, they, they get the best weapons, they get the sweater, so they're the one you get ready to fight Jason. And then everyone else, you kind of, like, you position someone to go save the kids when he runs for the kids in the lake. You position someone to, um, like, like track down Jason or try to get more power-ups for other characters, because you can get, like, torches, I think, are one of the items you can get. Right. So you, you basically just had to strategize, like, min-max your time and, like, make someone for fighting him specifically and everyone else. Oh, both. It depends on the day you go. Ah, okay. Oh my god, this is hurting my eyes. Yeah, this one's not great. Yeah. Like, as a colorblind person, this is hard to see anything. <laughs> people, are saying that, people are saying that Torch is the best weapon for the speed run. That makes sense, because the torch would be faster. The pitchfork yeah. does more damage, but I believe the torch just is quicker to throw. I hate this floor. Nice jump. Thank you. I'd like to catch up to the guy ahead of me. He's going pretty fast there. He's going very fast. I never noticed how fast Wait, where'd he the go? pumpkin's Why go? am I in first suddenly? Where'd, where'd he go? I think he fell off. Uh, did you knock him off? Oh, I fell asleep. Poison apple. Wow. Now I'm in fourth. Now I'm the page master. You are. Got your library oh, card. Got your library card. Oh, God damn it. There goes the power I needed. Having fun isn't going to be so hard without that. Finally. The fun starts now. Finally. John, are you having fun? Level complete. All right. Goodbye, I page now, master. I so can take this one out. Earth. 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 I'm glad the fun started yeah. like five hours into the stream. <laughs> <laughs> it seemed like a good time for it to start. That's Gollum. Holy shit. Yeah, Page Master on Genesis. There was a Super Nintendo one too, right? Yeah, I, uh, I grew so. up on the Super Nintendo version. I like that one more. I like how it looks like all these girls have like super thin, tiny legs, and then the the one on the side there, because of the dress or skirt they're wearing, just looks like they're the <laughs> biggest leg. <laughs> it's actually just blonde Chun Li. Harry complete, well done! All right, one more. Everyone keeps calling this Winx. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm not alone in it. Even the logo sort of looks like it, I think. I haven't seen the Winx logo and I can't tell you how long, but it, it's in my head what it, I think it looks like, it looks like that. 
my favorite thing about like this like let's like links here or uh which uh is like when me and camille were talking about like for her choice for this she was just dumping like witch lore on me <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty cool honestly Yeah, this is a kid's game? What the fuck's this layout? This fucking spike maze. Irma. Not back this here. is also a kid's game. Yeah, it's Star Wars. Touche. I still say it looks like Pokemon. Dude, the frame rate hurts. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say beat the first level, but honestly, at this point, just find that thing that fucking bridge man wants. I <laughs> think it's probably better to <laughs> We, we made progress on this before. Fuck if I remember how I did it, but we have made progress on this before when we streamed it. You know what? Hang on. Let me look up a guide here. Oh, wait. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, hang on. Oh, an oasis. Let's rob the people inside it. There's like a way to open these things, I thought. Or is this just a box that's supposed to move? I don't... Oh, this is a box that's supposed to move. Okay. Don't know how to do any of that. Don't remember anymore. Ugh. Ugh. Aw, the eel died. No. A could he? What, are you mad at him for dying? Sure. Let's go with that. Oops. Aww. From what I was seeing, we needed to go find a guy who was like standing in front of his house and we could talk to him. It looks like we can go inside the house. I guess that's where we get the thing to cross the bridge, man. Let me look more of this. There we go. Much better. Holder. Yes, that is a boulder. Congrats on identifying a boulder. It was a boulder that moved the second I got near it. All you need to do is punch it, right? I mean, Mowgli ain't exactly built like Chris Redfield. But what he was... <laughs> I mean, that's technically the, the live-action Jungle Book movie from, like, the 2000s, I remember. He was fucking was ripped. Was Mowgli jacked? <laughs> yeah, absolutely jacked. Hell yeah. What's that bonk that the rock does? They do that so you don't accidentally get stuck. Ah, uh, I guess that makes sense. It still looks weird, though. Oh, it absolutely okay. does, but yeah. So from what I'm seeing, we need to go find, like, a, a forest, right? Like, there's, like, a forest of trees. There's a forest everywhere right now. Well, uh, he means in Yoda it, stories. <laughs> yeah. <I know. laughs> in the desert, there's gonna be, like, a circle of trees, and you'll find that. And that'll let us talk to the ghost of uh, Obi-Wan. Oh, that's that thing that you found, like, really early on, I think. Yeah. What is the nine on the bottom? Oh, is that alternate that's, weapon? It's yeah. like grenades. Grenades, basically. Yeah, forest grenades. Yeah. Otherwise known as, Why like... does the forest have grenades? Just in case. Because of war. Know. In case of what? In case war. Of I mean, war. you see what is happening. War against who? The the tigers. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> I forgot about this one. So did I. So did we all. I forgot who picked oh, this one. Uh, this was Tomoyo's. Uh, got it, finally. Nice. Fucking finally. Alright, what's this one? We'll slow it to like five stages if you can do that. Thank you. We don't need a uh, sound to go into hardcore mode. Wait, wait. Like I, I, honestly, I only really expect this to be like just like a one night thing. I like to like continue this another I, time. Yeah, I'm not planning on continuing this list of games. I for my own sake. <laughs> yeah, please don't. <laughs> but Metropolis Zone. Bring that's my for, favorite we can bring game. that back for a race night if you want, if you want to just make other people <laughs> yeah. suffer. That I think would be funny. 
I mean, yeah, whatever. I already made the safe state, so why not? <laughs> we could do that. That's true. Now we're Jungle Book. I mean, Jungle Book I at least beat as a kid. So. Uh... Oh my god, why are none of those hits counting? Would you ever want to do another archipelago night? Maybe. If we're doing that, I need to get Cage 2 archipelago set up for that, because that's what I'm doing. Uh, because they got Link's Awakening DX. Is KH2, like, finally official? In the I know it was in beta yeah. for a while. Uh, oh. yes, it got released, uh, nice. yesterday. Oh, cool! Yeah. Love me some options. Yeah. I'm not gonna play it, but, uh, you know, I, I like the options. <laughs> the egg pack will, like, oh no, it's gain release. The, because tomorrow, the egg pack staff and mods have a... Uh, Archipelago Night. Yikes, that just took out a bunch of fuel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what you gotta be careful about. If you go to the to, to Verns to fuel up too much, you actually, like, lose... The, your paddles shrink in size. Oh, oh okay. I was but, wondering, because it was like... Can you, it seems like you could just go there whenever you want, so... There had to be some penalty. I mean, there's another penalty, too, but it, I, I'm, I'm wondering if I want a chance to make it appear. Ah, uh, yes, oh, that. Too late now. I never saw whenever you beat this game originally. I heard fault? legends, though. Mm, yeah, so that, that one might be for the best. What the fuck are we even doing for this one? Oh, I remember now, yeah. I changed it You're again. being the Lord of the Ring. We need to go kill a Scarecrow. That'll happen at some point. Why? Because he doesn't have a heart? Why is it? Brain! <laughs> Sorry, it's brain. Yeah, Frodo. See, so the one without the heart was, um... Wicked Lion. No, he was cowardly. He's... It's not that he didn't have a heart. I yeah, Tin right? Man wanted the heart. Yeah. Scarecrow wanted the heart. brain and... It's been far too long since I've seen... You can practice on this Scarecrow. It won't fight back. Here's a Scarecrow. Battle commences, an enemy takes turn! It's an RPG! <laughs> oh, I have no weapons? How do I... Um, I didn't... I didn't know... How, uh, how do I fight? Uh, oh no! Do not use the ring. Frodo, use the ring. Nothing Nothing bad will happen. Can we skip the turn? I can't fight because none of them have a weapon equipped! Hang on. There's your weapon. We'll gonna mess up again. What's that sample of Rill doing? Down there. How do I get to it? Uh, backwards long jump? No, I think I need to use the force, but I don't think Luke can do that yet. Use the force, Luke. I'm fucking trying! I'm trying over here! Yeah, I actually can't get in that way. <laughs> they fucking thought of that. Oh. I'm seeing you need to like find like a way to like buy a dagger elsewhere. I have to do what? You'll need to find like a way to like uh get like a dagger. Oh in the Hobbit. Yeah. Oh in the Hobbit, okay. I, I was like, I'm like Jesus, man. I don't know if you know this. He has a laser sword. I don't think he needs a dagger. <laughs> we're gonna end soon, John. Yeah, probably. I don't know how much longer we're gonna go here. My timer. Oh, my timer says 16 minutes. Should we just do the 16 minutes? I guess at this point, or should we cut it sooner? Than Up that? to you. Yeah, uh, it's your choice. At the end of the day, yeah. I assume I own yeah. I only have the power coupling. How's our block doing? I mean, we were caught up on our block when I cut back earlier. Those stormtroopers are pissed. Yeah, I can't move this boulder because they won't fucking stop standing in front of it. The 
I think I'm gonna see if I'm like finding this like oh never mind. I'm not gonna make it again. Nah, you can make it. Go, go, go. Oh no. You're good, you're good, you're good. Whoop. There you go. This one you might cut a little close. Oh, come on! I swear those are fucking homing. Slices. They, are, they are, a little bit. It's over. Oh, that was bad timing. That's over. Oh, no! Oh, wait, that counts! Nice, nice. Checkpoint! Gotta well, you check. found the top of the water, and then more water showed up. There definitely was more water. <laughs> I, I forgot that counts. I like how they give you like water a brief pocket. Right, let's get armored back up for Athena. Let's go. And I need an extendo weapon. Blue ring for the extendo weapon. Give me your hearts. There we go. Health extension. Lost my helmet. Health back. I'm poisoned, I think? Not sure what that means. But my health is blue now. And the game is beeping for some reason. It's angry. The game's always angry. Oh, I'm taking damage from these arrows. My shield is not actually blocking these. Yeah, yep. Dang. And that was a game over jingle, I'm pretty sure, too. Yep. You won! Hooray! Did you know the real challenge is actually over? Oh god! Back to this. Back. That didn't hurt you. I got really lucky on that. Yeah. <laughs> He's so excited when he kills people. It's like, yeah, I did it! He's so rad. He's such a rad murderer. The real cool radical Rex. Rad radical, radical Rex. Rex. I think I do have to go below, and that's what got us killed last time. Can I climb this? No. So what does, like, the sound wave thing do? Ah, goddammit. It's probably, it's probably some roar, but I just haven't actually, like, activated it. Well, I can't now because I don't have any any meter, any roar meter. I also realized I never showed you the problem. Chuck Rock intro, which is what this reminded me of. Oh, the Chuck Rock intro is pretty good. It is so good. All right, I can't kill him. Bold. That somehow worked though. We take those. God, what the fuck? <laughs> what happened to that guy? Dude, explode That's it! turtle thing! Finally a checkpoint. There we go. I really wish every time you passed a checkpoint it was just Radical Rex! Dude, that would be great, and I'm sad it doesn't Radical Rex do that. with like a little <laughs> guitar riff would be wee, wee. so sick. All the eggs. Oh, no. 
gonna die to this guy. There we go, just enough. Oh boy, move Rex. I can't, I have to fight that thing. Can I even fight this thing? Whatever, move on. Hell, thank goodness. All right, we're doing all right. Just gotta not land in the insta-kill spikes. Oh, crap. Well. Well, butter. Okay, so flipping those things from underneath will actually make them disappear. So, remind me of something here with Orb. Um, the whole thing has kind of like become this like meme of sorts for you. Which just cut to the game clearing stream from like many years ago, right? Yeah. Okay. Like that was it. Just dance adjusted it. It just you played it. It wasn't good. That's Dan, all. Dan said it was supposed to be like an easy game because he had done like a, a ton of progress on Kuso, and then uh, mm -hmm. it took like the majority of a six-hour stream. Uh, I see. Or something <laughs> like that. It took it took like four hours. I'm pretty sure, and a lot of that four hours was stuck on one stage in particular. Like, the second this... last stage. So, in a way, it's kind of like, uh, what was it? Like, the two-hour Bible game or whatever it was? That was supposed to be, like, five minutes? I forgot about that. Yeah, that's not a terrible comparison, honestly. Okay. That was a long time ago. <laughs> that was, I, I think, fucking, the same year. A fucking weird-ass memory, remembering, like, the most random shit sometimes. No, that had to have been earlier. They were both I like... when I lived in the townhouse, so they they would be close together. Orb was that long ago? Orb was that I mean... long ago, yeah. Let me, let me see if I can find the original Orb stream. Orb's, Orb's about... from one of our first game clearing stream, or first two game clearing years, rather. I thought Orb was like 2019, oh. dang. No, it absolutely wasn't. If it was, it was at the very, very beginning of 2019. I'm pretty sure it's 2018. I'm failing which, as the oh, lorekeeper. <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was 2018 because that would mean it's one of the VODs I don't have on Proton John livestream. It's on Scully's channel still. Probably, Linebeck yeah. said February 12th, 2018. Yeah, that's 2018. Right. Oh, all right. There's a Twice. light below you if you care. Uh, I'd rather just be done. I figured. Yeah, I don't blame you. Just finish like Act Two and you're good. I'd say. There's a checkpoint to your left. Oh, right, because it's not the end of the stage. Nope. Yeah. Act, act 3 takes forever. Just do Act 2 and you're good, that's a... John has to even play Orb at either Coliseum 1 or 2. Yeah, it was Colo 2, which was 2019. I remember that Colo. That was a great Colo. That was, that was Gaming Kahlo. Alphabet, I think, was the that segment. Yeah. I'd rather just be done as the most glowing review of Sonic Genesis. Yep. That tracks. Wow, that momentum really does carry. Holy shit. Yeah, it it's not normal. <laughs> You're good. That slide back though. Oof. Yeah. I'm surprised it gave you that ring back. I thought it was going to get stuck in the wall. I did too. Oh, okay. I'm a bit confused on that one. <laughs> I think the ring did get... Oh, no. Never mind. It also doesn't help that John doesn't like Sonic 1 to begin with. I wouldn't say I hate Sonic 1. It's just, like, if you're going to ask me to play a Sonic Genesis game, this would not be my first choice. Or my second. And if you count Sonic and Knuckles, or your third. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, look, we finally came back. Kion's game. Oh, oh hey! My God. Lives. It's on a five second timer and then leaves. Eh, at least it's not set to that. Right. 
You finished the stage. Wait, World 7 3? What yeah, happened? Yeah, now I'm in World 6 2. What is this game? It's a randomizer, Random. randomizer. Oh, yeah. that's what R stands for. I get yep. it now, I'm smart. Randomizes enemies and like the stages and stuff. Reminds me of uh, Super Mario Low. City. Lakitu is throwing me off. Yeah, dude. Yeah, I don't <laughs> Can like you it. jump on him? I, I don't want to kill him just because I think he's awesome. <laughs> there we go. Dude, that, that's me when I meet new people. <laughs> I'd rather not kill you, dude. I think you're too cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least he's a murderer. Like, nah, man, you're safe with me. Oh, I'm playing a little risky on that move. Getting rid of the extra hit. I got all the pipes everywhere. Oh, God. Oh, no. Ooh. Okay, you're good. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thread that needle! Thread Did that, that needle! Kill you? Okay. It's uh, really uh, thinking about this one. It's really thinking about this one. Uh. Alright, bad dudes! Is it because the enemies didn't die? I think it's because the enemies didn't die. We might have actually locked that one up. <laughs> Perfect. That's funny. Oh no, he's collapsed. Call him at the boss. Bring, just bring the boss. Let's just beat this guy and call it. Alright. <laughs> Walk into my fist! Back. Walk into my fist! I feel bad as Tamar was on the few actually gave me an actual, like, goal or objective. But also, like. It was sake. also just beat the game, wasn't it? It was also just four oh, minutes yeah. left to the stream, like the gameplay part mm -hmm. of the stream, so. Beat sewer ninjas. Unlike the surf ninjas. Which take place outside the sewers. Shit, 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 shit. Man, so you never actually got around to watching that, huh? What? Surf ninjas? No, I really want to, though. That's been like an elusive movie. From my childhood, I had Turtles 3, and uh, it had a advertisement for that. I was like, that movie looks sick, and I never got to watch it. You can play the Game like... Gear game. Yeah. I, I found out about that way later. I'm like, oh, dude, that's actually a ah, game. Ah, cool. goddammit. Yeah, it continues. Aw. Uh, oh, well, whatever. It's done. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> We're not getting back there. That's not a door. All right. Uh... The main place I saw is that it had you going like down and like to the right somewhere. So try like hitting like some like right spots maybe in the desert. I don't know what to go off of, but like try the right spots in the desert. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have Wayne's World, but then fuck up. It could have been Wayne's World. It could have been Wayne's World. We could have heard him say "swing" a bunch. You know what the worst part was? Yep. I was talking with Maya right before it appeared. Like, yo, let's actually try and change this. It's like, he's like, oh yeah, we should. And then it popped up. Like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. Locked in. Not to mention also like the whole changing systems we were kind of concerned with. Because at least we got away with like Dragon Power and like uh, Deadly Towers both being NES. Yeah. Check my down here, maybe. So where am I trying to get? Am I trying to get to the tree Could... circle? Yeah. No, you need to talk to the dude in front of the house or something first, right? Actually, wait, is Han Solo in there? What? Is, was like Han Solo in that like little like hut? You think? The bar or? No, I know. This is not Han Solo. There ain't no Han Solo in here. Dang. Alright, let's go find that grassy patch. I also saw, like, with the grassy patch, there was, like, some, like, blue stuff around it. So, like, that might be, like, a sort of hint of, like, what you might need to be, like, looking for. <gasps> there it is. Alright, so what do I do here? It's so green, you'd think there'd be water. Yeah. 
Neat. You did Thanks, it. Luke. <laughs> Jason. All right, that game's cleared. Hey, you did it. You found the grassy patch. I don't know. <laughs> <sighs> Look, man, the video had like a shovel or something, and like the fun part I'm realizing very quickly is like with these open games, it's harder to shuffler. I think this happened last time, too. Throw them rocks, Debbie. You can do it. I think overall with this night, like, this wasn't bad. I think some work could be put into it if we were to ever do this again. But I think this was not bad. I don't know. What do you think? I mean, I'm. if you're asking me do I want to suffer through more bad game shufflers, you know what my answer's going to be. I mean, <laughs> yes, but like, do you think this was still like a decent like idea? Yes, the actual shuffler itself was a decent idea. Okay, appreciate that. And there's time. Let's see what the next game would have been. So, the main takeaway from tonight is that we did beat uh, Killer Instinct. Killer Instinct, yes. Ask the egg pack next time will be nice. I don't believe you. The takeaway from the night is John has questionable friends. What do you mean, dude? We're just all feeling luppy. Hey, lucky, lucky. someone says we're gonna piss somebody off, I'm there. <laughs> Let me actually read the exact message to see, like, the exact, like, thing that made people make these choices. Yo, guys, on April 1st, I proposed the idea of a bad game shuffle to John for a stream idea, and he seemed okay with it, so I'm gonna ask if you guys can be one game that you seemed think Seemed okay. <laughs> 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 Didn't get a straight answer. <laughs> Apathy, John's best response. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you guys to give me one game that you think is utter trash, whether it's official or maybe even a ROM hack. Just have some fun with it. I'll ask for you to DM the game to me. We can make this make this work. I'll ask for GB, GBC, NES, and SNES, or Genesis for the sake of simplicity. Thanks again. I, I, I made sure we avoided the. I scaled back mine at the last second with the. Let's commit. <laughs> Uh, let's get court-martialed so we can avoid the bad part. Honestly, court-martialing was way funnier, so it worked out. <laughs> Cuba says, well, I would have made you play a Castlevania game. Yo, Castlevania the Adventure doesn't count, Cuba. It's not a Castlevania. I also made sure to leave that N64 because I was, like, way too, like, finicky after last time. I still can't believe I couldn't pause. <laughs> oh, no, I could pause. I couldn't skip the cutscene for some reason. Your start wasn't... Yeah, yeah, uh, that was so weird. Alright. That's gonna do it for the shuffler, then. We beat we Pomsky's game, Bubba's game, Allison's game, and Tenmar's game. Yeah, yeah. We got we pretty close... A checkpoint in mine. That was pretty cool. You got <laughs> pretty close... Yawns. It was, like, just one more stage. Shukers was almost done, too. Who else? Gex, you're on stage two. Tomoyo... <laughs> No. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I like the second one, Cupo. I find the second one, Bel or Belmont's Revenge, is pretty good. Draco, no. Mayo, we did beat Mayo's. We got the grassy patch. <laughs> we, we, I think that's a stretch of saying we beat that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Mayo deserves it after everything tonight. <laughs> after the game not showing up. To be fair, like it showed up a lot in the third half. It did. In the third. Third half? Third <laughs> In the third, third. The third, uh, the third part. They got us in the third half, not gonna lie. What's funny is, Mayo's game got way more screen time than Kion's, and Kion's was one of the first ones to show up, I think. <laughs> I think that's, that's right. True, actually. <laughs> It just took five years to get there. Yeah. All right. I think I owe a couple dukes. Dukey. So let's get the dukes on the go. Oh man, I wish I could have my own like uh, dukey meal. Just, just a little happy meal duke toy on the go. Jeez. Why would you want to call it a dukey meal? <laughs> Because it's gonna be shirt. 
That is Look. not good branding. <laughs> First we had the John P. meal, now we have the Dookie meal. Oh my god. Alright, I know I owe one to, um, to Ugi McTalk. What's the other ones? Did I miss anyone else earlier? Checking the queue. I don't think I got random player 818, so I think I owe two. Okay. Randoms. Oh yeah, it's ass kicking time. Not anymore, we're going to bed now. And oh. Oogies. Pancaked. And one for the road. <laughs> Jeremy, you invincible headshot scripted cheater. <laughs> You've seen that one. <laughs> that, one that, really that one doesn't come up that often, but it's been it hasn't been shown. Alright. Oh yeah, fun fact about mine. The save state I gave you had all the Chaos Emeralds too. Yep. Oh my god, so if I, I had 50 rings, I, I would've had it? Yeah, I god. knew you wouldn't figure it out though. God damn it. <laughs> it's not a case of not figuring it out, it's not a case- it's a case of fucking living long enough to get 50 rings. Exactly. Yeah. Well, I mean, even with Metropolis Zone keeping the rings too. Mm. Yeah. All, all like, little, like, Mantis dudes are kind of the problem there. Yeah. Emily Chan gifted a sub to Chill Days. Emily Chan sub for two months. Yo, Emily, hope you're doing good, girl. Inukun 7 for 74. Poke Dude 14 for 102. Picklotron XD for 31. Xander the Goose for 16. Inspector Rhino for 29. Shadow War says, I had a dream back on Thursday where I was watching a normal stream from you with Popski and Maniacal on Cocom, but you also had Selen from Niji Sanji as a Cocom as well, and you were talking with each other like you were good friends. I had to take a few minutes after waking up from that dream to correct myself from believing that stream had actually happened because it felt like a normal stream from you and I honestly thought it was real. Interesting. Someone's dreaming about me. Can't oh. say that's happened, sorry. Or did it? I wish I wish I could queue up that or am I from Duke. Alright, eggs wise, do we have anything in the carton for all the subs? No. Yeah, I'm just gonna play a Duke. You wanna dance? How good is this one? Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Draco, for doing that one for me. Yeah. Man, oh, have you great. just not seen a bunch of these, or what? No, I haven't been able to be around for a while. Fuck it, let me give you five and see what happens here. We'll see what ones come up. Maybe there'll be ones you haven't seen. Yeah. <laughs> no, not no, at the same we're time. We're, we'll space them out. We'll space them out. I'd have to go now. My play needs me. I love that one. <laughs> Ooh, shiny. I am home. Or am I? <laughs> there it is. Good. I love that one. <laughs> it's too quiet. <laughs> I was, wondering I was about to say that one was really quiet. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> the best one. <laughs> I love that one. One more for the road. How's this for a cunning stunt? All right, all right. Uh, what's going on in our block? All right. Usually, what happens there? No message on that one from AMZ John. So we'll start with this one here then. April Fools! Heh, <laughs> snurk. From Chloe Chloe. Val, what do you mean uh, you get a human transformation drink in the first place? Or where do you even get a human transformation drink in the first place? Petey, I mean, hey, you at least look like more like an actual Alt John now. Val, oh, screw you, I'm gonna go fly home now. Juno, how? Val, god damn it. I want to make a silly April Fool's doodle for Val before the day ended. I'll space your color scheme on one of Philip's color palettes from John of Versus. In any case, hope you all enjoy. Cute. Thank you, Chloe. 
Glad to see your alts are fucking around. Have a good time. Next up, this delightful piece from Love. After a longish art block, I finally got back into the rhythm, and wow, it feels good after conquering that block. Really, I just wanted to draw Rosa John with some pancakes. Delight! I like the little, the the whole made outfit, the apron, the skirt, and everything. Super nice combination with everything here. And of course, the pancakes themselves. Very nice, thank you, love. I'll jump ahead here, because that one I left over is the draw pile. From Corel Leo, hey, it's been a while since I uploaded something here, and it might be the last for a while. Classes start again on Monday, and I'll be taking more practical art classes. I have those classes to thank for me getting lots better at oil painting and drawing. Hope ha have some swimsuit, Rosa. I use Mika's picture's reference, minus the hoodie, because I'm afraid of no reference drapery. Hope you like it. Very nicely done. Heck yeah, thank you, Leo. And enjoy those classes. And the last one I got here is the draw pile for this week. Oh my god, we're just starting cursed right out of the gate. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. From Udiptez, draw pile 154, the futon pile. The egg pack wanted to show their support for the mod, so we followed through on John's promise for the long-awaited futons and futon accessories. You're free, John, at least until you hire another mod. Princess Skylar, Dewan Guy, Private Butter, Gishmant, Alex Nerd, Clo Chloe, Blonde Lombax, Fene, Nasu Blue, Dragon Tamer, Noir, Gabri, Sylveon Moon, Ink Stains, and Cupo. Dragon Tamer says, Jiggy Gift Pillow. Private Butter, made a Bowser pillow to go with Cole's futon. Lombax, Futon Rosa, Alex Nerd, Bagel gets his own futon all to himself. Chloe, making sure GF gets a futon to rest on after working hard during mod work in the egg pack. Enjoy. Nasu, I made a promise for that that for this week's draw pile I would draw a busty woman. However, no one told me how to draw said busty woman. Gespent but small, decided to be predictable and make a mech out of futons. Dewan guy, Wesker egg futon, better than sleeping on real eggshells. Noir, uh, Rosa Nigel Daki. Skylar, Gremlin needs nap after being chaotic. Even cult, I mean army leaders need some Z's. Gabri, since it would be right up Rosa's alley, I decided to draw a pancake futon. Fene, today slash yesterday is the best April Fool's joke birthday. Kanze Teto, who's sharing a baguette pillow with Kermit. Ink stains, behold, plushy worm coming in at six feet. It's basically a body pillow. The knife attaches to the front via Velcro. And the toque is a secret pocket good for cool rocks, other plushies, and incriminating evidence. Sailor Sylveon, I'm a sleepy dragon, so I go find a futon and I go to Mimi or oh, and Rosa's here. I guess she wouldn't mind if I uh, she wouldn't mind if I slept here as well. And Cupo, presenting to the mods your futon. You can now enjoy the comforts of a nice, comfy sitting spot or even a bed. Now with bonus Hans Mom pillow. Yeah, I I had a feeling this was your handiwork. I just I just knew in my heart of hearts. There's the sleepy. There's the sleepy. There's the worm with the knife. There's Chaos Incarnate. Do they know? Do they know? Rosa Nigel body pillow. There's the pancake body pillow. There's the egg futon. There's, okay, the sandwich one's actually pretty good. <laughs> Although it does look like Kermit is screaming because the sandwich has been bitten into. The futon mech. The nap. The bagel nap. The, the Coliseum shirt. The give pillow with the jiggy. And Rosa in a little sleepy, sleepy sleeping bag. Thank you everybody for doing these. These tend to happen on the Saturdays. If you want to join in on these, exclamation art discord gets you access to the art discord. You don't need to be following here or subbed or anything like that. Uh, and you don't need to be a visual artist as well. There's writing and music and a bunch of other stuff over there as far as I'm aware of. Uh, plus, we also do emote of the month contest over there currently. I forgot to add the winner for this month. Oops, I'll make sure that's ready for Monday. Other than that, if you got a sub tonight, you have access to the sub Discord as well by linking your Twitch to your Discord. You can hang out there and chat with other people from the community. You can also join our servers for Pokemon Unite, Pokemon Showdown, Rocket League, and Splatoon 3. Exhibition League, I think, brings up all four of those. Is that what we could sh uh, shrunk that one down to now? Is League for all four? It is. Okay, yeah, there we go. Perfect. I think that just gives us all the different commands. All right. Refresh check. Yep, we're done, though, folks. Schedule for the week. Monday is going to be a whatever day with a sponsored segment with Dare Drop for an hour. Uh, Tuesday is disc only. And that's at the usual 7 p.m. Mountain Time, 9 p.m. Eastern. Wednesday is Cookie Jar because we're overdue for that. And Saturday is Fortune Cookie, but 
I hesitate, because I never remember to look at my damn phone. I like how everyone's posting the March emote of the month. Uh, so yeah, so for those who are wondering, like, yeah, so the way we're gonna do is we're gonna get five, we'll ha we'll keep the other ones there temporarily, add in the next one, and then when we have five of them added, then we do a poll, and whichever one wins stays permanently, so. And then we run another five, and continue from there. While I'm looking at my schedule to make sure I, I did not forget anything, uh, what's our raid message? Oh, okay, so I, ha I have therapy this week, and I have a uh, double podcast on Tuesday. That's why I was trying to remember. Okay. No big... Aura. What? Oh. However did uh, Chikade uh, pronounce... Uh, oh, Buru. Uh, uh, Baru. Baru. Let's see, we got third half, perfectly normal raid. Where am I or am I? Deleted the old Dan. Questionable friends. There's a bunch of good ones tonight. For a moment, I thought therapy was a stream. Look, I like you guys, but I'm, I'm, I'm not at that level. <laughs> I'm not at that level. <laughs> Here's all my deepest, darkest secrets. Stream to a thousand plus people on the internet. Let us collectively trauma dump together. We're a good influence according to her, but not that good of an influence. <laughs> <laughs> there are limitations. Of course, yes. I don't know about you, man, but like, I'm still fucking dying and you getting stuck in the fucking like hole. <laughs> <laughs> Is Tyler doing a Mario Sunshine versus right now? We are the reason John needs therapy. Yeah. I mean. I'm not gonna no. just like refute that. <laughs> wow. What do you mean, wow? <laughs> not just saying wow. That's all. S says the guy who organized this 26 game shuffler I did tonight. 24, actually, get it right. <laughs> I don't know why I keep thinking it's 26. I don't know why. Rolls off the tongue better. We're all the reason. Yeah, we're also the reason he can afford therapy. I think, also correct. So you know, it's it, give and take, it's as they say. It, it's a symbiotic relationship. Symbiotic therapy relationship. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Let's go with Tyler because they're they are actually doing a Mario Sunshine versus right now. Requirements. First to beat Mario Sunshine with 80 shine sprites. Crowd control is turned on and affects both players. Jesus. And they've been going for, it looks like, seven hours. Well, let's go make it worse, I guess. <laughs> this, uh, I like a totally normal raid. Let's do that. Oh, not not male. Trevin F and attacking two cans. I can't tell how many shines Tyler no! has currently. How did I slide off just there? Ah, uh, there's the honk. Love that honk. honk. I keep hitting sunshine. Just doesn't show you how many shines you have unless you're like in the overworld or paused. I'm actually not as drunk as oh, I was right. anymore. So like, oh, well, 79. I'm more sober. Whoa! Oh, got more. Oh, oh right. Oh, unless he stands <laughs> perfectly still. So there you good. go. <laughs> This is not good. What isn't? We're getting a raid. Why is it yellow We're water? Pineapple raid. juice. I'm trying to get my last shine sprite with crowd control. All right, go fuck with Tyler. You know no, how it'd be. And we'll see you guys Monday for I the next stream. I'm alive longer now. I good night, everybody. This, good night. Night. this raid night. See you next time. Don't let the cubby, tubby custard machine bite. Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, I gotta get you a Teletubbies game. 
I don't know Isn't why. Isn't that I your lifelong it. goal? Absolutely no, has really, to happen. Yeah. I have many I other goals. I thought you were going to say, I need, I need to get you a tubby custard machine. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, actually. It, it, it's basically ice cream. cream, right? Is that is that what it's supposed to be? Oh, it's a cookie maker, I think. It's a cookie ma oh, so it's cookie dough. Or maybe. I don't know, actually. Hang on. Like, why don't you eat any type go, of tubby Go to the mission? Teletubbies wiki. They'll know. They always know. No matches found on eBay. This is bullshit. <laughs> well, you're looking at eBay Canada or eBay UK? eBay US. <laughs> ah, okay. Night, everybody. Hey. All right, everybody. Of course. How's it going? Sorry, I'm a bit late. Uh, my computer exploded again. So you know.